Not. Not. Hello. <clears throat> I'm just choking on my coffee casually, <laughs> waiting for the end. No, no. <clears throat> oh my god. <laughs> I swallowed. I swallowed my coffee wrong. <laughs> Hello. How are we doing? Uh, I don't know. I'm sorry, Jenna, that it doesn't like it. So it doesn't let you like. Um. Yeah, it doesn't let you, like, push through the notification. That's weird, because I've seen that not. before where, like, you're able to choose to show it or not. I don't know why. It... That's weird. But thank you for the, the resubscribe, though. That's very kind. But hello, everyone. Not. <laughs> Jesus, I am girthy. Nine inches wide. That's a big one. <laughs> That's a big one. Hi, Gabby. And hello, Pingu. And Jackson. And Dine Alone. And Rosanna. And Robin. And, and, and. I said hi, Jenna. Who else I see? I saw Pear. And who else popped in? Uh, Allie popped in. Hello. Not. Hello, hello. How are we doing? I'm going to turn the music down a little bit more. Seven by seven. <laughs> a square. A square nut. Okay. Not. A square one. 17 by four. That's a pretty, that's long. Squat. <laughs> a squat. Wait. A squat. That's good. <laughs> It's a squat. <laughs> you got a squat. <laughs> you ain't got a nut, you got a squat. <laughs> That's funny. <clears throat> oh, I got mine off the Sims nut source. <laughs> Wait, that's a funny one. I haven't seen that one yet. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> that's a good one. They, they, it seems like the bot's giving us some unique quotes today. Giving us some good quotes. <laughs> Five bolts, okay. Your, your psychic advisor called. They said nut violence as opposed to regular non-nut violence. <laughs> there was a long one. I, I did it and I got a big long one, which I remember 
But it's all right. I'm gonna take a med and then nap before I turn into a nut as smooth as my nut. I will nut that diploma nut. and nut you a word. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, that was a long one. <laughs> was it out here nighting people with their nut? Oh no! <laughs> Fascinating concept. Fascinating concept. Oh my god! I was like, it's it's so weird when like you have time. Whenever you, like, have more than enough time to, like, get ready to do something, you always end up, like, somehow still being, like, up to the last second before you're, you're like, ready. Like, if you have don't have to, like, do anything before work, somehow you end up late a minute. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like, it's like you're just like, okay, I'll just screw around. I didn't have to do some things today that I normally have to do. I was just kind of doing stuff, and then I was like, oops. I gotta eat lunch and, and go live. <laughs> so I was like up until the last second loading up the game and, and getting going here. <laughs> so I'm like, I'm like, I like rushed to sit down and get stuff started here. Um, but yeah, I hope y'all are having a good, good beginning of your week. Um, I always use alarm not to be late. I hate being late to like real, real things. You know what I mean? <clears throat> I'm bad. I'm like very particular about like, being way too early about with things most of the time. You buying food before work and walking in five minutes late, like uh yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> it's funny. Um <clears throat> but yeah, so we're gonna play some strange view today. Uh we haven't touched strange view in a minute. It feels weird. I feel like we haven't been uh focusing on it very much, which is understandably so because Calicundia is very much like I feel like Calicundia is very like the main character of my streaming like i know strange view early strange view is like fun and like a good time but calicundia is like kind of the main character a little bit you know what i mean in my opinion um but yeah we're gonna be checking out strange view some more early strange view we um last time we left we last time we played it we played we finished playing john burb john and jenny burb's household and all the drama with that um and then we at the end of that stream we jumped over to the broke household and so we're still playing them we haven't finished them yet it's right now and i'm looking at the game on my other screen it's monday at 10 a.m so we're kind of still doing them yeah they killed tiff with the woohoo yes yeah that one yep and then we jumped over here to um the brokes <clears throat> Skip broke and Brandy broke and Dustin and then Brandy was pregnant and she gave birth to a little boy we named Bo. Um, so yeah, we'll see what happens there. We were having some interesting things going on. I think we were we had a party, we had some kind of party. Um, and I think we were hoping somebody would drown in the pool, but it didn't happen. <laughs> you know, normal stuff, just normal stuff. Um, but yeah, so I'm excited to jump into that in a sec here. I don't remember if there's anything else I needed to say, though. I've been, it's been chaos the last couple days, so I'm just like, it's been chaos the last, like, couple weeks, honestly. In IRL world. Casual attempted murder. Casual attempted murder, of course. As as is the w right way to play The Sims, of course. As as is, you know. <clears throat> but, IRL world sucks. I like Sim world. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Let's escape to SimWorld instead. Escape to SimWorld instead. Yeah, I have to... I've got to um, do some stuff this week so I can't stream on Thursday. And um, it's going to be... I decided just to go ahead, instead of like choosing another day to stream, just to say, that's okay, We're just. I'm just going to use those that extra time to focus on getting YouTube stuff done. So I'm still like trying to get into the groove of like putting out an, a YouTube episode every week too, which like, it isn't that hard, but it's just a matter of like figuring out the rhythm of when to record, when to edit stuff like that. And I've been wicked behind on shorts and TikToks, but it's not a big deal. Anyway, we'll jump over to the video game. I'm going to pause the musics. Do this, do that. I push all my buttons. Make sure it's showing up right. Yep, looks like it is. Oh, Paralive's gameplay stream reveal on the 7th. Interesting. I didn't know that. 
So tomorrow, right? February 7th, so tomorrow. Interesting. I'll be intrigued. Like on, do you think, I don't know, what are they, What are, do you know if they're, pl it's like on their YouTube or are they doing it like on Twitch or something? Where's like the, the stream? I'm just stupid, don't remember the day. Okay, <laughs> no, it's okay. <laughs> it's on their YouTube. Okay, interesting. That could be kind of cool to, to, to check out. We'll have to see. I can make the people who annoy me and make their lives miserable so I don't yell or worse IRL. <laughs> Just good for my soul. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I didn't have to play nice today. My daughter had an unexpected doctor's appointment. Had to wake her up just after she oh, she got to sleep. Oh no. Oh no. Posted a link in the other game. She, oh, okay, cool. Hi, Lear. I just asked my internet law professor about CC creators' terms of use and whether those are legally enforceable. Fun fact, they're not. Interesting. Huh. So, like, is it... Is that... What's that, like, based on... Like, it's based... Their, their opinion about that was based on, like... Or the information about that was based on the fact that they're just, like, using stuff from another game, so it's, like, not their property or something. Unless it's your own website and not Tumblr. Okay. So it has, like, so I was just wondering, like, what does that hinge on? So it hinges on, like, where they've got it or something? That's weird. Hi, Danny. I finally got home from school. Welcome. Welcome. We're just jumping in here. Piss, I don't have my face copied anymore. Ignore the link. <laughs> oh, the eyes. I was like, what? <laughs> YouTube link. <laughs> I'm gonna steal all their things. Link to YouTube video. <laughs> Just okay, Crystal <so> Beth. <laughs> okay, because on Tumblr has their own terms of use and would have to allow individual bloggers. Oh, okay. Interesting. Huh. Okay. I always think there there are times where like Sims. Who are you, Skylar? There's a little doggy named Skylar here. Um. So yeah, here we are back in the broke household. Um, 10 a.m. I think you're supposed to be at school, aren't you? It might we might have missed your. Why don't you walk to school, kid? Mr. Dustin's gonna walk to school. Where are, where are you? Okay, taking care of little baby Bo. Our little Bo got black hair, which is fun. Which is fun. Oh my God, a 45 stream streak! Holy crap, Bola! Crystal Beth is robbing Paralyzed HQ. 911. Hello. <laughs> Oh, I know, that's true. <laughs> that's the link. <laughs> that's funny. But he asked me to send him an example to look at, and I'm going to do that in a minute. Okay. Interesting. I just watched the most recent Calicundia stream, and there was a high school musical machine at the head that was feral about their video and CC being stolen. So I just thought, yes, that's true. That one was funny. That was so funny. I love it when they're, like, so... It's mine. Copyright. Like, you can't just say copyright. <laughs> You can't just say copyright. <laughs> that one's funny. And then there's like, um, ugh, you're hungry. Why are you bothering this baby? Can you please just have a, have some some food, dude? Um, are you gonna put the baby away, or what are you gonna do? Okay. Okay. Brandy's actually cleaning for once. You gotta actually re can somebody repair this? Do you have mechanical? He's got one mechanical point. Kind of pointless for her to just clean that like that. Uh oh, the bed's goofing. The bed they got reset. The bed's goofing. When do you? She doesn't have to work today. He wants to be friends with Dustin Langerak. Maybe we should call him. But I always think it's funny, like, because like one of my things I like to do is to download sim like sims 3 sims to have them available for when i'm making a sims 3 sim i can use them as like a base to, to create who i who i want <clears throat> and they there's so many times where i find like sims to download where they'll be like terms of use don't change this sims appearance and it's like <laughs> thank you kaylee <laughs> Hello. Thank you very much, Kaylee. <laughs> Hello. 
I like how that he knew not to say the the little wave emote. Interesting. But thank you, thank you. <laughs> appreciate appreciate the resub. <laughs> Came in with a bang. Exactly. Yeah, like it's weird. Tell me why she's thinking about having a baby when she can barely afford the one she has. Yeah. <laughs> Brandy broke for you. It's interesting she's obsessed with being friends with this other Dustin. Wait, you know, people talked about before, like, how in this, because they have the Langerak family, which the Langerak family kind of, um, is more so a thing in The Sims 3. They, they appear in Sunset Valley, not in, like, original Pleasant View. But, like, Kaylin Langerak obviously does. And, like, it's weird that there's two Dustins now because they brought them into the same hood. There's our Dustin here, and then there's Dustin Langerak, which I believe is is Kaylin Langerak's dad. I don't know what Skip's doing. Skip's going through something right now. He just He's obsessed with the baby. Maybe he's going through some kind of weird, like, new father thing. He's, like, afraid the baby's gonna die if he doesn't touch it for five seconds. I don't know. But, like... What if what if Brandy secretly has an obsession with Dustin Langerak and that's why she wanted to name her kid Dustin? Because like she's right now she wants to be friends with him. And she hung up. Okay. Thanks. Um you wanna dispose of that for me. <laughs> he had a terrible nightmare that he died, so now he must hold his baby, yes. <laughs> yes. But yeah, it's it's strange. It's it's like there are weird times where people, um, people post, like, terms of use, and I'm just like, what? I guess you can come answer the phone. Also, I missed some messages when I was running my mouth. You can't just say copyright giving. I declare bankruptcy from the office. Oh, he's answering. Is uh, Mortimer calling for Brandy? Yeah, sure. I asked my art law professor about custom content as well. He said that because the game is owned by EA, there is no way for in-game stuff to be copyright. Interesting. I just saw a screenshot of some someone anon asking somebody if they can trigger warning lesbians. And the person said no, but I can hit you with my car and that's a vibe. Oh my gosh. That's also a big thing that happens on like Tumblr is people are like real obsessed with trying to... What's, why? Why? I can't click this. People are real obsessed with like trying to tell other people what they're allowed to do with like what they're allowed to tag things or who's allowed to interact. And it's like, if if the person doesn't care, they're not going to listen to you and you can't do anything about it. <laughs> Hi, Comey. <laughs> the terms of use convo reminds me of that huge Sims 4 paid CC drama. Yeah, <clears throat> I wonder about, a lot about the legality around that. There's a lot of people who just went and uploaded paid CC to the Internet. It got so bad that some creators began putting it in trackers in their mods. I think I remember that. Like, <clears throat> like the gatekeeping. Yeah, it's like more so like, do not interact if you are this. And there's like a list of things. And it's like, you have no control over who interacts with that. Like, you can block them if you want. <laughs> but that's that's all you got. You know. We also have to include the TOU in every post, yeah. Just pinning on top of your feet isn't... Yeah, I know. Nobody's gonna look and see. But that's the thing that happens a lot. And it's just like... I don't know. People get a little weird about stuff. Like, I understand to a certain degree, but... It's like... Yeah, I don't know. Like, I'll be, like for me on Tumblr, I'm in a very, like, large cir circle of, of the, like, the, the lesbian side of Tumblr. And there's a lot of people that, on, like, every single one of their posts, it's just like men do not interact <laughs> it's like men don't care they're gonna interact and you can just block them it's not the end of the world like <laughs> i love that they try to copyright their cc when most of it is stolen from second life Ooh, the drama you know what's trippy so like there's this um i need somebody to fix this thing or wait is it not broken anymore yeah it's broke it's broken I need him to come try. He's touching Bo again. Oh. Sir, put the baby away. Let the baby sleep. So, <clears throat> there's this... I've mentioned before that I like watching some of the streamers that I watch do, like, RP stuff. Also, I forgot I have a mod that makes it so when it's broken, they can't clean anyway. They can't, like, clean themselves with it anyway, so... Sir? Oh my god. Why are the Sims, like, so 
unable to care for themselves. How about we hire somebody? Everybody's obsessed with the baby. Um, and so anyway, I watch a lot of these like roleplay streamers. And I used to watch a lot of them do like Red Dead Redemption roleplay. But then there's like this newer, like updated GTA roleplay server that opened. It's like no pixel 4.0 or 3.0, whatever. And <clears throat> they have like a bunch of custom hairs and stuff that have been added in. And like sometimes I watch them go in and like set up their character. They're like changing their character's hair and the hairs that they go through, like there's a whole section of their hairs in that server that are all like hairs that I've had in the Sims three. Like they're like custom content hairs that I've a hundred percent seen in the Sims three. And like, there's some characters that I'll see like that are like running around in the world, watching it and stuff, like that are like wearing Sims three hair, like Sims three CC hair, like the alpha hair. And I'm like, wait a minute, this feels weird. <laughs> this is like, you're just using, like they just use the same meshes and threw it into the other, this game. <laughs> it like feels weird. Um, repairman. I interpret terms of use as an etiquette thing rather than a legal threat. True. I just don't want to piss off those. Yeah, I think that's kind of, I that's same. Like, I just like, okay, I guess so. But it's also like, like when it comes to like me playing The Sims 3 on my own and like I'd say I download a sim that supposedly wasn't supposed to be edited because it was their OC. I'm like, I'm not going to post it anywhere. It's my personal, just my personal gameplay. Like I'm just going to edit the sim whatever I want. Plus half the sims I've, all these sims I've had in my game for like 10 years anyway. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like I don't remember where I got it from or the rules about using them. <laughs> That's one thing about the Sims community. It's far less obnoxious than the Sims 4 community. Yeah, that's true, I think. It, almost every Sim, Sims 2 TOU is just do what you want. Yeah, I know. I think, and I think if you ask people, they're like, they're like, yeah, I don't care. Go for it. Share what you want. Who did he bring home? I'm playing with, I'm, I'm sitting here fidgeting with a, with a friggin' tape measure. What is this? Okay. Who are you? Orlando. Hello, Orlando. Hey, Orlando, you have a bald spot. Orlando has a bald spot? Question mark. Orlando? I still haven't done the thing that's supposed to fix, like, the townie names. <laughs> yeah, no, Orlando wants a hug. <laughs> Dustin just brought out his boat and says, hey, you want to see my boat? <laughs> Is it my boat? I'll be honest, I also steal from Second Life, but I'm not uploading it behind a paywall. In fact, I don't share it anywhere because it's not mine to share. True. <laughs> Skyrim mods have a lot of hair. Okay, you recognize from The Sims. If someone converts from another game, share it for free and says, Hey, this is converted from X game. That's what, yeah, I think so. But SL is like the threat because legal issues. Yeah, I think Second Life is like a very strange uh, environment as well. Almost like the, this, the, um, the Sims 4 situation. That spot is where the Mary Jane plant grows on on, on Orlando Sentowski's head. <laughs> that spot? You you think that this child's are you talking about the spot on this child's head? Is where marijuana grows? Yes. Oh <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I've seen far more Sims for kids lately converting C Sims 4 CC from creators that are notorious for not allowing it. Like, people simply do not care, which, yeah, I think that's fine. I think it's great. <laughs> I'm not even going to try to read that butt spot message. So many bing bongs. So many bing bongs. Poor kid's going to be bald by high school. Orlando gets nuggies. I mean, nuggies? <laughs> nuggies? <laughs> nuggies or nuggies? I guess they're, is that spelled the same way? Well, I guess it's an O. Fun fact, the weed you can only smoke the female plants. The <laughs> women stay winning. That's funny. Okay. Here, play with your friend. Get up, Dustin. Play with your friend. We're kind of just sitting here watching The Sims exist. I'm not even like... Okay, so you're... Okay, so somebody fixed our damn thing so she can take a shower. I feel like the, the parents are just kind of struggling to exist. We still got to be friends with Dustin. The other Dustin, Mr. Langrack. I'm gonna have her serve dinner, I guess. 
Throw some sketty. No, you're okay. <laughs> you're okay. No, not butt's butt. <laughs> Sorry, my bing bonglish. Wait, that sounds fun. Let's all do we we, we should all speak bing bonglish. Men do not interact with this post. <laughs> it's okay, you just made me hungry. <laughs> yeah. Want some nuggies now? We run the world or you run the bing bong. <laughs> We run the bing bong. I think lately I need to touch some grass, but I have no idea who I can turn to tragically. Oh no. Please bear with me, guys. You're okay. Dude, you get. Oh. Do y'all see what. Look at this little gremlin. He's waiting to zap. He's trying. Do you know he's trying to do the zap? <laughs> He stopped. Damn it. I'm th sometimes I just stand there forever. <laughs> if you don't know what that is, that's little ki kids that are mischievous will, they'll scrape their feet on the carpet to make, make them like electrified, you know, like the static electricity, and then they'll stand there and try to zap somebody. <laughs> and Orlando was busy, so he couldn't zap <laughs> Orlando. <laughs> that's how Orlando got a bald spot. He got zapped. Oh no. Look at him. Should I change his hair? Should I let him have a bald spot? Orlando's like, this is the best. You know, I think Orlando might be in. Orlando might be. I don't know if he's a townie or if he's in the orphanage. Cause I got, I threw a couple of the kids in the orphanage. Oh, he's leaving. I don't remember where Orlando lives. Okay, I'm gonna delete this. F oh God, that was a quick zoom. I know the stress, the stress. I'm gonna shift, force error delete. There you go, because I think that bowl was bugged. Also, our bed's bugged, but I don't really have a good way to to fix it until somebody just sleeps in it. Okay, you need to eat this. Just get up and eat. What are you gonna do, sir? Why don't you grab a plate? Brandy is like, I'm going to do macro clean for Brandy just to keep her busy. And so the other thing is, Mr. Skip doesn't have a job. He wants to become Hall of Famer. That's right. He had like a thing with swimming. He's, a, he's supposed to be like a professional. He wants to be a professional swimmer or something. So we're trying to find the athletic job. Why is Mortimer here? Earlier, Mortimer tried to call Brandy. And we should say hi to him. We have bolts with Mortimer. Yeah, he's a professional swimmer. He wa or he wants to be a professional swimmer. It's funny because a lot of people down the line will pair, like in regular Pleasant View, they'll pair Brandy and Mortimer. That's like a thing that happens sometimes for folks. Thank you for the lurk, Gabby. I'm gonna try and drink my coffee without choking. I've decreased my daily Diet Coke consumption a lot, so I don't want to hear your judgment. <laughs> uh, wait, I missed it. I'm so effing pissed. Frickin' pissed. I bought a 12 pack of Diet Coke from the gas station. It tasted so funny, I checked it. Oh no! You should, you should tell them and then make them give you like a gift card or something to the place. I had a family member do that. They got like, they bought, they bought some, they bought some, uh, here, I'm gonna do macro, like, friendly. They bought some kind of juice from the local Walmart, and it was, like, very expired, and it made their kid sick. And they went and said that they were gonna, you know, like, sue Walmart if they didn't give them, like, a $300 gift card, and they got, like, a $300 gift card from Walmart for, like, a cheap bottle of juice <laughs> that made their kid sick. <laughs> This was a gas station near my parents, five hours away. Oh. Oof. Oof. There we go. Look at, he's doing it again! He did it again! <laughs> Look at him! Who's he going to zap? I want to see him zap somebody. Stop. Put it down. I, I need this. I need this. Skip, I need this, please. Here it goes. Here we go. I love it. I love this. This is so stupid. 
<laughs> he thought that was funny. Why did it play? Oh my god. I didn't see the pop up yet. I was like, what's the music playing? <laughs> Thank you so much, Trish. I think it's Trish. <laughs> I love that interaction. That's so funny. But the fact that he, the dad laughed because he's like, yeah, that's my boy. <laughs> that's my boy. <laughs> but thank you so much for the prime. I appreciate it. <laughs> that was great. His little face. I love little gremlin Dustin. Now, is that you think that's because he's like not very nice or is it because he's playful or a mixture of the two? He's mischievous. What are you? Why are you sitting in here, bud? He's just been living in his underwear all day. Also, like Skip has not gotten dressed once. Not once. Also, I need you to like find look at, look for a job. Find a job, buddy. What are you doing? Can, can you go here? Can you not? Are you like stuck? Oh, what was that? He like grabbed his little foots. Grabbed his little foots. I cannot my, wrap, wrap my head around the bourbons in the U.S. Like city planners wants people to use cars so bad. The bur oh, so like c city, pl yeah. S you mean like suburbs? Like the like the design of like suburb towns, or like you know the suburbs of the okay. Because suburban is a type of car. That's what I was gonna. A suburban is a. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. You mean like the Chevy? That's a type of car. <laughs> no, the yeah, the no, no. You're okay. I figured out what you meant. Yeah, they, there are issues with that. A lot of issues in the U.S. Um, a lot of places in the U.S. are built for cars specifically, and it's kind of wild. Hi, daydreamer. How are you? Olive oil. Um, yeah, that's another, yeah, with an a, suburbans is, yeah, the car, but then it's like to call a place a suburb, you would say that place is suburban. So it's like, but you don't really hear it. So it's just, I think in that sentence, it would have just been around suburbs, suburbs, because it's suburban, but like, <laughs> it's very confusing. It's very confusing. But yeah, that's also the Suburbans are like obnoxious giant cars. It was like, I mean, Chevys are, yeah, the Suburbans are like annoying big cars. <laughs> so like, also it works in that sentence. Also, I, oh no, I, I, that timed out. I got distracted. <laughs> Part of it, I guess, is the size of the landscape. That's the other thing. Same thing with Canada. Cause like, that's one thing I think is a big difference between like North America and like Europe. Okay, I'm gonna actually pay attention to the jobs too here. We're looking for athletic. Um, I don't think he's gonna settle for anything else. He's real obsessed with athletic. Is, you know, like, from what I understand at least, a lot of like, that was quick. Um, a lot of like places in Europe are very old cities, very old places that are just having new civilization sort of built on top of it. So they're kind of retrofitting modern society on top of old structures whereas in like places like north america which is of course a colonized land where european society has pushed its style of civi civilization onto the land it's like a blank slate and so with that blank slate they just choose the most cost effective way to apply that design and so it ends up big spaced out gridded gridded cities and gridded sub suburbs and all of that you know just googled suburban <laughs> absolute unit of a car <laughs> it's funny <laughs> you think there's sims 2 universe where the burbs are called the suburbs that'd be fun the suburb that'd be kind of funny what would you how, what would you call the who what's the difference between the burbs and the suburbs as far as like the sims are they like i don't know <laughs> I think that that's why too the calling them suburbs sounds strange. Yeah, I think that's they're like the origin origins of their name. Yeah, in smaller areas like per country, you drive many hours and you're in the different country. Yeah, I saw a thing once that was interesting. That was so so he did not find one sec. I'm like jumping between playing and talking. I want I wish I had a computer for these guys, but also it doesn't make sense for them to have one. So I don't know. Dustin cares about his report card. I'm going to have him do his homework. I'm, like, trying to actually play. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, I saw this video. 
that was interesting. It was the, the original video was a girl who was from England talking about how people, what, any every like dumb American she talks to, asks her if where she's from is near London, and she was explaining that she's from this town, whatever. It's not London or whatever, and how. And then somebody else replied who was also a British person. They said, as somebody who's been to the U.S., I will say that the there's a difference between the perception of what are you near means and different in, in between like U.K. because the U.K. is a very small place versus the United States, which is very big. And so he actually looked up her town. Her town was two hours away from London and the United States. That would be close. <laughs> you would be near like if you. If you lived in Nevada, somebody would say, oh yeah, I live near Las Vegas, and you're actually three hours away from Las Vegas, that's close. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, you hop on the highway, like, I hop on the, the highway to go to my dentist appointment, it's, a, it's, a couple, it's an hour and a half drive, that's, that's nearby, because <laughs> everything is so big and spread out. <laughs> You know what I mean? So it's like, it's interesting concept. Now, obviously there's times where people, probably some idiot goes, oh, I'm from Ireland. And so, or not some idiot goes, somebody goes, I'm from Ireland. And then somebody goes, is that near London? You know what I mean? Like, obviously that happens, but you know, <laughs> what is wrong with you people? <laughs> Hope that made sense. I see that's so strange to have that thought, but I lived in the UK, yeah. It's interesting, though, because then it's like people in like a lot of places of like Western Europe, it's so easy for them to go from like multiple countries, like across multiple countries, whereas in like the United States, like you can, I think, what is it? It takes, it takes, does it take 16 hours to go from one side of Texas to the other side of Texas? It might, I think that's, it's like 16 hours or 18 hours to go from like Eastern Texas to Western Texas. <laughs> You're still in the same state, <laughs> you know? <laughs> yeah, it's chonky land. Oh, these two are fooling around. Okay, my sims are running wild. <laughs> I've been an hour away from London, and most of my childhood people were like, so how often do you go to London? And I do not, yeah. <laughs> El Paso, Texas is closer to LA than Houston. Yeah. You know what I was doing? Do y'all ever just, like, go on... Is this weird? Do y'all ever go on Google Maps and just, like look at stuff. I like just looking at places on Google Maps. And I was in El Paso the other day in on Google Maps. <laughs> just like looking at stuff. There's so much really cool graffiti in El Paso. I was just like running around looking at looking at uh, graffiti in El Paso, Texas the other day <laughs> on Google Maps <laughs> while I was like what had a, a stream up on my other screen. <laughs> I just I like looking at stuff. I like GeoGuessr. Do y'all ever play GeoGuessr? was my mind that U.S. has different time zones, different states, though. That shows how big, yeah. You know, time zones are weird to look at, too. But yeah, there's four different time zones in the U.S. and Canada. I know, baby. I don't think, did we hear a baby charm? I wasn't paying attention. I don't think I heard a baby sound. I don't have the silent pregnancy. I can literally drive to Italy in 24 hours. You're telling me that I would still be in Texas? I, yeah, I know. <laughs> well, it's like, because, like, yeah, because... There has been times where, like, I have family members who have, like, go, who are here on the East Coast, and they, like, go to school in California, but they have to, they have to, like, drive because they want to pack certain furniture and stuff. And, like, it, it's like a, it's a, it's a, f you know, I mean, it's probably like a week. It takes them, like, a week to, to, if, I mean, if they take their time to get there. But of course, the East Coast is like a little different with the states because states are a lot smaller on the East Coast because it was like the original colonies. So it's like things are older, like on the East, the Northeast, like New England, where I am, it's. Oh. <laughs> Mortimer? <laughs> Mortimer? <laughs> I forgot Mortimer was here. <laughs> He just walked in. <laughs> oh. You're gonna die up there. I'm Katya. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 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 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> that was interesting. Um... I don't remember what I was saying. Mortimer, he just, he walked and he said, you're hot, and then he left. <laughs> Thank you for the stream marker. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I wanted you to go to sleep. Is this, like, in your way? Are you not able to get to the bed because of this guy? Um, but yeah, like, the, the northeast things are smaller, but then the farther out west you get, the bigger the states are, because, like, that was the stuff that was done later on, that was made later on and stuff. But yeah, I mean, I wonder where in... Mexico they were that they were driving to San Diego. I mean, San Diego is very Southern California. And then there's like Baja, California, which is not America. I don't, is Baja, California, Mexico? I actually don't know. I think it must be part of Mexico or is it its own thing? I actually don't know a lot about that. I think it is Mexico. Okay. Also the baby's screaming. I'm not paying attention to the baby. I think so, Mexico, okay. It's like very desert there. That's like very desert. I mean, most of Mexico is. I wouldn't mind visiting Mexico one day. Can you please get up so you can take care of child? <laughs> you like the little, I like the, I like the little bay window. I didn't make this, they, they, the original creator of this hood made this. And it's really nice. It's really nicely done. They used to have a public train system. I wish. There's not really a train system. I think that if it is, it's like a very localized thing. I'm gonna have her take care of him. We'll, we'll watch her. Um, mostly I think there's like subways and cities and then some bus buses are probably the closest thing you'd have. I, I think in Europe, trains are a lot bigger. A lot, like, like a lot bigger thing. Not like physically bigger. I mean, trains are trains, but like they're more of a thing. I wish there was more trains here. There used to be back in the day. There used to be a lot of trains, and then they went away. They they got swapped over to other stuff, and now pretty much like like around here, there's a bunch of like tr hiking trails that are just old train tracks <laughs> that aren't used anymore. <laughs> Um, yeah, we'll save. Because you can get one train from where I am, South Wales, North... Okay, that's cool. Yeah, America is very into cars. And it's, like, very much... Like, especially if you live in rural America. If you live in a city, and you live in, like, a walkable city, it's different. Public transport's more of a thing. But if you uh, live in a rural area, it's... You have to have your own vehicle or a vehicle somehow to use. Well, bud, you gotta get up. You gotta get up, Dustin. I hear the bus honking. Um, trucks and guns, America. <laughs> but yeah, that's very. Truck, my truck, my truck. Also, high scores. <laughs> the daydreamer. Why did I read that day? The daydreamer. <laughs> my brain yeah it's more of a local yeah in new jersey we have some trains here yeah we have we do have one train that moves through but it's not a passenger train it's a freight train so we have one active train track that brings freight up to canada because we're like right on the border right near the border so it's like that's pretty much the only train i i hear the train regularly but it's not like a passenger train the daydreamer <laughs> x <laughs> i need lotion my hands are dry it's cold i took olive for a walk and like i didn't bring gloves because i didn't think it was that cold and then i was my hands are now like super dry there's train tracks being built in the baltics that goes through five different countries that's cool i would like trains i wish there was <laughs> what spot <laughs> the 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 dre the dree bing bong xx <laughs> It should just be the Bing Bong XX. I say Canada is just great uh, with some sightseeing. Yeah, I think that's also because like around here, I don't live like near it, but here in New Hampshire, there's the Mount Washington, which is like one of the biggest mountains, at least in the East Coast. Um, and it has a train that takes you to the top. 
it's called the cog railway it's an old-fashioned train which is it's fun and that's like mainly the big most like passenger sightseeing thing you'll find is is that canada is just bing bong <laughs> is just bing bong uh, what are we doing? We're kissing romantically. And she's filling herself with just chips. Can you just, like, have a snacky, sir? Subway Bing Bong deals. <laughs> Is Brandy pregnant? I don't think so. I didn't hear the ch chimes. I don't think. We'll see. Do you ever have a, a have want to have a panic attack? Just Google Katie Freeway in Houston, Texas. I would take a bus over. Oof. Some of the... I think out west, some of the freeways and the highways are wild. I think they're a lot bigger out west than they are out east. We don't really have, like, big, huge highways here. Or freeways or whatever. Out west, they're, like, kind of wild. But they have the land to use it, because there's just so... Everything's so big out there. Out here, over here, it's more like, again a little bit closer to lots of old houses and old places that they're kind of building on top of. How is Gregnet formed? But So, like, does she want anything to do with Mortimer? She, she wants to talk to Dustin. Mortimer seems to be into her, though, because he called her earlier in the day, and then he showed up at her house. And then he walked into her house and said, look, looked at her naked in her bed and said, you're pretty good looking. And then, like, sir? Sir? She's making pink soup. Does she have to? She must have to work. She does have to work today. What do you want to be her sugar daddy? <laughs> I know. Is she going to have an affair? Because Bella, Bella and Mortimer are still together, also. But Mortimer caught Bella with Daniel Pleasant. <laughs> Brady is cooking up some pink ass soup. Yeah. <laughs> I did this too. There's a uh, safe payment the whole way, and it's not like I'm doing a huge shop, so I only pick up a few things. Oh. It'd be like a 30-40 minute walk with all your groceries, which is not easy. Okay. I was I, I was missing the... I was gonna say, Canada is just frightened. Oh, yeah. <laughs> She's gonna have an affair. Let her cook. <laughs> Let her cook her pink soup. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Okay, bothering the baby again. I want her to call him and befriend him. What do you want, sir? He has this want to influence another sim locked in. I don't know if I want to do that. He wants to talk to Brandy. Also be friends with Ichabod? Why would he want to be friends with Ichabod? Just because he's new in town? No, I didn't. I haven't actually looked into trying to do that. To change the name from pink to purple. Only walk will sit in the U.S. I feel it. that's probably true. Yeah, or just be, if you live somewhere that's like in the center of an area, <laughs> of a city area. <laughs> but I mean, mortar, sh mortar, mortar, <laughs> mortar, sugar baby, any day. <laughs> Not mortar. Uh, okay. Can you put away baby, please? How about I'll, I'll have him... Oh, he wants to talk to her. Let's just chat. I don't know what we're doing. We're kind of just spinning our tires here. We Can we, like, do a thing? Not. Mortar? <laughs> mortar? I was thinking, like, mortar. Like, isn't that what you put between bricks? Mortar. Oh, no, I'm a chode. <laughs> Mini nut for Lear. Not. <laughs> Nine by five. Okay. A, a sensible nut would definitely put me in his will. <laughs> uh oh, <laughs> Daddy, they said no nut not. for you. <laughs> Sixteen by nine, a, an easily dividable nut? No, wait, not quite. It would have to have been eighteen. <laughs> uh. Not. 90% romantic and bing bong tile. Her bing bong. Not her bing bong. Points and laughs at your micro nut. Okay. <laughs> we don't do that very often. It's a good distance. A lot of smells from a big doggy. Okay. Yeah, if I... 
technically I could walk to the local convenience store if I wanted to, but the only like actual like grocery store or just like department store, I have to drive like 20 minutes to get to. If I walked, it would take me like a long time. <laughs> I'm going to have you go pee. Buy a changing table, buy a baby toy. We could do, why don't we, we could buy some baby stuff. She's going to spend all her monies. She's going to spend all her monies. Also, I haven't had her sewing at all. I don't know where we can, I don't think we can fit a baby table or a changing table, but I could get a baby toy. Yeah, see, like, I don't have buses here. There's no buses. We don't have a bus, period. I live in the middle of nowhere. I guess, I don't know, there's... This this is like a toddler toy that's just chilling here. There you go, you got a baby toy. Okay, we got some new stuff. Oh, she wants a promo. We get a promo. <laughs> Your bus doesn't have a period? <laughs> Did I say that? I, we don't have a bus period. Wait, we don't have a bus period? <laughs> like you just, seems like the US big shops, like grocery stores and stuff, are all like shopping parks. Oh. Interesting. I said over my space. Yeah, I might have. Here in Thailand as well, public transport system is placed only here in Bangkok, but other provinces, people is. Dependent on motorbikes and cars. I've seen, I think, I've seen before, there's certain countries where motor, like, motorbikes and, like, mopeds and stuff are a lot more popular, which I think is cool. Like, I wouldn't mind, like, a little moped zipping around, which is super annoying. Yeah. I get that. Yeah, it's just, like, again, rule, more spread out areas. <laughs> no, you, okay. I was just goofing. Okay. Okay. Danny impregnated the bus? Oh, no. Maybe Danny is a, it, it gave the, the bus medicine to stop it. Southeast Asia and perhaps South Asia, yeah. It's kind of neat. So yeah, so Skip doesn't have a job. He it's kind of implied in his in his little bio. Is this the same paper? No, I think it's a different paper. It's implied in his little bio that he came here to Pleasantview because he really wants to be get into prof being a professional swimmer. So he's going to and I so I've been trying to get him the athletic career because he has a lifetime wish for it. Um so we're going to say that he's like, wants to be a professional swimmer. Um, and I really want to get him the job, but I'd like to do it organically, but it's taking a while. So we might have to, maybe I need like a jobs board where I can go. Cause the fun thing about a jobs board is it still feels like you had to do something to go do the jobs board. I don't know where I'd put one. If we have buses or trains, if we didn't have buses or trains, we would not be able to go anywhere because I can't drive. <laughs> Well, you know, it's good that you have them. Yeah, like like I said, here it's required pretty much to have your license, which is rough. And then, or you have to rely on other folks. Um, I don't know what to, I guess I'll have her call the dude, call her friend Dustin Langerak. Uh, I grew up in, oh wait, I missed a message. I grew up in a small limited bus town. There was a bus that came once an hour in one direction and once an hour in the other direction. That was all. Oof. Oof. But I'm an anxious baby, Sam. <laughs> You're okay. You're fine. Let's just talk. We'll get him again. What are you doing, little gremlin? You're already back from school. Who do you think you are? being home and stuff. Just do your homework. He still wants an A+, plus, so I'm gonna have him do his homework. I'm afraid to think how many people I'd kill if I had to drive. Oh no. I also can't drive because I rely on parking or public transport. Yeah. Yeah, let alone afford a car, let alone car payments. Yeah. I'm very lucky that I have an, a very old... I have an old vehicle that I got from a family member. <laughs> But I'm actually not able to drive it right now because we, like, put it away for the winter. So I just borrow a family member's, another family member's car if I have to go anywhere. But they got, they got a fancy new truck. I get to drive around in their truck. Yeehaw. She keeps calling. I keep telling her to talk to him, but she kind of just, like, hangs up. You want to just eat this? Oh, wait, no, that's her, that's her carpool. She's got to go to work. 
Oh, that's right. I forgot. She puts on a wig to go to work for some reason. <laughs> I don't know why this hair is like connected. <laughs> Automod caught that message. What? <laughs> Automod caught that message because of in the butt. What? Why is it? It caught that message because of the word cowgirl. <laughs> Automod didn't like the word pain in the butt. <laughs> Sir? <laughs> Hi, Rick Romans. Okay. You. Let's go take care of baby. He's he's staying home taking care of baby. <laughs> Confirmed cowgirl. <laughs> I used to rely on public transport. It has been a pain in the butt. Even though I could drive, and yes, it's a, it's a second hand old butt car. <laughs> but I can uh, relate to folks that still use picture. Yeah. Automod is homophobic. <laughs> Automod's questionable. I still haven't edited its settings. I don't know why it's so intense about stuff. I'm gonna just, uh, I guess feed a bottle. Put away. I feel like this time with them has been a little chill, but like, I feel like there's some beginnings to some things happening. <laughs> I know I get scared. I don't know why it, it didn't like the word, it does not like the word cowgirl. I don't know why. I don't understand. Well, yeah, they got a big truck. I drive around in the big truck. It's got four-wheel drive. <laughs> loins. <laughs> yep. Elsa doesn't like loins. Yep. Yeehaw. Yeehaw. They <laughs> sure yeehaw. <laughs> Yee my ha. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, I think so, Allie. <laughs> it's very. But, like, of all the things, why does it have to be that? When it's just in conversation. <laughs> Driving your truck in the bayou? <laughs> I mean, like, the bayou? I made him make a little. We ain't got no bayous around here. <laughs> we ain't got no bayous around here. Okay, sir. Did I just give him the job? I think I might. I think I'm just gonna give him the athletic job. Because at this point, we've been trying like 10, 10, 10 times. I think it's, it's, bayou is, is that. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> that's that's down south. It's like the swamp. Uh, I'm just gonna give him the job. Where's the career? Hmm. Seems like they're so short. Yeah. It's like and and like I've said before, I have all of the custom NPC jobs, and those just like flood the paper. Like I wish I could disable them for the paper. Jobs. Oh my god, I keep accidentally clicking off. Have mercy on my soul. Jobs. I just want athletic career. Give athletic. Why aren't they alphabetical? Oh my god, there it is. Holy crap, Ola. Take job. Congratulations. Okay, you want to take a shower now? Oh, you already just took one. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I heard that Toby Keith died. Yeah. I don't know how. I don't know. I don't know how he died. I didn't hear because he wasn't that old. Was he in his 50s or something? Oh, stomach. Future tobacco and drive my truck. <laughs> Chewing tobacco is so gross. Oh, he's 62. Oh. When I was a when I was a wee child in the early two thousands, my parents went to a Toby Keith concert and they dragged me and my brother along. So I've I've been to a Toby Keith concert. I'm gonna have you just go to sleep. Okay, you did your homework. He wants a water balloon fight. Who does he have like his besties with Angela? Maybe him and Angela need to like have a play date. 
He not really he's not close with Dirk yet. Maybe him and Dirk need to get get going. Be buddies. Be looking at the King of England who has cancer like <laughs> Are those hopeful eyes. <laughs> but I was occupied with my job. Yeah, that's interesting. Parenting 101. <laughs> If I didn't manually cheat jobs, I said would never get employed in the correct careers. Yeah. My sims dream not of labor and the market is horrible. <laughs> it's true. I've only ever seen Aaron Carter and Ozzy Osbourne. Ozzy Osbourne sounds like it'd be fun. I've seen, well, technically Toby Keith when I was a child. And then back in 2016, I saw Bob Dylan live, which was fun. But I'm also a Bob Dylan nerd. You heard of the, the boys around here? Yeah. Yes. Yes, I know that one very well, Lear, because I think when that one came out... Oh, the baby just grew up. Sorry. <laughs> I feel like we're talking a lot and we're not... Oh. This baby said, let me offend some people. <laughs> this baby said, I'm gonna break some rules. <laughs> not this. Um... The, but the reason that I do know that one is because the store I used to work at only played the they, they played the only one local radio station that came through clear and it was the country station and that goddamn song got played on repeat it was that one and the other one that always used to send me there's one where it's this guy singing about going on a date and I'll let this keep happening Okay, little Bo grew up. That seemed quick. Um, oh, he wants to be friends with little, little, what's his name now? And he wants to invite someone over. Let's lock that in. Um, also, Bo got a little dress. Or does Bo a little, I don't remember if Bo got born as a girl or a boy. <laughs> I don't remember. Um, but the other one they used to play all the time was this one that was just, it was just just as bad as the chew tobacco spit one where it was the one about some guy like going on a date and like they go to like a parking lot to dance they like slow dance in a parking lot it's called slow dance in a parking lot or something like it's a little it's very and like they're playing their music out of their car and they're like dancing in the parking lot and literally one line of it says i'm gonna spin you around beneath the walmart sign like that's a line i'm gonna spin you around beneath the walmart sign <laughs> it's like <laughs> that one used to send me i was like how can you seriously listen, listen to this one <laughs> if i had to work with country music i would sue for intentional infliction but yeah it was bad i used to it was really rough. There were some days that I got lucky and I was able to play music through the computer instead of like the actual regular system. Yeah, I'm gonna spin you around neath the Walmart sign. <laughs> it was like, no, <laughs> no. Also, I gotta roll a dumb ad. We're gonna do it while we're just picking the baby's hair here. But yeah, that one, the chew to back, a chew to back, a chew to pack, a spit. <laughs> Hate that I know the, the way that it's sung. Chew to back a chew to pack a chew to pack spit. <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> spit. That's always a spit. Got the wall side. He's going to come and go. <laughs> oh no. What kind of hair is, is little Bo going to have? <clears throat> I think Bo was born as a little boy. I think. I think I think. But you know what? I've talked about before how there's been times where, like, I've had Bo grow up. Usually I either have Bo, Bo grow up. Yeah, Automod caught that. <laughs> um, I have Bo grow up either to be gay or trans or something. I know Bo not being blonde is kind of wild. What's this? Look at this little hat. It's a fun little hat. A fun little hat. Uh, uh, a mullet? Wait, maybe we need baby mullet. It's not really a mullet, but like we could say it's a baby mullet. <laughs> Me as a UK local listening to American country. So I think the one thing to understand about American country is there's a big difference between pre 9-11 country and post 9-11 country. Because post 9-11 country is when it, it's just gone downhill. Real hardcore. I mean, even like 
90s and onward it, it was already going downhill but then the, the 9-11 era it took a real bad hit and it went real downhill because like johnny cash and like uh dolly parton and like all of the the early country is like a big yeah Patsy klein johnny cash johnny cash the big one <laughs> yeah because 9 11 the country was just very all of the it became like all of the i don't know how to even fully describe it because of course one time i had somebody explain to me or i was reading something where somebody was explaining about how a lot of folks in like the uk how they view their the monarchy and how they how the way that they described it was the monarchy is to like a lot of folks in the uk to as the military is to people in the us so like the the military is like the us is like if you don't support the troops you're a you're you're a you're a this you're a that you're a you know what i mean and so in 9-11 and like all of that broke out and like war stuff broke out and like all of the country went like really hard with like raw raw america bomb the the bad people and let's be yeehaw <laughs> world's fastest radicalization 9-11 the country yeah and it was like very so that was like it, it, i don't know it's like such a it's such a complicated thing to like put into a simple why but like it's just like <laughs> yeah and it just got really intense let's be yeehaw <laughs> bing bong be yeehaw some americans glorify their military while some english glorify their yeah that's it that's what i mean and it's a lot of like I, i'm assuming probably the older generations older generations in the U and this would be a question i guess older folks in like the uk probably are more likely to glorify their their royals i would assume similar to how older folks in the united states are lo more likely to glorify the military that would be my guess uh assumption so more of a, about hating yeah hating other other groups and hating very uh like intense i guess it would be it's like islamophobia i think is the proper word and just like being just very openly hateful and but also like not actually having a true understanding of like what the situation that they were even singing about was about and all of this stuff <laughs> it's a very complicated thing but yeah uh i don't know what bo's hair is gonna be <laughs> i don't know what bo's hair is gonna be ew what if he has this little wispy hair I'm just gonna give him this one. I'm gonna give him. Let's do gussy up, change everything. Trying to voice that any public space will not go well for you. <laughs> Even super liberal people who recognize the military industrial complex refuse to put any kind of responsibility on individuals caring. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's very, uh, yeah. Mili the, the US and their military are very, yeah. <laughs> anyway back to back to us like loving sim world and not real world <laughs> back to back to the escapism of sim world <laughs> did this rascal just age up yes this little gremlin aged up and i don't know what what he's gonna wear this is his every day what if he just what does Bo normally wear wait why don't i look up Bo? What's Bo's like default outfit? Oh, he's got the little jean jacket, Luke. I can't see chat right now because I have. Where's the? Do I have it? I might have it defaulted. Where's the little jean jacket? Maybe I have it defaulted. <laughs> crouch goblin, <laughs> like crouch goblin. <laughs> Ever knew that my I could love my husband anymore, but he got me a pretty lady Taco Bell. Well, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. There you go. I don't know what... I don't know. He might... Oh, right here. This is it. I don't know why is it... I don't know. There you go. He's a little bow. Every day.
just do that. I'm just, I don't, the outerwear barely ever matters because it's like, I never see my toddlers in their outerwear. Like, do they ever actually even, I should have just done the change everything for, just do this. Now Gussie up, change into every day. Um, then I can delete this for now, I guess, and just put this back, right? There we go. There we go. Maybe I need a... Maybe I need a... Little potty. Where should we... Where should I put the potty? I can get away with it there. They can still get into that. There we go. Can, can we make him bloody? Think, I think I like him being, like, a little bit different. He's a little, he's a little bow. He's a little different. I like this alternate reality bow. <laughs> While here in Thailand, some Thais glorify both military and royals. These things are like inseparable power here. So I'm sitting here like I could not voice that similar phrase out loud. Apparently, yeah. I that's interesting. That's I can see where that gets intertwined. You have a Maxis made Sims 2 normal chair in your game i'm going through the sims 2 store items and i and it says it can crash your game nominal nominal chair max has made sims 2 i don't know i don't know if i feel like digging through it right now but i don't i don't know what that one is i mean i have just all of the basics oh it's a dining chair i don't know i have i, I downloaded just like the ultimate collection or whatever it is ultimate collection or something where it's just the a red dining chair let me see what i don't this is from i think this is from life stories i don't think it's that guy right oh it's like the ikea death chair oh we're right here there he is. She's not broken. She didn't crash my game. I don't know. I don't know. Hello, Bogwater and Thicky Bunny. How are we doing? Um, the custom PC looking dining chair. Okay. Have they paid their bills yet? That's a very good question. Where is their... So, also a good quest. Oh, right here. I was like, where's their mailbox? Or how about Brandy gets it? Because she's sitting right here. He wants to. Skip wants to meet someone new. What if we had Skip go out and, like, spend some time on his own in the world? In the world. Please don't crash. <laughs> I've used that chair before and I haven't had any issues. Oh, she's tired. Oh, not you. Uh oh, my, my headphones just beeped at me and told me that they're dying. <gasps> she wants a baby! Oh no. Oh no. You just skip out in the world? No, that's the whole point. <laughs> that's the whole point. Also, I have cookies. I have cookies here with me. Oof. 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. classes. Yuck. I'm gonna have him walk. Where should he go? Let's just stay in Pleasant View. The park lags. I can't get the park to not be laggy. I'll just go here, I guess. <laughs> Thank you, Lear. It's very kind. Brandy. Everybody's calling for Brandy. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I appreciate it, Lear. Thank you for gifting a sub to score. Congrats, score. Also, hi, Indigo. I hope this hood. I haven't played it yet. Enjoy seeing it. Yeah, it's been really... I like it. I like this hood a lot. Are you still doing the Spongebob picture from, for Nom Times? Yeah, I haven't because since I made my little, pic, my little window, my uh, camera shape a little circle, I haven't. But I should. I should. I don't know. Do I still have the... 
Yeah, it's not hooked up right. My little button doesn't work. I didn't screw something up, did it? No, it seems okay. Okay. Oh, look, he's Mr. Mr. Specter's here. Wait, he wants to ask him on date. Oh, what if he's what if he causes some drama here? Who's showing up? Let's see who shows up to the lot. I'm just gonna let him cruise on in. Yeah, I gotta sort out the roach nom pick. Scheduling issues inside the school. Not enough teachers for eight to five course. Oof. So that does that mean like some poor teacher ends up having to do extra? That's rough. You're very welcome. Uh, will probably be my last gift sub for a while. I've run through all my entertainment allowance. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. It's very kind of you. <laughs> please, please spend your entertainment allowance on yourself also. <laughs> I don't know why, but that wig for work makes me cackle. I wish I could wear a wig that no one know me. Yeah, that'd be fun. Just be like anonymous at work. Mysterious anonymous. Who's this? Jasmine Rye? Let's greet Jasmine. Look at her. She's cute. She's cute. Who else is out here? Just Crumple Bottom. The the OTP having a having a duel out here. I'm fixing these schedules so we'll close at standard hours. And these poor professors have to keep reminding them that they physically cannot do that. That's that's awful. I feel like it's always the teachers or professors that are losing. <laughs> they just they just are always losing the battle. Why do you have a sh why does this kid have a chef's hat? Gordon Bear. He's dressing <laughs> he's dressing for the job he wants, not the job he ha he has. <clears throat> That's what Gordon Gordon believes in this philosophy. Okay. Well, he wants to have a party. I'm going to lock that in. Oh, uh, chat. <laughs> Rosanna, thank you. <laughs> That's very kind. Appreciate it. He believes he is the Chef Gordon. Oh, there's a rat under there. Hi, Sandwich. <laughs> thank you, Rosanna. Yeah, you got me to 69. That's wild. <laughs> thank you. I very much appreciate that. Congrats to Octum. Octum. Hi, Lindsay. Thank you, thank you. I just, uh, I purchased a sweater that says, I'm wildly unpopular in the online Twitch community, uh, not Twitch, Twilight community. That's funny. That's funny. Teachers, uh, here, we're having a strike about unfair wage. I said, we'll give you a 5% bonus to your salary. Like, that would help. Oof. The admin doesn't communicate with anyone, so our complaints either go to our professor or some poor chump who had the displeasure of managing our course. Oof. Oof. That sounds rough. <laughs> Oof. Baby Hank. Oh, did you get a baby Hank? I was just catching up. I was trying to skim and catch up what I, what, what I missed. Okay, so it's, Skip is, is just chilling here. Well, he got his want to meet someone new. He's interestingly close to Bella Goth. Oh, Danny, thank you. I appreciate it. Oh my goodness. I'm not used to the gifted subs. Thank you, thank you. Here, how about you make yourself useful? He's gotta he's gotta get a cover. He's gonna buy some groceries as a cover. Inch resting. <laughs> thank you, Daddy. Rest at Tony Washington and Aust Ostage. I don't know how to I'm sorry. <laughs> Ot Ostage. <laughs> that was terrible. <laughs> thank you. Buttspot names another one. What did Buttspot do? Bing Bong Tomb, not the Bing Bong Tomb. The Tomb of Bing Bong, the great, the great Bing Bong Tomb. I just buy some a little bit of groceries. Oh, sure. G. Yes, I appreciate it. I do. <laughs> There's a lot of noises happening outside, but I don't know that they're getting picked up or not. Okay, I guess you could just like go home. Nobody's really here. Who's this random? I was noticing he's very close with Bella. Would he would he fool around with Bella? I'm just gonna have him go home. This was just a silly little adventure. A silly little adventure. Oh, Danny! <laughs> Good day, Dreamer Sub! Thank 
Thank you, Danny. That's very kind. <laughs> you're very kind, Danny. You're making everybody look bad, Danny. <laughs> Crystal Beth said, you're making me look bad, Danny. Chill out. <laughs> Thank you, Danny. That's very kind. Last step for me for the month. <laughs> that was my entertainment money. <laughs> Y'all. Y'all. <laughs> Thank you. I said it before. I feel like there shouldn't be... Like, I feel like if somebody is modded, they should, like, auto... Like, the... the Twitch should let them have, like, all sub privileges automatically as a mod. You know what I mean? Like, you shouldn't have to sub as a mod. Does that make sense? Like, you should just have access, just like I have access to everything. That's how I feel. But, I don't know. Yeah, just like, you should, because I mean, first of all, being a mod and having to be in an ad is, you know, detrimental, could be detrimental to your ability to be a mod. Like, so it's like they shouldn't even they shouldn't have you know you shouldn't have to if you're a mod you you don't have to see ads you should just be exempt from ads you know and all the other stuff i don't know but i in any way i appreciate it danny <laughs> thank you Bezo said screw you mods <laughs> Okay, these two, should we have- I think we should have them try for baby, because she wants to- Who's in our bed? Oh my god, that scared me. It was a re- somebody reset. Somebody was in the bed and, like, reset or something. I was like, sorry? Yeah, you'd think they would. Even, at least get access to the- to the emotes, but no. Because then that would also- if- if anything- anyone modded got all access to emotes, it would be, like, nice because all of the custom bots that I use for things, like when, like- like the Kanut Futa bot that pops up that when you like redeem the little little um the little commands and stuff. The, that bot doesn't have access to my emotes. So like I can't put an emote in like the message that it responds to you with because it won't show up. Unless I literally pay to have that that bot account subbed. <laughs> Which is dumb. So it's like but because in order for the bot to function, I have to mod it. So it's like, if the mods unlocked, if mod unlocked emotes, it wouldn't be an issue. You know what I mean? I don't know if that made sense, but... <laughs> Bogwater, one thing we know is that you will always have a good curry to talk about. You know, that's the one constant in life, is Bog's got a good curry. Bog's got a good curry. Made old people curry. All the bits are mushed and blended, so I don't need to chew. This is my dream dinner. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Long dog hours. <laughs> Long dog hours. Can always afford it. I'd love Twitch to pay for my Sam sub as a mod. Yeah, I think they should. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Crystal Bev. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Good comrade, a little sub. Comrade, the regular lurker. <laughs> thank you, Crystal Bev. That's very kind. Now my now my subs are at I should have put it I was like maybe I should put a seventy goal that feels wrong to put it I, the goal, the sub goal keeps having to go up <laughs> I keep having to put the sub goal up <laughs> I'm also getting it's kind of wild how close I'm getting to to nine hundred followers I'm at eight hundred and seventy five already Thank you Crystal Beth <laughs> Thank you Thank you Oh you got a little Oh we got a little little thingy. Got a little heart. A weird little heart. Oh yeah, I was gonna have these two do things. We're, we're very distracted today, aren't we? Let's do a makeout. We're gonna have try for baby, because she wants a baby. Wait, is this gonna be unborn baby broke? Are we, are we gonna create unborn baby broke that starts at the beginning of Pleasant View? Yeah, I mean, so you're not uh, paid as a mod and just... Yeah, it is. It isn't. And that would be cool if there was a way for mods to almost get like some sort of cut of like ad revenue or something. That would be interesting. But, I also understand that would be hard. So it's like, if Twitch wants moderated streams, they should incentivize. Yeah, they should, they should let you... Yeah. Like, there should be some perk. Because, uh, you know, it's... But of course, like, I'm also somebody who's not like... I think there's some people... Um... There's some people who are more strict with mods, especially if it's like a big channel, like people who have like thousands of viewers and stuff. Like, they, their moderators are a lot more, like, tired in a way. But, like, for me, anybody that I've ever asked to be a mod, I'm like, it's literally just somebody who's who's a regular viewer that just has the ability to, ability to delete an annoying message if possible. Yeah, also, no baby. 
you know what i mean like i don't put any pressure on any any mods having to be here or having to do anything like it's just like a view a viewer that i trust to make a, a decision to delete a thing if needed <laughs> maybe <laughs> to help out <laughs> with that but also like i'm not playing a game where i can't just pause it and do something if i need to you know what i mean like whereas there's people that are playing like action games where they can't stop and do things um but yeah but that bog always has good cur curry theory is not true i had some ass curry last stream oh no oh that it was chicken curry i think i remember that i think i remember you could talk about it maybe could be a sign of his own death sentence oh no the time has come Skippy's, Skippy, Skippy's, if it's the unborn baby broke, then Skip's gotta go. True, true. Maybe that's why there was no pregnancy. Oh, okay, story progression. Ask Curry, I hate that. <laughs> I hate that. Story progression, all Inspector is romancing Rick Romans. Who the hell is Rick Romans? I don't know who Rick Romans is. All Inspector's got a new mans, apparently. One cannot live while the other survives. Anyone? Anyone? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I like the alternate reality of them, like him living and, and it being a thing. I do think it's fascinating that Mortimer is showing interest in her. Look at the little stool that got left behind. Somebody answered the phone and then left their little stool out. Oh, that pop-up, it went away. It just said that Crystal, uh, that said that Laszlo Curious just had his first kiss with Crystal Vu. That little pop-up, the story progression pop-up. I turned on story progression for this hood. I don't know if I might turn it off eventually, but that's cute. Dick Roman is a villain in a TV show, Supernatural. Oh my goodness. Canon event. <laughs> the canon couple. The canon couple. Okay, you... Oh, okay, so that's the issue. The baby is in here. Okay. Um. So somebody needs to get up. You need to get up. Put Bo in the crib. Well, actually, we'll get up. We'll have you feed Bo. And then put Bo, or we'll have to wait. And then this little guy, Mr. Dustin, has to go in here and take a shower. We're gonna have to, like, keep the gremlin out of here. Start progression is fun when it when it... There's times I like taking breaks from it, like I had been taking a break from it for a while, but it's also fun just to kind of let it go. See what happens. I think you were going to say Crystal Beth, and I was like, hello? <laughs> yeah. I mean, Calicundia? Crystal Vu, Crystal Beth. Is Crystal is Crystal Vu the, the Strange Town version of Crystal Beth, or is Crystal Beth the Calicundian version of Stra Crystal Vu? That's the question. Go here. You come here and eat. Move. Okay, now you take shower. We're trying to juggle the children and this the Sims here. She's gonna go to the bathroom. How about you just like have a little bit of breakfast? I gotta put plug my earphones in, they're gonna die on me. Or headphones. I guess I should say headphones. Which stop changing my icon. <laughs> oh no. I like the clown. <laughs> I like the clown too. Which no. <laughs> Which said you you did this to yourself. Okay. Okay, now the baby maybe should I get the baby just like a regular baby bed? Or like toddler bed where they can get in themselves? I guess. That's easier. I don't know which one. Let's get like a fun one. Let's get like a funky little fun one. Funky fresh. What? I don't know what color. What kind of color is going to work in here? Would they even get like a matching color? What do you think Bo's favorite? Is Bo's favorite color blue, maybe? Maybe, maybe? Thank you very much for the follow. I wish we have named Crystal Beth the same way we named Dina, Nina, Don. So slight variation. Crisis Breath. Wait, that's so funny. 
that'd be funny to try and do like make weird cursed alternations alternate alternate weird cursed alternate versions of like sim people's usernames as their sibs name <laughs> crisis breath is so good <laughs> crisis breath <laughs> oh my god bing bong golbeth i hate thinking of what to draw like I gotta visualize. I don't have TV brain. Hmm. I was thinking about recently how I haven't been drawing at all. And I was like, hmm, maybe I need to, like, get on that. I need to do it more. Sounds lethal. Yeah, Chris's breath sounds lethal. I'm gonna give him a little blue bed. We'll just do this. <laughs> what if I bring Calicandies? <gasps> Wait, but that's funny. That's funny. Leah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> also, hi, Lavia. <laughs> Congratulations, you got a sub. <laughs> so much for that. What, what happened to that entertainment budget, Lear? <laughs> no, I said last one, but your Twitch name is too good. <laughs> Congratulations, Lavia. You, you've charmed yourself into a, into a sub <laughs> simply by existing. <laughs> okay, you're doing that. So does she have to work today? No. Oh, did she get a promotion? Because her days changed. I for I didn't see that she got it. She must have got a promotion. Now you, what are you? What's your problem? You need to. I'm gonna have you go to the bathroom. I forget we we put a little um outhouse thing out here. Not an outhouse. That that's how you know I'm a hillbilly. I said this is an outhouse. That's a porta potty. <laughs> Gotta go out to the outhouse. Uh, I don't know. Get get some cereal. I'm gonna have you clean up this. Can she use this phone? Is that gonna be an issue? Go out to a shader. <laughs> Law of equivalent exchange. For every calico and find normie. We need. Yeah. Also, yeah. That's a fascinating concept to to normify a calicundian. That'd be funny. I'm also getting a work placement, so I desperately need a portfolio. Ah, okay. I'm guess is work placement like your school is helping you get like an internship or something? I'm assuming that's what maybe a unpaid internship is. Okay, yeah. So it's like yeah. Also, is that who's? Oh, that's Skip's job. Okay, Skip's going to work. First out and out I ever saw was on The Simpsons with the Cletus family. Interesting. The store I used to work at, we used to sell. The lime they use a lot a certain type of ground limestone in outhouses to um cover the smell <laughs> and we, that was something that we sold pretty regularly to local folks here was lime for their outhouses <laughs> fun fact <laughs> also for their barns You guys, I'm uh, planning a field trip for some high schoolers with the volunteering I'm doing. And the volunteering organization, only six days before the field trip, said that it was my responsibility to get signed consent forms for the trip. And then our contact teacher at the school couldn't print out the forms. I had to go back and forth between students and parents with limited contact in for these past five days. Oh my god. Pain. That sounds like pain. Oof. Uh, so we just need to do breed out the weird and have SimCity do a humanitarian mission for the uglies where they pair them up. Yeah. Well, that was our, always kind of our thing with Calicundia. It was like, how long is it going to take before we get like a really normy inborn Sim? And unfortunately, that got like a little ruined, but we could kind of maybe not count it because what happened was, and I feel like this says a lot about Calicundia, but I didn't want, I wanted her to make the bed. Oh, why can't she make the bed? That's weird. Um, how about we have her, like, practice? Oh, wow, she's actually really good at making stuff. Wait, make a curtain. I forgot what I was saying. Oh, we had a Calicundian... We had, um, Schnoz had a baby with an alien, and it ended up normal-looking. That was our first, like, inborn normal baby. But, like, because it was, like, with an alien, a pollination technician, it's almost like it didn't count a little. But it also says a lot about Calicundia that because we got genetics from an a, a pollination technician that the baby came out normal. <laughs> you know, like usually that's when the baby comes out really screwy looking. <laughs> Porta potties scare me. 
Where does the poop go? A reservoir? Someone has to empty my septic tank? <laughs> well, I mean, somebody has to always empty your, empty your septic tank. Well, I guess maybe, I don't know if you're connected to like a city system. Maybe not. What a potty. I know. It just kind of goes in the, the blue water. <laughs> it just goes down in the blue water. <laughs> and we don't look down. <laughs> you know? Unless you mean like in a, like, unless you mean in like an outhouse. Because, like, porta potties and outhouse is, like, different. Kind of. I mean, I guess it depends what you call it. I'm kind of tempted to make a Calicundi and multi-PT mod. That'd be fun. That'd be fun. <laughs> you don't look down the shithole. <laughs> you can't be calling porta lizard. Yeah, because, like, here, like, a porta potty Um... I have porta potty trauma from opening a really nasty, unflushed, and overfilled one. Oh, no. I remember, because, like, when I was younger, I used to work every summer at a, a local fair. And, like, the only place we could go to the bathroom was the porta potties. And I don't think, I don't think these days I could go into a porta potty. I just go, like, it was always the end of July. So it was, like, the hottest, nastiest, and going inside of this little plastic prison, porta poop prison. Which is bad. That has been sitting in the sun. Oh god, hot shit hole. Yeah. <laughs> also, this is our last day in this house, and I feel like we've been talking so much that we just kind of the Sims have just been existing alongside our conversation. <laughs> but like the porta potties here are plastic, like contained things, whereas the like outhouses are like a hole dug in the ground with like a wooden shack on top of it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I imagine someone cleaning my poo. I'm not a baby or, you know, you know what? There's a lot of people that have to have help with that that are neither of those. <laughs> Before I was born, my sister was little. My older siblings would bully her and call her Princess Porta Potty. <laughs> That's a terrible name. What if someone takes my stool samples? Well, you know what? They, they maybe. I mean, it's going to be so mixed with everybody else's, <laughs> you know, is that, is it going to be worth, is it going to count? <laughs> you know, you don't need them. You left it behind. <laughs> one man's, one man's crap is another man's treasure, you know? Rogue's toilet was well, last stream was super stanky. Really, like, that's true. And this this stream, it's not bad. Also, Brandy's happily kind of just doing her thing. What's where's the baby at? The baby. Oh, I'm gonna have her stop and try and potty train the little gremlin. We gotta do some teaching to this little gremlin. I'm gonna also be a cheater. I've become addicted to making the baby smart with that with the debugger. It's a problem. I have a problem that they learn fast, but it's like so much better. Cities test the sewer system. It's already. Wait, cities test the sewer system. Sorry, to have it. that's how they got COVID stats. Oh yeah, that's that's true. I mean, I only had an outhouse for a long time at my great uncle's farm. Either you walked there or you did your business muted bush. Horrible experience. Oof. Then there's of course there's the places that like use the human waste on their fields. I don't know how I feel about that one either. I forget what they call it. It's potty train bow. Speaking of potties. <laughs> everywhere, everywhere as far as I know does that, yeah. Which is like... But, you know. <laughs> they would test wastewater in U.S. cities and track rates of COVID. Okay. I mean, that's a good way to do it. Wasn't there that one case where there was someone who had tracked because they... Some random strain of COVID roughly where they were shitting but no one's no one knew who they were that's funny that's wild okay this little gremlin doesn't want to learn because uh, he's in a bad mood tickled let's have him like do some stuff he wants to be tickled by brandy play tickle let's try and make him happy played with okay are you gonna just put him down you know we got tickle you got tickle Using human waste or fertilization is, yeah, or for, I guess it's fertilization, technically. The message made zero sense. Yeah, like, I understood what you were saying, in a sense. What are we doing? We're just sitting here. 
I got a tickle. I just need this child to not be miserable. <laughs> be miserable. This may be a genuine phobia. <laughs> for I think they mean like for fertilizing crops, like for yeah, they use cow weight like they for fertilize yeah for like fertilizing plants and stuff like farmers fields. Okay, the baby went to the bathroom. Did he not? She did also didn't tickle him yet. Why is it so hard for her to tickle this baby? Brandy secretly Brandy doesn't know how to tickle babies. Okay, now she's the one that smells. Oh, you know. Yeah, I forget what they call it though. There's a special word they call it that's like, so they don't have to say human waste. I forget what it's called though. You obviously wash your crop before you eat them. Yeah, and also they generally they don't like put it on while the crops are growing because you don't generally like fertilize. I mean, you can fertilize while things are growing, but it would have to be a more a more specialized, not manure. Manure is like animal feces, but there's a different word for it for the human. And I can't remember what it is. Um, but like most of the time, manure is or feces is applied to the ground before, even before planting is um, is even done. Usually, because the reality is, is manure doesn't have a lot of uh, nutrition nutrition for the plants. It's more of like an organic. It's more for like making the soil better. I could go on a rant. I can go on a a, a, a gardening rant here in a minute. <laughs> People get confused about what fertilizer is and what manure is. <laughs> Seven percent. Okay. Thirty nine percent. Okay. Poop rant. <laughs> poop rant. Carnivore and omnivore poop is not used for different reasons, like parasites and stuff. Hmm. Don't ever get doo doo. Yeah, it's like a proper word. It's like a Farmer Sam education hour. <laughs> it's because I used to sell the stuff. So, like, exp people would come in and say, like, they'd come into the store and be like, I want a bag of fertilizer. I'd be like, okay, what are you fertilizing? And they're like, just my garden. I'd say, okay, the fertilizer's down there. And they'd say, no, I need cow poop. And I'm like, okay, so you want cow poop? You need manure, not fertilizer. And they'd look at you like you were crazy. <laughs> It's, it's, I gotta, I gotta have to, let me look it up. Hmm. S treated sewage sludge. Damn it. I can't think. I was looking up the name. Malorganite. That's what it is, malorganite. We used to sell it at the store too. Malorganite is what here is what they call human waste fertilizer is malorganite. Human manure. Wait, that's good. <laughs> okay, who's who's is this who is this somebody coming home? Oh, that's you coming home. He's, Dustin's not quite getting his grades up. Like he he's doing his homework, but he's not doing good. Yeah, it's we sold it in pelleted form. It was like a gr or a granular form in a bag, malorganite. I would have never said that in ten billion years. Yeah, oh yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Yeah, I know. I was like, I'm like, I knew there was a name for it. <laughs> that's what it was sold as is malorganite. <laughs> ACR is being wild in your game right now. ACR is kind of kooky. ACR is like kind of a silly little crazy guy. I know, I know, I need to know, you to know deep in your heart, someone has probably eaten Malorgan. You know, there's a lot of stuff that they sell for cattle that has a really sweet smell to it. And every time I, like, I saw it or would, would handle it, I would think like, there have there have been a hundred children who have eaten this this who like some farmer's kid that has a hundred percent eaten this cow medicine because it smells like candy because that's how they get the cows to eat it. I'm like, there's no way that there hasn't been children who have just 
eating a whole bag of of this this cow electrolytes. <laughs> it's so I'm like this seems like bad maybe. <laughs> Can you clean this up? Okay, I'd like Brandy to try and train the baby a little. Maybe should I do talk or walk? Let's try talk first. I gotta lock one in for him. I think Brandy would try. You know, Brandy would try. Emily Burb, John and Jennifer's second daughter, just did a booty call with Brielle Goth, Cass and Don's firstborn daughter. Okay. Are they what eight are they like teenagers or adults? I've heard you're not supposed to use raw human waste as fertilizer, but it's like processed and pelleted. I I see how well that'd be fine. Yeah, it's yeah, and I'm sure again, like you said, it's processed, so manure smells sweet or sour. I can say that when I go to country walks, people I go on walks, look at me like yeah, it's some people like the smell of manure. That's um that's like how the term professionalite poop is coprolite. Its own special little term. <laughs> I looked it up. Our government threaded first wave sewage for farm use. First wave sewage still has fecal matter. Yep. There you go. <laughs> but I didn't know they knew each other. I literally just found them in bed together. That's so funny. That's funny. Maybe that would, well, I mean, like, that's that feels a little realistic, though, for people just to, like, hook up. Maybe they, they found each other on a, a dating app and they're just like, let's just hook up. They don't know each other. They're just hooking up. My city is sitting here listening about farming and fertilizer. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's a weird crossover for our Sims world here. <laughs> Someone has eaten poop plants. Most people, probably, if you bought your, your food from, like, a, a grocery store. <laughs> My curry doesn't look so tasty anymore. No, it's okay. The curry is safe. The curry is good. They should make cow medicine smell like silage. Pretty nasty. Yeah, cows love silage. It's gross because uh, silage is just rotten hay. Personally, don't like manure smell, but I could choose between manure and super chemical. Yeah, that's true. I hate chemical. I tend to have a hard time with most perfumes because all I smell is the chemical like beneath it. I don't know. Okay, did he learn anything? Oh, did he learn? Oh, he learned how to talk. That's cool. That's cool. Should we try for baby again? She wants a baby still. I'm gonna have him try for baby again. Someone is eating my poop plants. Yep. You're right. That's true. I think I missed that in the message. Yes. Yes. Sometimes I read too quick and I miss it. Oh, uh, butane. Okay. I was gonna say, I know people who like gas, like car gas. People like the smell of gas, car gas. It makes me sick, feel sick, the smell of car gas. Story progression. Parker Langerak is romancing Jamar Allison. Let's have Brandy initiate Try For Baby because she wants to. And someone who does, I love it. <laughs> it's interesting. <laughs> who wanna smell my gas? <laughs> Thank you for your, your wonderful contributions, Sticky Bunny. I appreciate it. <laughs> I'm gonna go take a drug. I'll decide which one I get there. Okay. Is it is it gonna be sniffing gas? Because I would have to say probably don't do that. Don't huff petrol, don't worry. I don't huff petrol, okay. I heard when Americans say gas, I would think those gas tanks that people here use for- Yeah, a lot of times gas. <gasps> Baby sound. <laughs> I've been lurking, are y'all okay? <laughs> no. <laughs> We've, why, has, why has the conversation gone in so many directions today? <laughs> Baby? Baby? Okay. I'm going to save. At least they both have a job now. So they'll get a little bit more money to take care of the children. Sniff some markers. Don't do that either. You give me there ideas. Oh, no. That we will never oh, fully no. Understand. Understand. We, we want, want answers. answers. 
We have worked years to build our build credibility. Our, credibility. Our, our reputation. reputation. <laughs> Yeah, I did know that gas doesn't have a smell. They add, usually it's sulfur that they add to it. It's a sulfur smell um, that they add to it to make it smell like farts <laughs> so that you smell it. But I don't know if gasoline, like car gas, is the same. But a lot of other gas, they'll add like um, propane, they add sulfur. Um, like propane that you used for cooking. Yeah. So that you can smell if there's a gas leak in your house and stuff. Uh, so I got some parsley metal and one of those airplane fireballs. I have no idea what either of those are, but I hope you have a good time. And thank you for the follow. Sorry. <laughs> okay, gasoline is just naturally. Okay, I was I was wondering that. Hi, Google. Like methane, neither propane nor butane has an odor of its own. However, gas producers... Add agent ethyl. Okay, interesting. Cindy, your gas is leaking. <laughs> How are you doing, ma'am? What is she up to? Low dose pain medicine and alcohol. Oh. Well, you know, I can't tell you. I you you gotta do your own thing, I guess. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. Fireball with medicine sounds bad time. My overactive liver can take it. <laughs> Bug. <laughs> I, you know, too late now. Okay. <laughs> R.I.P. to bog water. All right, so I like skunk smell. What the fuck is wrong with me? Is it, is it colorless or yellowish liquid a gas pungent garlic or skunk like odor? Interesting. That sounds... I wonder if it's different in different countries, then. Because, like, here, I know for a fact that propane is sulfur. They add sulfur to the propane. But maybe it's different for different types of gas. Your liver's pickled. Congratulations. <laughs> oh, I checked Wikipedia. This is also stuff that makes gasoline stinky. It's just there naturally. Ah! Oh, it's a sulfur compound. Okay. Okay, this info is from a New Jersey PDF. Well, of course it's from New Jersey. <laughs> of course it's from Jersey. I like the smell of weed, but my mom says all she can smell is skunk. I've heard people say that. I've heard people say that. That's That would happen sometimes when, like, people would... If, if you, like, walk by somebody who has been smoking weed in their car, it's like, did you get sprayed by a skunk or did you smoke weed? Yeah, or cat piss. <laughs> at, at this point, I feel like I've become very desensitized to skunk smell because Olive loves it, loves going after skunks. She has an obsession with jumping skunks in the nighttime and getting sprayed with them. And so she's, she usually, if you smell hard enough on the Olive, no matter how hard I wash her, she's always got a slight skunk essence if you smell real close. She's not too bad right now because it's been a long time. But there will be times, especially during summer, that she's always a stinky oil. Yeah, she's a stinky oil. She's a stinky girl. She's a stink the stinky baby. That's usually I just call her stinky baby most of the time. Yeah, we tried tomato juice. We try. Um, I use mostly the best thing is like I have a shampoo that's made for skunk, and like you like leave it on them and let it almost like not harden, but really like stay on their fur for a while before you rinse it off. And that helps a lot. <laughs> she likes skunk scent. Yeah, I, apparently she likes she likes chasing skunks. <laughs> also, we're almost done with this household. Um, I think you got to go back to sleep, girly. After I'm going to turn We'll wait till it turns Thursday. And there it goes. We're going to save. Um, all of us are a little short. <laughs> Odor chasing the scent. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Thank you very much for the follow. I, I like the smell of cigarettes. They're like attractive, like a milf. 
I do think tobacco can be an, an, a good smell. Tobacco smoke can be a good smell. It depends on the kind of tobacco. Pipe tobacco is like different than like a cigarette tobacco or like um, cigar versus cigarette. <laughs> Olive's a little stoner, Chase. Maybe Olive was a stoner in another life. <laughs> this house is small, but it is. It uh, was made by the maker of this town, and it's really nice. Um, so we're done playing that household. We played them a bit last time. That was kind of quick, I feel like. Um, we just kind of hung out and did some stuff. But uh, so we do we're done with those guys. That was quite a fun little time. I feel like because this is our first time playing any of these households in early Pleasant View. So like, I feel like some sometimes it's more like just sort of establishing who's there and what directions they're headed in. So that one was kind of a lot of that. I feel like we did end up with a baby and we have another baby on the way waiting for us when we play next time. Um, so up next, let me double check my little tracker sheet. Finish them. So the next one I have listed is the Langerak household. So there's actually only two more households in Pleasant View before we're done with this round. There's really not a lot of houses here. Um, uh, where are they? The Langeraks, where are you hiding, guys? Right here. So we have the Langerak household. So these guys are interesting because they were pulled from Sunset Valley. Uh, was that baby Dustin then? Because it's early Pleasant View. So the, here, let me select them again. Um, Dustin is the child here. So Dustin's the child. When we started the household, Brandy was pregnant with Bo. So Brandy gave birth to Bo. He ended up having black hair. He got her hair. So this is little Bo. And now she's pregnant again. So I guess it's the third broke baby that you usually kind of start with. Um, so yeah, so it's Dustin is the child and then Bo is a, a ch toddler. Um, so that's kind of neat. I like I like playing Dustin as a child. It's kind of fun. I like I also like the opportunity to play Skip. Also, I missed Daydreamer's message. WTF is wrong with me. The UK gas companies add something called Marsa Marsitan Methan Methane That word. <laughs> it's a harmless but pungent smelling gas that has been described as having the stench of rotting cabbages or smelly socks. <laughs> yes, that's that's why I think it's interesting people like those smells. Hence my strange affinity for green-skinned blonde men. Yes. Yes. <laughs> it's, so, it's okay. Um, Langerak is Kaylin young, long, younger. Yes. So we have in this household. So this, this, this little household would have been sort of taken from Sunset Valley in The Sims 3. The Langerak family shows up in Sunset Valley. So that's, but in the creator has made this early Pleasant View, they decided to take them and plop them in here. Uh, actually, look, like it's mentioned in their little bio here. So their little bio says, The Langeraks may have left Sunset Valley and all of its drama, but they sure brought some scandals with them. Will they teach young Kaylin to make the right decisions in life? So, um, so that's kind of interesting. Let's jump in and get to know the Sims. Dreamer has a foot thing is the first message I see. Please no, I hate feet. You are built for a foot thing. <laughs> Such a bizarre set thing to say to somebody. <laughs> you look like you're built for a foot finish is a wild thing to tell somebody. <laughs> I'm very sorry. But that's that's a lot. <laughs> Let me get my sim manipulator. I like this house. This is a cool house. This is a, I mean, I know it's the default house, but I like the makeover of the house. It looks really nice. You look like a sprinkles guy. <laughs> you look like a sprinkles guy. Let me uh, let me turn on quarter tile. I'm gonna put. You know, y'all. I've been thinking. I miss my strange town Sims. You know, we've been we've been exploring Pleasant View. I miss my strange town Sims. Um, change model. I'm gonna go over this way a couple of times. There we go. Hi, Allison. I had a dream last night. I was playing this neighborhood for some reason. That's funny. <laughs> there we go. Here we go. You need to hang out with my kind of people. Bizarre shit is the only thing that comes out of their mouths. <laughs> no, I, I appreciate the bizarre shit. I do. I, I'm, a, I, I'm an enjoyer of the bizarre, bizarre stuff. 
Simsu does infest the brain, I've found. I think everybody can agree with that. <laughs> um, but yeah, so we have Kaylin Younger. That's sort of the most recognizable character here is Kaylin. Uh, let's turn on all the lights so we can we're going to just get to know everybody here. Um, as a note, I did get rid of my traits mod. I've been debating it for a while. And I decided that I'm done with it for right now. Um, I still think it's a really cool mod, but it was just like felt too tedious right now. I just didn't want to deal with it. So we don't have a traits anymore to deal with. We're just going to look at their actual personalities in game. Um, I'm still reeling from the fact my internet law professor used a sims to- Yes, that was cool. <laughs> At first, I thought you were saying that you made this this the PowerPoint and put that in there, and then I realized it was like found in the wild Sims Two reference, which is kind of fun. <laughs> I enjoy that. Okay, so we have Ms. Ms. Kaylin here, the icon, the queen. She's a teenager. I think I might need to fix her makeup a little. Looks like she has the default blush that I'm not a big fan of. Um, so she's in public school. So she's pretty neat. She's very shy active i guess a little more serious nicer uh what's her little bio say although being the most helpful person around kaylin keeps to herself and doesn't want to bother anyone with her problems but with all these those dividing feelings growing will she be able to cope excuse me i have a little hiccup uh okay so i think there's some must be some drama going on in the household I don't know if the rewards pinged or Sam's PC or not, but hydrate. Oh, I I might not. Have, oh, I missed it. Yes, I might have been in La La Land. Thank you. I got my water. I don't know if the rewards pinged in Sam's PC or not, but <laughs> hydrate. Eva Bing Bong won. Okay. Your students always go wild when they see Sims icon. That's funny. That's funny. I remember when I was in high school, there was a, I had a, a few different, the, the sign, like, so we had some science teachers that were like married. It was like a husband and wife that were science teachers at the school. And then there was an art teacher who all three of them played World of Warcraft together. <laughs> it was a very weird thing for them, like to be talking about their World of Warcraft together during like various like meetings and group stuff that like, if they're in the auditorium, they'd be like... <laughs> <laughs> talking about their world of warcraft it's it's a very weird thing when teachers are like into stuff like that i don't know how to describe it like obviously teachers are human beings that are into things but it, like as a child it feels or like a young person it feels weird <laughs> you know it needs to be neat because she's a maid later in life true and that's what so they say she's like a helpful person and doesn't want to bother anyone with her problems i think that's the shy part but there's dividing feelings. So, like, what's the deal? So, this is her... Where, where? That's not... This is her brother. Oh. So, this is her dad. I don't know how I feel about dad's outfit, but I guess he can keep it. I don't love this default replacement. There's something about the pants I don't like. Or maybe the shoes. I'm trying to get a good look at him. Why don't I just hit play and let them kind of establish a little bit? Why are you looking at me? Can you, like, go here so I can just look at you? <laughs> Thank you very much for the follow. Hot? <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Bogwater. He's blonde. He's blonde. Watch out. Watch out. He's a cutie. He's a little cutie, but he kind of looks like... So his name is Dustin. We were just talking about how there's Dustin Broke and there's Dustin Langerak. And, how, and the earlier, Brandy Broke wanted to be friends with Dustin Langerak. Like, what if Brandy secretly has, like, an obsession or a thing for Dustin Langerak? You know? Is, is it the crotch bulge by any chance? I have the same issue. Oh, is there? Oh, yeah, there's a weird. That's interesting. Oh, God, never mind. No longer have Dustin. Yeah, you think he, yeah, his name is Dustin. You don't like old Dusty? I don't really like the name either. It feels like a. It feels like I wish he had a different name. I do. Like in such a small town to have two Dustins. Not. Like, I understand that they didn't have a choice, but like. Timelines ain't right here. Yeah. It feels weird, but he's a cutie. Like, can we? What? What if he were to have a different name? I don't know. I, I'm not going to change his name, but oh my god, it's been another hour already. <laughs> he's Dustin, but he ain't Dustin. Yeah, like what other name? Dustbin. 
It's like someone said dustbin and thought, wow, that would be a cute name. <laughs> dustbin Beaver. <laughs> Not dustbin. He did move here. You're right. He moved here. And it was just like a chance that there was two Dustins. What's the nickname for Dustin? I guess Dusty. I have an aunt that gets called Dusty. So it like makes me think of more of a like a woman's nickname, but it's not really. It's just a very generic nickname. Well, one of us has to change <laughs> their name. Pick one and trans their gender. True. <laughs> wait, wait. What if that's how we do it? Wait, what if that's how we get Dustin to change his name? He becomes he 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 secretly is actually secretly hiding. He has a big secret, and that's what's happening. <laughs> Well, let's read, let's read the bio. Let's read the bio and see what's up. Dustin never wanted to cheat on his wife. But you know, Ileana was more focused on her career and her sister, Zelda, being, being making it clear her attraction. That's okay. Stuff happened. So he's a bad guy. So I think probably the answer is we actually just kill Dustin. So what he's saying is, uh, I didn't want to cheat on my wife, but it's her fault that she decided to do career stuff. And uh, so he slept with her sister, Zelda. Is that what's happening? Zelda? I don't know. I think there's some weird wording here. Being making it clear her. So I think it's Zelda made it clear that she was attracted or he was attracted to Zelda and stuff happened. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> like, uh... <laughs> Okay, back to the kill him option. Also, I have to run a dumb ad. I'm sorry. I'm gonna. I shouldn't have run it. Wait, I should have waited. Now I feel bad because I should have waited until we were done reading. I'm, you know what I'm gonna do while we're waiting for the ad? I'm gonna pick a new outfit for him. I don't like this outfit. Let's pick a different outfit for him while the stupid ad rolls. Very Daniel Pleasant core. I know we've got another gross man. <laughs> <laughs> we need something we need we need a new storyline here gross man does gross things while wife does career things and it's weird because she the wife kind of looks a little bit like like um looks a little bit like mary sue crusty dustin yeah dustin more like chuck him in the dust bin that's a good one <laughs> i forget if ella specter is here growing her garden yet and if so cow plant snack candidate that's a good point kaylee that's a really good point I like that. Um, um, um. What if he just got like a nice suit? I feel like he could have like a nice suit. I'm gonna go to the end. I feel like that's what he's supposed, he's supposed to just have like a, a regular suit and stuff. He had it come in. Mm hmm. You're gonna die. What up says? There. I'm Katya. <laughs> Sims team can only create cheating or gay meant true. <laughs> what says I'm gonna cheat on my wife now? What what is it? which maybe this one? <laughs> Love this oil oh you like the oil photo? <laughs> Ms. Oil. Miss Arfoyen. Maybe this one. Maybe this is it. I kinda like this is like I don't ever use this color. <laughs> but he was, she was low key staring into your soul. <laughs> he always does. Is that Katya and Trixie? That yes, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I used to have the full bit with them, with Katya sucking on the chicken, and then I took it out, and everybody got mad at me. So I guess I gotta put it back in, huh? <laughs> I know I caught that. I, I God damn it! I gotta write a note for myself. To the ad's almost over. We have like 42 seconds, so I'm kind of wasting time for the dumb ad. I'm going to write a note to fix auto mod. Slurp, slurp, slurp. Auto mod is against slutty men. <laughs> if we can't fix him, we can at least make him slutty. Yes. There he is. Look at that. Oh. He got mad. He looked at me. He got upset. Sucking the chicken. <laughs> yeah, at the end of that sound bite, Katya sucks. She has a rubber chicken in her hand. And she, like, sucks on it. 
very graphically. <laughs> Dustin isn't slutty. He's cool. He's cool for school. He's also a cheating man. Also, so somebody had a question. I think they said, who's Zelda? Um, this is Zelda May. Who? So let's double check. Let's double check. We still haven't read the other bios. Um, Automod. <laughs> No, the Don Lothario Corps is sort of single sluts, not married old dads with children. Dan true. Daniel Pleasant Corps. You're right. That's true. Automod is a square. Automod is a square. 100%. I'll see the clip randomly next time I'm on YouTube. <laughs> Oof. Um, so, okay. So, Ileana. So, this is the family tree. So, Dustin, Ileana, married, had babies, Kaylin, and Parker. Zelda is Ileana's sister who's living with them. So that's who Zelda is, which was drama, again, drama that happened in The Sims 3 that's being brought over. <laughs> Automod's working overtime right now. <laughs> I also got <laughs> I also got, got for saying bite you. Yeah. I think it's weird because Automod will recognize if something is said in a slightly different way, such as putting parentheses next to it because it, it sees it as like you trying to get around it that's so stupid too erotic yeah so that's who zelda's this girly which also i don't know how i feel if this girly is out here like enticing men i don't know if she should be wearing this outfit right so she we should maybe she needs a better outfit too okay let's just go down the list here so we're gonna look at mommy mommy iliana she's pretty she's got a little bit more kaylin you can see the kaylin is that it was about a snail? <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know what's happening. They're having three pulse with Daddy Pleasant. Oh, Zelda? She does. I mean, that seems correct. She's the cheater. <laughs> oh, he is. Oh, he's shittier than Daniel. Okay, so here's Ms. Ileana. She's cool. Um, she's extremely neat. Not super shy, but like not outgoing. I guess more shy than outgoing. She's active. She's also a Virgo. I don't pay enough attention to the Zodiac stuff. She's a Virgo. Uh, she's very serious and pretty grouchy. So she's a little bit down to business. Ileana lives a pretty uneventful life in Pleasant View. She still misses the hustle and bustle of good old Sunset Valley, but she says she'll get over it. I don't know if you will, Ileana. You can't die. I'm a Virgo. <laughs> Loot makes me think of a gambling site, sl site called Juicy Slots. Not Juicy Slits. <laughs> juicy Slots. Oh, my. Okay. What, she must have a... Okay, so she's a business lady. So, again, this feels... The, the vibes are very Daniel and Mary Sue. Like, that's kind of the feeling. Okay, so then we have Zelda. Again, I feel like maybe Zelda needs a new outfit. Maybe we could keep the orange, look for something else in an orange. She's a record store clerk. Uh, she's extremely sloppy, very outgoing, kind of lazy, very playful and pretty nice. She's also a Libra. Is that Libra? Yeah. Libra. Virgo, how about you go <laughs> your own, find your own man? <laughs> but that's that's wifey. That's wifey. Thank you for the follow. It didn't. The spelling salute just makes me think about the one post about ripping fish snuffs off the slooty little oranges. I know for a fact Automod will get me for this one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it likes fish nets, apparently. Automod is okay with oranges. Zelda knows she's in the wrong. But if this steal stealing your sister's husband situation is bad, why does it feel so good? Okay, so we're in the process of, of her stealing stealing the husband. <laughs> oh, 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 Prime! Oh my goodness! Thank you! You were kind. I'm gonna do a up real quick. Thank you, thank you for the Prime! Right after the follow. That's very that's very kind. I appreciate it. So Zelda and Dustin are like the bad people in this family. <laughs> Thank you for the prime subby. I get all the emotes and stuff. 
Ooh, what if she gets... I think she should keep wearing the orange. She's got orange. Maybe this is a good orange. It's got to be something a little bit... A little bit revealing, maybe. I don't know that there's a lot of orange options other than custom content. <laughs> Just got a pic that Trixie Cosmetics is having a Valentine's Day sale. Well, there we go. She's the hippie type. Oh, you're right. I remember that now from from um from Sunset Valley. I haven't played Sunset Valley in a long time. This a Sunset Valley is a big town to play to try and play rotationally. I mean, most Sims Three towns are. See, like I feel like this could work too. Um. Oh, what about? Oh, wait. This this is the hippie type. This is good. This has got orange and stuff on it. I think I'm going to give her this. This feels right. Oh God, I dropped. I dropped my pen. I was fidgeting with my pen. You're one of my favorite YouTubers. I was just looking at this and thought, oh, neat. I watched all your streams. Oh, thank you. That's very kind. <laughs> Welcome in. Um, wait, how how does one even manage to play Sims through rotation? I feel like that's far more work than it's worth. It is a lot of work. You have to use some mods. There's mods you use you use to make it like to make these things called casts, casts, which are like essentially freeze the Sims households, and you have to like swap the casts between different houses that you're playing it's a whole thing it is a lot of work people do it and they like it but it's it's a lot i'm just testing out auto mod wouldn't catch some pretty egregious stuff but not biting yeah it's i don't know but <laughs> auto mod's confusing <laughs> so let's talk about being bitten by a snail <laughs> i'm gonna give her this outfit i think this is good I think that's a good one for her. That feels right. Okay. And then I also, I'm just going to fix her makeup real quick because I'm just going to take off. Everything's fine. I think I'm just going to take off this random blush. It kind of looks like I gave her a makeover already because her eye, her eyelids with the green, that's a custom. I don't know. And then same with little Kaylin. I don't know. Should I take off? Sometimes I think with, like, the teenagers, I'm like, maybe because she's, like, experimenting with makeup, she just puts too much blush on. I kind of don't like the look of it. Look at little Kaylin's eyes. Okay, so that's the crew. What, does he have a job? What's his deal? Unemployed. Okay. Well. His fear is... He has a fear locked in, I just realized. His fear is to fall in love with Ileana, or fall out of love. But also to talk to Kay. He wants to talk to Kaylin. What do you think they're gonna? What's he gonna talk to her about? Why, why does he want to talk to Kaylin? Interesting. I'm sorry. The bangs are making me auto mad. <laughs> oh no. Uh, they just want to be bitten. <laughs> And their clothes ripped off, or whatever. <laughs> oh, Parker's bio, sorry, you're right. I completely forgot about Parker's existence. I don't know if I love their hat. I know we went searching for a hat for Parker, but with this outfit, I don't know if I'm a fan. Parker wants to join the slacker career. Uh, what is, what is his deal? So he's sloppy, outgoing, active, playful, kind of grouchy, I guess. Parker believes his mom... Oh, take two. Parker believes his mom just has to take a chill pill. He'll get a job eventually. Right now, he seems more interested in a newfound buddy down the street. In that newfound buddy down the street. Who's his newfound buddy? This Now, he's in love with this Jamar kid, but that happened during story progression. I don't think that's got to do with... Whoever his buddy is. Is it Don? Don? He's friends with Don. Let me look at his memories to see like who he was friends with first. Because my story progression gives them lots of friends. So it's hard to say. Outfit is icky. <laughs> you think we should change his little outfit? Parker is not slain. Parker does seem like the name of a forgettable person. Sorry to any Parkers in chat. <laughs> Hateful. 
what do you think is like the most i was thinking about that the other day like names that you hear and you're just like it's it feels weird to try to imagine somebody looking at their baby and going your name is this like it there's some names that i'm just like how who who decides to name their kid that you know what i mean <laughs> like so the start progression doesn't actually work yes yeah, so it's a mod by um by lazy duchess is the creator's name and it does cause random events to kind of occur off screen that then affect the sims when you play them such as him falling in love with that other sim so let's see who's moved in Kaylin grew up well daisy dewey i don't know who this became besties with don i feel like the best friends with don was maybe something is that who it's supposed to be is about don he had kisses we had very first kiss with jamar is it supposed to be don hey there little dick <laughs> naming their kids dick People still naming children like that? I don't know. I don't... I mean, they might name him Richard. Mom desperately wants a grandchild named after her, but I'm like, sorry, Sonya. <laughs> I can't imagine a two-month-old named Sonya. <laughs> That's not too bad of a name. It's Don, probably, I guess. That's our best... Unless he's... It looks like he's besties randomly with Daniel. But also, like, besties with his family but they don't like him so also he's an adult which is interesting so he's not even like he's just an adult i feel i'm gonna be honest i feel like i could i could envision we'll see how things go but i feel like i could see parker becoming a townie <laughs> i could see parker being a townie one day It's not a bad name, but I personally don't like it. And her middle name is, I swear to God, is gay. Okay. That's fun. <laughs> That's a fun one. I think it's a lovely name. Yeah, a David. Interesting. You know what? I think mine is, is I don't, I don't know that I really, and I don't hate, but I, I just can't imagine naming a child Kevin. To me, I think the name Kevin is a weird one. Like just looking at a little baby and going, you are Kevin. You know what I mean? He's a swaggy boy. I guess he needs like a little bit more style, but also he feels like maybe he's a little immature. I hear Kevin and think Home Alone. <laughs> Name a grandchild gay after her. There you go. Naming a kid has to be the biggest pressure for me. Yeah, have you been not terrified? It'll turn out terrible, unforeseeable nickname. True. It's like you never know, like you could name your child something and then and I'm sorry to I know there's like people in chat who've mentioned that they're pregnant. I'm sorry this is going to unlock a new fear for you. But like, what if you name your child something and then there's like a celebrity by the same name that does a horrible thing. And so that that name is only ever associated with with that terrible thing that person did. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> that sucks. I guess that's why you got to name your kid a more generic name, maybe or a really, really unique name that nobody has. Right. I've always said there's this one lady in town who I always I don't know if she was like she was give her parents gave her this name or if she named herself this down the line. But her name, her, it's like one of those like nature names. So that's why I wondered if maybe she gave it to herself. But the, her name is Harvest, like like H, like Harvest, like the Harvest Vegetables. And I always thought that was such a pretty like nature name, Harvest. I didn't care. <laughs> There are many more male K names in Polish. I knew like seven dudes named Camille and they're all unhinged. That's funny. <laughs> that's that's funny. I always thought Harvest was cute. Um the only other one I really liked, there was a there was a kid in town named Jana. It was a girl named Jana, and her nickname was Johnny, which was always seemed like a fun nickname for a little girl to be called Johnny. It's kind of interesting. Yeah, Chad, Chad's a hard one. I don't know. Okay, what is this child wearing? Not child. What is this grown-ass man wearing? Maybe like one of these. I feel like this could be something. Yeah, you, Guy is also a weird one. That's a good point. Guy. A lot of called Bronwyn. Bronwyn. 
and literally translated it means white breast or white boob. That's funny. I've heard the name Bronwyn before. Boob. Hello, my name is Boob. Also, these could be good for him. Maybe one of these. Feels like he's still in his skater boy era and he needs to grow up. I'm going to grab a few of them because I don't know what's going to match with his silly little hat. I remember we were giving him this hat because he has a hat in The Sims 3. What about like this one because of the white? Unless I found a different hat or something. I like this one. Maybe we'll just find him a different hair. Yeah, that feels like... This feels like a dude bro, right? Like, this is a dude bro that needs to grow up a little bit. That one looked like Steve from Blue's Clues, the blue one. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Maybe he's got his shaggy boy hair still. I would give my children names that have different, definitely good meanings, both tidings. That's a good idea, yeah. Call him Fanny. <laughs> Which I don't mean ass elsewhere, but it means, oh, <laughs> that's funny. Maybe, he, I think he needs like a little emo boy hair. Or just a long hair. Or maybe, he, I wish he, this is like stoner. This feels like a stoner hat. I wish I had different colors of that one though. This is this one too, but this is like not his hair texture. Oh, there's these ones. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's a cutie. He's got he's got a fun little face on him. He's got a fun little face. Is that the is that word the slang for that in the UK? Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, I always thought latrine would be such a beautiful name if it wasn't already a word. Latrine. That's funny. I love the name Ariola, but if only it didn't mean what it does. Oh my god. I don't know what I'm doing with this child. I keep calling him a child because he looks like one. Did he have the Vidkin hair? No. Vidkin deserves better than that. Maybe he has this little bandana, this little tie back. Oh, there's also this hat. Or a ponytail? <laughs> Wait, Latrine or Latrina? That's a good grunt baby name. Uh, I must double check the meaning of the name because Leah literally means weary in Hebrew, and I feel like that that has manifested in my life unintentionally. That's funny. <laughs> Latrina Grunt is funny. Is this a custom save file? Yes, in a way. Yes, it's this is a a custom hood that is. Um, I have a link. I think I I fixed the link. Did I? Let's see. Did I, did I spell that right? Okay, that just does a link to... Sorry, that's a link to just my playlist. Is it that one? There we go. That's a link to the early Strange Town, but this is also early Pleasant View that the, that same creator made, that, that second link there. Um, yeah, it's supposed to be like Pleasant View and Strange Town, like, like a decade or two in the past. So it's kind of fun. Everybody's a little bit younger, and there's some ancestors that are alive. I feel like I'm taking too long. What if he has this hair? He's he's kind of cute. He's kind of just like a little cute guy. He's just kind of a little cute little stoner guy. That thing means desire for goodness or house of happiness. And that just feels hateful when you consider the depression I possess. <laughs> I think mine means like the listener or something like that. Samantha. Why are you in your, your son's room? Okay, let's actually play the video game. What if I have a wild concept is playing the video game. I might need to delete some of these trees, though, because they're in the way. I think I'm going to delete this one. I get a little annoyed when they're, the trees are in the way. There we go. There we go. Okay. Everybody's just standing here. What's going on? Is the... Oh, free will is off in this house. <laughs> What's going on? Everybody's just standing still. Okay, so he talked to her. Unfortunately, I didn't see what he talked about. What are we doing? Relax? Okay. Who's woohooing? Okay, the husband and wife are woohooing. Caitlin has a love for, for arts. 
Oh my gosh, look at all the plants in this room. This do you think Zelda shares this room with Kaylin? Is Kaylin available? Somebody wants to talk to Kaylin. This must be is this Zelda in Kaylin's room? And then this must be Parker's room up here. Uh, all my siblings and myself were named after Bible characters. <laughs> I love calling it Bible characters rather than just Bible names. Um, and if you look at Leah in the Bible, she was ugly and unwanted. Oh no! <laughs> what is happening? Did she she say no? Uh oh, wait, can she not get her? Oh, I think she can't get in here. Is that gossip? No, come here. Let me test. Can she not squeeze past? Yeah, she can't get in. Okay. I'm just gonna delete that. Oops. That's fine. Uh, sir? Well, we might be able to see where the son's immaturity maybe comes from. Uh, I always thought it was such a pretty set of meanings. Oh, the... Now your parents naming you after the ugly one? <laughs> oh no. Okay, Zelda? Zelda's trying to goose him. What is happening? Everybody's just sitting here staring at the man. Also, I saw their, their role-playing Sims 4. I, d I saw that. <laughs> I saw that. Earn 100k. She needs some charisma. Oh, and I just deleted her mirror. Maybe we'll put a wall mirror up for her to study in here. There we go. Also, I gotta change the time. Uh, or the day. Change set. We start on Saturday right now. Um. Guess I'll just let it be 2 a.m. still. It's kind of weird. Maybe I won't. Maybe I'll make it like 6 a.m. Just make it 6. That'll be a little bit easier. You wanna. Should I just give him the slacker career? Maybe I should. What are we doing? What is this? Chat. Leave her alone. She's literally sleeping. Go to, like, your room or something, dude. Even though it's 6 a.m. So, um, also one thing I just remembered. Sandra Goth and Caitlin are dating. Um, so that's a thing. <laughs> what was the... I googled my name and it said it's Latin origin and variant of French names Clara and Claire. Claire means bright and famous. Also the name of an Irish county with rolling hills, breathtaking coasts, and beautiful music. I'm neither bright nor famous or an Irish country. County. <laughs> Not yet. There you go. You could you could one day become an Irish county if you if you dream hard enough. <laughs> you know? For the longest time I thought my uh, parents named me after Sofa, and I accepted that I was named after a seat. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> also, hello. Hello, hello. <laughs> hello, Simi Mom. Welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Uh, so I don't really know, like, where we're going here. What we're doing. I'm gonna have you go to sleep. Not go to sleep. Go to the bathroom. Thank also, thank you for the follow. Hello, Lazy Taurus. <laughs> hello. Thank you for the follow. Apparently, my name is God is my judge, which God must not like me then. <laughs> oh no. Dina Caliente is no longer a family friend. Honestly, a crime. I played this one before. This family is crazy. Interesting. We're, I'm just starting this. So, the way for those that are like newer coming in, um, this hood is, I've, I've set it up as uh, what you might call like an Uber hood where you have the two different hoods together. One's a sub hood of the other. My main hood is Early Strange Town. And I've played Early Strange Town for a few rounds. I think we're, we did like maybe three or four rounds before I added Early Pleasant View on. So, but this is our first run through of Early Pleasant View attached to my Early Strange Town. Um, so we're kind of just like establishing everybody in Pleasant View right now. I, I just, I don't know where our storylines are going yet, so we're kind of seeing what's going on. I uh, Like I said, when we played the goth household, Cassandra ended up dating Kaylin. So, 
Um, that's kind of interesting. Maybe it is Saturday. Maybe Caitlin should go on for a walk or go out on a little date with Cassandra and get out of the house. Um, what are you doing, sir? I have a feeling he was trying to woohoo with somebody. This girl, Zelda, is sleeping. Um, I don't know. I don't know where we're... Also, he's a family sim. Does he have, like, a secondary anything? He doesn't. I was just curious. It's interesting as a family sim, he cheated. She's a Zelda's a pleasure sim. Parker is a romance sim? Also, what is your reshare? That's a good question. I think... Let me see. I think under this link... Let me double check. I'm pretty sure I have it listed here. Yeah, I have the one that I... It's, it's my own little personal reshade that I, I made myself. Um, It's literally... It's just like some basic like vibrancy and levels and stuff. Yeah, no problem. I like it to be really lightweight for playing. How about we have... I'm gonna have... Where's a phone? Is There must be... Here we go. Let's ask out on date. Let's ask Cassandra out on a date for the heck of it, because I don't know what else to do. She's a family sim, so maybe she'll... This house is very pretty. I think it turned out... It looks really nice. Um, let's go to Community Lab. The, the creator made this house again, um, like the other one we were in. And it's really nice. It, it they, they did a really good job with it. Oh, she's doing a shy dance. Look at Kaylin's shy dance. Oh, Kaylin knew we were watching. Also, look at look at her skirt. There's all kinds of little broken hearts, and or, or is it just like elect? I think those are broken hearts on her skirt. <laughs> that's kind of funny. That's a very like that feels very like emo era. <laughs> Should I get a salad? All I had for lunch was a cup of ramen. I'm not full at all. Salad is always good. I think salad is always good. Maybe sh maybe they'll go to the Strange Town Diner for a date. Go to Strange Town. That's true. They do look like chemistry bolts. Maybe that's what it is. Also, the salsa music playing in the background is always a mood. <laughs> it's always a very strong mood. I haven't eaten all my cookies yet. I have like one and a quarter left. God, I just looked up and saw Robin's message. God has seen your chat history. <laughs> Imagine you go, you're you're at the the pearly gates, and they just pull up a, a printout of your all of your chat history, which you get through <laughs> looking at bog water. <laughs> Not to call Bogwater out of <laughs> out of work. <laughs> uh, let's have them. Uh oh, wait, where's our date? Oh, she's here. Okay, I didn't see her. <laughs> the salad is out of avocados. I've never had an avocado salad. None of us are going to heaven. <laughs> yeah, bong of us are going to heaven. These girlies are both family sims. I feel like that could be really interesting. What do you think they're going to gossip about? Is that a little burp? Who is who's in this bubble? Is that burp grunt? Also, this is Mr. This is a young Buzz Grunt, who actually his name is Barber Grunt because of he, how he got married. <laughs> They're gonna gossip about your mom. <laughs> oh, who does who do you think that was? Does she know whoever she's talking about? Oh, right here. Oh, it's Orion Nigmos. Okay, it's one of the Nigmos kids. Okay, what else do they want to do? I guess we could do a little slow dance. Oops, not take my picture. Although that could be kind of fun. I'm gonna do a little slow dance. I know, talking shit about Burpee. Actually, I think they're they're talking shit about Orion. But also, like, what did Orion do? Orion. Didn't it? Is Orion? I think I said. 
Donald Lothario. <laughs> I just looked over and said, Donald Lothario. I'm doing my creative work, not paying attention to chat. That's okay. It's good to it's good to do creative work. What if we went to the diner and slow danced? <laughs> I start. Hello. What else do you want to do? Play with Cassandra. I think we all know what play with Cassandra means. Have pillow fight. Oh wait, she doesn't want to dance. She wants. I mean, she doesn't want to. Oh, <laughs> the uh, I actually hit take picture. Cassandra is just like inside of Kaylin. Who is this random girly? Patty Fowler. Okay, Patty Fowler. What is what if what if Cassandra takes a picture of Kaylin's butt? Because that's a thing. Um, let's do play. Pillow fight. That's not how you take a picture. <laughs> Obviously, you just pull out your iPhone and hit the camera app. Uh, duh. You're gonna take a picture of my jugs. <laughs> you wouldn't want a date with a beautiful woman. <laughs> just the pictures of, of boobs. Okay, they want a kiss. We do. do. Do romantic. Okay, you can stop now. I want them to have a pretty decent date before we sit them down to eat. Because whenever you sit them down to eat, they like, they end up, <gasps> is that Hank? <gasps> it's Mr. Hank. We haven't seen Hank in a while. Hank's got a new do. Hank's got himself a new do. It's Hank, the butler. We haven't seen Hank in so long. That's why I was saying I miss my strange townians. We haven't seen him in so long. I need to play, I need to play early strange view a little more often. She's looking at me all nervous, like, because she had to do the thing. Is Hank? Is Hank? Flirt. Uh, I don't know. Hold hands. Okay. Maybe we'll go on our little date. Uh, go on our, like, sit down and eat. After they do a few things. <laughs> Everybody loves the Hank. Everybody's into Hank. I have a mind that only allows them to pillow fight if they're near a bed. I like that. That's cool. That's like... Excuse me. That's like the one that only lets them dance if they're near a radio. <laughs> Cassie, Cassie likes booty. What? Could, what? You, what? You, are you you kink shaming Cassie? Okay, these guys are doing pretty good. Oh, what are they? Oh, they're they're massaging. Cassie's a woman with taste. Yes. Somebody's woohooing in this in the background. Who do you think is going to step out of here? I don't know who's in there. This was just bouncing around. Somebody's woohooing in this right now. If I took a pillow on an IRL date, that would be weird. <laughs> just want a pillow fight. Is it Hank? <laughs> I'm afraid. It's Glo- <laughs> It's Glade Curious and Buzz Grunt. Buzz Barber Grunt. There are things in this world that we will never fully understand. Uh, understand. Uh, we want answers. Look at how cute she is. We have worked years to build our credibility. Our reputation. She's desperately every. How come it's always her? I am very uncomfortable with the energy that we created in the studio. Remix. <laughs> Remix. Gla Glaive is messy. Gla Glaive is very messy. Okay, these two are making out. I'm gonna have them go ahead. Be seated. Have them do their little thing. Her eyes, I know she was so excited. <laughs> I got I got what you meant, Sandwich. I was reading it while I was chewing. I was like, okay, translation? No, I got it. Yeah, I know. It seems like so many times. So many times. And the Sims you aren't controlling or behaving <laughs> or having a juicier time. I know. 
It's like these two are just. Uh, what is? Look at look at these glasses, Cassie. Cassie's glasses are breaking the rules. <laughs> Okay, they look okay from this angle, I guess. Medic. <laughs> Medic. <laughs> it's like chugging a little bit. It's like maybe there's somebody loading in. Buzz is a bad husband, but so is Glaive is a wifey. I don't remember if Glaive got divorced yet. <laughs> the real orange sloot was Glaive all along. You're right. <laughs> You're right. That's so true. This lady, I swear to God, this lady is undercover. Hattie Fowler. Ma'am? She's hiding her identity. She is hiding from someone in Strange Town. This is suspicious. <laughs> Speaking of, um... Dun, dun. I love I love the X-Files sound. I haven't watched X-Files in too long. I need to watch X-Files more. Maybe she's an alien hiding her eyes. Um, speaking of X-Files, I downloaded... Somebody shared in the Discord um, somebody who had made um, Mulder and Scully. Agent Mulder and Agent Scully for The Sims 2. I feel like they should be in this hood as well as Calicundia. I feel like that's my, my constant is Sc Mul S Scully and Mulder being in, in my hoods, because they were in my other strange view. <laughs> I was wondering why I had X-Files content on my Tumblr. It was you, and I was less confused then. <laughs> That's funny. I've, my my, my X-Files fandom is, is leaking out. <laughs> Smully and Calder? <laughs> Calder and Mully? Word? <laughs> I would... <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> Why is that so funny? <laughs> Wait, that's because I moved in my chair at the same time. <laughs> that's funny. Uh oh, the time's running out. They're not even eating yet. Um, order? They're, they're, it's gonna be over. I promise I didn't. <laughs> Donut school and fog moldy? That's fun. I like that. What do you mean? It wasn't messing up the gas all this time. <laughs> I would never. Okay, are we not getting to order? Um, these two I landed on thick. <laughs> Maybe it isn't all of getting sprayed by skunks. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Damn it, we didn't even get to eat. And the date's over. Um, excuse us. <laughs> We're trying to end our date and these two are cheating. Look at these two. My god. Our messy, strange townians. How dare they? I know I was so distracted by the, by the, by the, 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 the cheaters. Smelly sun gas, not sun gas. <laughs> Y'all are hateful. Y'all are hateful. <laughs> what is that stance, Glaive? This is the, I'm gonna cheat. This is the homewrecker stance. This is the home wrecker stance. <laughs> All right, I guess we'll go home then. We had our date. Oops, I hit the wrong button. Oh, is there not a walk home option? Oh, paying paid dining bill and leave. We didn't get to eat. She got their fancy leg out. 
Do you know what mod it is for townies to do their own stuff? Do you mean like romance like that? Because I think most of that that romance that was happening is because of ACR, the auto autonomous a autonomous romance casual autonomous casual romance is really what I think sets that off. I'm pretty sure. We're gonna go home. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that would be the main thing that's causing all of that. Um, but obviously I think, as far as I know, it kind of just functions on the existing chemistry system in the game, too. But... They see this ankle and the boys come running. I know, maybe we were wrong about Zelda's outfit, because that's the exact outfit Zelda, ha Zelda had, so like... Maybe this is the homewrecker outfit. We were wrong. Oh, Caddy, not you too. Caddy, I had hopes for you. Caddy, I had hopes for you. Look at these two girlies. But I think it's fun because they're- I feel like these two are gonna have lots of kids, because they're both family sims. They're just gonna, like, adopt the whole town. I like this diner a lot, too. You know what I think, if I recall correctly? So I downloaded this diner. I didn't make it. And I'm pretty sure somebody who- the person who made it said it was based on the Life is Strange diner. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be like the life- the one from Life is Strange. I think, I think. If I remember correctly. Are these all teens here? No, there's a couple of- these two are adults. Horror prototype error. Uh, sorry? Uh... She's in the- Caddy is a PI sent by Buzz's wife, maybe. I keep seeing these ads. Uh-oh. I remember this being an issue before. I think that was an issue before when I swapped out- what was that? I forgot what caused that. I think it had to do with my story progression going back in and out. I think it'll be okay. I think she'll just be back home. Just letting us leave us up too. I think I think it'll be okay. I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be okay. Don't don't panic. Nobody panic. It's okay. I want to add that sound. I love that sound. I've heard it be around on other streams. It's the one that's um. <clears throat> the I don't know what it's from, but it's called, yeah. Her date won't be saved. I'm pretty sure it's not a big deal. That was just like a funny little extra thing. We'll see. Um, but isn't it, it's the one like no? I'm panicking. I am no. Don't panic. I'm panicking. I am something like that. I feel like we need a good panicking sound effect. Yeah, I don't think the date happened. Yeah. Well. That means technically none of the dating happened. You know what? That error? That error was made by Glaive so that all of her cheating gets absolved. That's what just happened. Glaive did that on purpose. Glaive did that on purpose. Alright, well... <laughs> I guess here we are. Whose work is here? Your work. You gotta get up. Oh no! Not this! Don't do this to me! The pink flashing! I was gonna say, she didn't want to get caught cheating, yeah. Sins have been forgiven, but not forgotten. Yes. Oh god, let's- oh god. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh, I might have to do a little restart. Oh no, oh no. It's spreading, it's spreading. Okay. <laughs> I gotta do a little restart. Should we watch a machinima or something while we do a little restart? Well, my game doesn't take very long to load most of the time. I don't know what. I'm going to get the game loading and then we'll... Wow, yours took 43 minutes. Is that from what screen? Is that like when you're loading the hood or the household? Or is... We'll just get this going so that I know it's like getting going here. So I've been quiet. I'm sorting out my Sims 2 season. You're okay. <laughs> I, I know the, the pain of sorting out the CCs. Yeah, 43 minutes is long. That's for loaded. So like this screen, loading this main game. Wow. So it must be the CC. I've got over 70k CC. Wow. 
Yeah, I like to keep it light most of the time with my CC. I, a while back, I got rid of a ton of my custom hair and stuff, and that helped a lot. I've been sticking to some custom hairs and mostly defaults. Surprise pit in my cherry. Oh no. Surprise bing bong in my cherry. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I used to make machinima so I didn't get rid of stuff I needed. Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> I used to make machinima so I didn't I didn't want a bing bong. But spot, please. Get rid of a bing bong. I need bing bong. <laughs> but spot. <laughs> Surprise bing bong in my cherry. I should probably screenshot that one, huh? Let me screenshot that one. I'm just gonna get us to the neighborhood screen and then we'll watch the machinima because this is the screen that does sometimes give me trouble like it is right now because I clicked off wait for a response I gotta get past this one and then we're it's smooth sailing smooth sailing I haven't had pink flashing a whole lot recently so there that was not a bad thing in this world that we will never yeah, fully we'll understand. Understand. understand we want, we want answers, answers. We have worked years minutes. to wow, build okay. our credibility. Our reputation. Now reputation. Oh, she got choppy at the end there. I heard a choppy at the end. Okay. You're going to die up there. I shouldn't. I'm Katya. <laughs> I'm Katya. Okay, there we go. Then once we just get into the hood, we'll be okay. Boom. I'm gonna let her load up. Those must be comfortable shoes. I bet you could walk all day in shoes like that and not feel a thing. Uh, there we go. I wish I had shoes like that. <laughs> oh, she, she's in the background there. That was a quick load. I, I'm curious about the Mr. Humble trespasses. I know we have others to watch, though. Buffy the Vampire Slayer. We watched this one. That one was good. That's the the that one's a. I think this might be a long one. We have watched the Vine ones. Do we miss any Vampire Academy Sims Two trailer? Prologue scene from the novel. Okay. We watched this one. Lost preview. Okay. I'm trying to go up see if I missed any. There was also this one, Legend of Zelda. I'm kind of intrigued by the Mr. Humble one. Oh, and this one, this one was Sims 3. I'm gonna go, I think I'm gonna watch the, the Mr. Humble one. Oop, sorry for the scroll. Content warning hillbilly. Oh, I'm in, I'm in the video. No, pause. I said to pause. Well, Okay. <laughs> you don't have to know anything about Lost to Enjoy the the one. Okay, <laughs> good to know. I'll definitely have to have to to look into her earlier. Everyone loves Mister Humble, or do they? Yeah, I know Canadian Pride Eight. <laughs> Canadian Pride. This is a video I've been working on several months back for Machinima.com. However, newer projects have kept my attention, so I don't have time to complete it. It is still largely unedited, not many SFX, though I figured it was good enough to release to the public. Enjoy. CP. So 2011. So it's not that old. It's not too old. It's only two minutes long. Let's see. Oops. Oh, no, I actually opened up Photoshop. <laughs> not Photoshop. Why is it always Photoshop? Go away. <laughs> Go away. <laughs> Every time I click over. <laughs> Photoshop, please. <laughs> Photoshop, please. It won't stop. Photoshop, please. <laughs> God damn it. Here we go. Canadian Pride. Mr. Humble Trespasses. Rough edit. Okay. Mr. Humble. I haven't seen Mr. Humble in so long. Also, I forgot to do full screen. I haven't seen Mr. Humble in so long because I have the mod that gets rid of him. The view it's Clip Studio Paint. I also have Clip Studio Paint, I'm pretty sure. Oh, 
<laughs> this is great. This is great. sometimes. My pappy. <laughs> oh my redneck Ryan Lance humble Mr. Humble is Canadian pride okay momthesims2.com <laughs> that was fun I know loud gun <laughs> loud gun that was fun I'm we're gonna do a thumbs up on her that was good <laughs> you know I always wondered what might occur if humble ran afoul of a less than friendly neighbor Back. <laughs> this was, this was good. I liked that one. I liked that one. I'm now like, what just happened? <laughs> that was a good. One. It was a little little quickie. It was a little quickie, but I liked that one. Oh no, not my Photoshop. Look at my Sim stuff. It's the cursed. Wait, it's the cursed Dreamer edit. It's my cursed Dreamer edit. You want look? <laughs> there she is. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't need that up close. <laughs> okay. Anyway. Eyeballs. <laughs> anyway, back to this household. God damn. Also sound. Please know I must sleep soon. <laughs> it's okay, you'll sleep fine. If you keep all of the windows closed, you'll be fine. No, it, it can't hurt you. And you keep your feet underneath the covers, it can't touch you. It's okay. <laughs> I hated it, thank you. <laughs> Somehow worse when it's zoomed out. Yeah, I think so. I have to sleep soon, but it's it's still I still played it. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, please, video game. Oh my god. Wait for program to respond. Oh boy. Anyway. I might skip forward a little. I don't remember what time it was when we left the date. But I might skip forward the date just a little bit. Skip forward the day so we don't have to like replay the same day. I'll just put it like afternoon time. <laughs> Angel's Angel's eyes. Dreamer's eyes remind me of when the angels of Supernatural die. I tried to make them glow like when you take a picture of like an animal or like you shine a light at an animal. <laughs> it should go back to when she left the lot. Yeah, I think. Um, well, I don't know. It was showed 9 a.m. Yeah, see, it's 9 a.m. Saturday, which I. Th yeah, when she left the lot, which I don't really want to because we were. I have the story progression so that it makes it, it's supposed to have a time sink and the whole thing. I think I'm going to make it like 6 p.m. No, because it wasn't dark yet, was it? Let's make it. I don't know. 4 p.m. And she's definitely not in the vents. Yeah. I still need to go down into the. Maybe I need to. Oh, no, I should have. Maybe I should have. I'll do that tomorrow or something. I need to go. Back down into the basement of my grandmother's house. <laughs> Just need to take a creepy picture down there for the next, for the for the new version of. 
Is Zelda available? Yes. Oh, actually, Zelda's at work. Zelda's not available. Uh, are these two fooling around? What happened? 4 p.m. I'm gonna give them some energy. Oh my god. Have them be awake. Sponsored by Grandma. <laughs> Imagine Dreamer as an elder. I know. One day she's gonna be, though. And it's gonna be wild. All of our... Imagine, it'll be it'll be so weird when, like, the first gen born to the founders are all old and dying. Like, that's, that's gonna be scary. That's scary. Okay. I know Crystal Beth will be dying. What, imagine the day that Crystal Beth dies in game, not real Crystal Beth. <laughs> you know what I mean. Same with you know. <laughs> I am immortal, actually. Okay. <laughs> you keep telling yourself that. It's okay. Um, I don't know what to do. I guess I'll have some some food. I feel like this household would have a maid. Maybe we should have him hire a maid. Oh, answer? Wait, silent mode? I guess, let me just have him answer and like hang up. <laughs> I will have many f up kids with Chuby. That's gonna be a, a trip. Oh wait, is that Zelda now? Oh, that's Zelda now, Never mind. Okay, sorry, I screwed up the... I screwed up the, the call thing. I'm gonna give her energy too, just because it's like things get all goofed up. He wants to go on a date. I guess he could he could go on a date now. I guess. I don't know. Maybe he'll invite his lover over here. Do they have like they have like a backyard with nothing? I feel like they need a hot tub. Oh. I found some new places to go out downtown. Oh god, I'm gonna end up with pig soup again. Let's go. <laughs> so Zelda May just got invited downtown by Danny. By Daniel Pleasant. <laughs> Are both of their kids homo of homos of sexuals? I believe they might be. I think they might be. I, oh my gosh, pay her. Pay her. Uh, Are we taking, we're just taking us. <laughs> Thank you so much, Pear. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. And also, thank you for the follow. <laughs> thank you. The orange sleuths are colliding. True. What's she trying to do? Tell a dirty joke. Are we gonna go downtown? Maybe somewhere that's less scary? Somewhere that's a little more low-key? My game's gonna explode again. It's gonna suck. Go to the lanes. I don't know. Eepy olive. Subby time. Salsa goes unreasonably hard. I love the salsa music. I love it. <laughs> also, well, it was subby and follow. <laughs> I guess both. I guess both. Beware of the pink soup. I know. Uh, maybe because we're freshly in, it's, it'll be safe. Also, like I said, I turned my my lot edges like way down. That's supposed to help. I'm so scared. <laughs> As I'm dancing to this, I'm terrified. <laughs> my coffee's cold. See, that's the thing is deleting thumbnails causes it to causes them to regenerate, which for me. Generating thumbnails causes pink flashing. Okay. See, this big monster is something that causes issues for me. Um, I'm going to turn decorations off. Let's do that for now. I don't like to do that. I also don't like turning off neighbors, but maybe I could do that too. Just for now. Just we'll, we'll stay a little bit safer here. We'll just stay zoomed in. I just really don't want to go to business law class. Not Herbal. Herbal has arrived. Oh god. Now it's all downhill. Herbal Old Spice has, has entered. 
He brought Herb and he brought Laura Sue Cole, who's like a generic downtowny, I, I think. I'm very uncomfortable with the energy that we've created in the studio today. He brought just he just brought all of wait, Danny just brought all of his lovers. Cause we have we have Loki. We have well Herb and him aren't lovers. But he brought Loki this is not Loki either. <laughs> wait. <laughs> okay, we're, 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 rewind. Rewind. Everything is bad. Bjorn, we brought Bo Bjorn, Bella, and Grania. These are three of his lovers. <laughs> yeah, him and her aren't lovers yet. True. Okay. Everybody's swooning. Also, Bjorn was swooning over Herbie. <laughs> He's not afraid. Okay. Grania's into us. Oh my god, she's into Grania. It's chaos. I do need to come and, I guess, put a, a, a lot skirt, like a hood skirt on <laughs> the OG group. I, I gotta put like a hood skirt on, on this world. That way, at least when I have everything off, it looks okay. Take me. I know I heard that for a minute. <laughs> Are these two woohooing? They're woohooing. This is literally an orgy group. Like, you are not wrong. <laughs> this is a new bop, though. <laughs> With these guys wooing. You think he'd just, like, auto woohoo with us? Oh, wait, I gotta... We can't pause it right now. This is an important song. Oh my god, that scared me. Oh, oh there we go. <laughs> Four employees at this bowling alley, I know. What is that? She just sent me a weird face. Danny boy, come here. Look at that Danny dance. Danny boy. Oh no, I paused it again at a good part. I'm sorry. Will I woohoo? Yeah, let's woohoo with Danny Boy. Let's just go for it. It's a good song. <laughs> Who's this old lady? Now I I gotta. Oh no. <laughs> Who is she? <laughs> Who is she? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh my being bunk Danny and Drag! <laughs> Danny and Drag when his little eye his his blue on eyelashes are drooping. <laughs> Wait, but like the jeans coming out there of the skirt. There are things in this world that we will never fully understand. Understand. <laughs> too much. We want answers. Oh no. We have worked years to build our credibility. This is scary. Our <laughs> reputation. Those must be comfortable shoes. I bet you could walk all day in shoes like that and not feel a thing. I could turn on the sound a little. I wish I had shoes <laughs> like that. <laughs> mean Girls Virginia George cut out boob top. Oh no. <laughs> well, these two fooled around. Uh, she wants to play on a couch. <laughs> Titty Clippin is my new drag name. <laughs> Strong sensory overload. I'm sorry. That was all. Yeah, there was a lot happening for a moment there. Uh, I just want to do some romance with the Danny boy since we're here. I don't really want to go on a full-on date. Maybe she needs to hook up with some of these other folks. Like, who else could she- maybe she needs to talk to Loki? Or Bjorn? I keep calling him Loki. Like, I feel like this is just a free-for-all orgy club. Like, is- uh oh here comes Crumple Bottom. Is Crumple Bottom gonna beat Danny? No. Okay. I'm gonna have her flirt. 
checks him out. Bing bong like a cunt bing bong, to be honest. Titty clipping like a tippy sniffing. I know, right? <laughs> that sounded like I just... Anybody who heard me say that and read that out, anybody who heard me read that out without knowing what's what I'm reading, it's like, thinks they just had a stroke or something. <laughs> Titty Clippin is Tippy Sniffin's drag name. You're right. Oh, Marilena. I thought that was Mary Sue for a second. I got scared. General Chip's here. <laughs> it sounded like you were having an aneurysm. Yeah. <laughs> it's terrible. These two getting along. Oh. Herbie and Bella. Look at them. We need to greet Herbie. Oh, she's got... She's got Herbie... Okay, good enough. You talked enough. I just want to have her to check him out. Okay, she's into B Bjorn. Bjorn is into Herbie. Uh, let's check out... Okay, she has three bolts with Bjorn. She's, this is literally Zelda. Zelda is like... Uh-oh. Did Herbie just say you to us? I'm sorry? Is Marilyn here to, to get even with Glaive? Maybe. Or... Maybe she's here to find Glaive. She's like, I heard that there was an orgy meeting at the bowling alley, and I assumed my wife was here. <laughs> I assumed I needed to show up here because my wife is probably here, but she's not. <laughs> you know, like, Herb has the right to judge. Is there a way to make uh, a custom sim act like Miss Crumpenbottom? I need one for Calicondia, whose name is Automod. That's funny. I don't think there's a way... I don't think so, unfortunately. <clears throat> that would be really cool if you could. Okay, Zelda. Okay, this, um, this feels Zelda coded, like, this hippie girly. Did she check him out? Get up. Oh, they're, they're like, chatting? I don't know what's happening. I want her to check out. I didn't see what happened. Oh, not fight. No. Let me pause. Checks him out. Okay, I think she was into him. She's also hungry. I'm gonna make her a little less hungry so we can do stuff. Let's see what happens when we charm. Herb just looked right at me. Hello, Herbal. Mr. Herbal is my man. Mr. Herbal is my man. Attraction? Um, can we do a peck? I think he'd just go for it, right? <gasps> we got rejected by Herbal. He doesn't know us enough. Let's do... Let's see. Casual woohoo. Wait, let's... Will I woohoo? Sure, I'm game. He's gonna woohoo with us, though. You know what? This isn't about romance. This is about woohooing. This is a woohoo club. This is the woohoo club. That's what this is about, you know? Herb said, no, this isn't about getting to know each other. This is about you know what. Now we gotta see the herb, the, the mixture of the herb. Oh god. <gasps> Wait, she just shoved him out? Wait. <laughs> Ma'am? <laughs> She's the one that asked him. And now we're gonna. Okay, so. Oh, Daniel? Look at Danny Boy heading on in. Sir? Are you just walking by, Danny? 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 <laughs> he keeps getting knocked over. <laughs> Danny? <laughs> Danny? <laughs> he keeps getting bumped. We're playing ping pong with Danny boy. He's trying his hardest. <laughs> He's going somewhere. <laughs> he, uh, is that Glaive? No, that's Holly. It looks like Glaive from the back. <laughs> Let him cook. <laughs> Let him cook. Oh my god. Now where did Herbal go? Where did Herbie go? Oof. My game's chugging a little. Oh, he's over here. This- the song- all the songs at this- this bowling alley are good. I'm gonna do like macro socialize romantic and get these two just kind of started. You know, we gotta do a Herbie crossover, you know what I mean? We gotta do a Herbie crossover. Good night, Danny! Thank you for hanging out. Sleep well. And don't let the, the 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 roaches bite. I was trying to make a Sims reference, but it didn't really pan out. <laughs> oh, 
Don't let the don't let the the monstrous dreamer find you. <laughs> Damn, it's 3 a.m. already. Oh no. Uh oh, I don't know if these two are getting along. I don't think he wants us that bad. Maybe it'll be time for us to go soon. Y'all keeping me awake. Here it's 4 a.m. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. For me, it's 4 p.m. Wait, that's interesting. So it's 4 p.m. here for me, so it's like exactly like 12 hour difference. Interesting. I don't think these two have very good chemistry. 9 p.m. for you. That's not terrible. That's a little late. Okay, they're starting to get along, though. Maybe we'll just have to pursue a Herbie relationship. Let me turn on the sound a little. It's loud in this place. Yeah, exactly opposite. It's interesting. It's 2 p.m. for you. Okay. So you're a little earlier. 10 p.m. Okay. 10 p.m. for moi. Okay. 3 p.m. Okay. Also a little earlier. <laughs> Wait a minute. I read that for a sec trying to figure out, like, what is going on? <laughs> Sticky buddy. This stream has been scheduled to last for 20 hours. No, it has not. <laughs> no, it has not. <laughs> the fear. The fear in my eyes. <laughs> I thought you were... When I first read it, I thought... I thought it was say I thought you were saying something about it like my schedule was written up wrong. Like I had written something wrong. <laughs> I was like, what did I do? <laughs> okay, I think I might have her go. I'm gonna end. We had some fun. <laughs> it was like <laughs> you got me. Rule. <laughs> I love this girly. She's pretty cool. I like her little fishnets. I do like Zelda. I feel like she could be a fun character. I feel like, you know what, I feel like Zelda looks like she should be living in Strange Town. You know what I mean? She feels like she's Strange Town vibes. Like, she needs to get herself with a Strange Townian. But she's not a romance sim, she's a pleasure sim. Look at Mrs. Crumplebottom sitting down. Okay, Miss Crumplebottom. Take a load off, queen. I guess I gotta call a taxi, huh? That was a really good time. Thank you. Just trying to eat. Now everybody's holding her hostage. Okay, there we go. All right. Well, that was kind of an event. Here's hoping that that's true. Oh, no. You're right. <gasps> that's why I want her to walk, though. Why can't she walk? If she walks, she'll be fine. Why can't I make her walk? I know that they won't let her walk because of... If I get one of those walking signs, can I do it? Yeah, I know she came here by taxi. But isn't there a- there's like a sign you can use. But it's like, I wish I could force it. This- this one. Because then I know that- that- no, it won't let me. Ah, oh, damn it. Because it won't work. I forgot about the error. I forgot what causes the error. Because we won't- this- none of this will be saved. Well, let me click the sign. And walk to lot isn't an option anywhere. Go home. It's not gonna work. It's gonna glitch out. This sucks. <laughs> I don't know. I can't remember what caused that. There was something. And I forget, it happened last time I swapped out story progression or something. Why doesn't it glitch on the- I don't know. You have to leave- yeah, I don't- I don't know. It- that's true. I don't know why leaving the home lot doesn't glitch. You're right. You're right. Let's hope. Let's hope and pray. Maybe it'll work. Oops. It was a conflict somewhere, and I can't remember what the conflict was. Was it one of the... There it is. 
Did it have to do with the computer? Remember, it was like a thing with the Monique's hacked computer thing. Yeah, reset just... I think it was the computer. You're right, turn off testing cheats. That's a good idea. Oops, I got pause. There it goes again. No, reset. Wait, I forgot that. I thought it was pause. I think she's a little false. Okay. Okay, they're off. We gotta let it. You don't have any problems. Weird. Because there was one part of the Monique's hack computer, there was a particular controller that caused errors. Nope, she's just reloading. It's stuck. It's just a loop. Is it just it just like auto reset itself. I go I can just go can I just what if I just go. That's annoying. That's okay. We know it happened. I mean, we can easily just invite, like, I can just either force the relationship or just invite him back over. It's gonna take me to Strange Town. Let me do this. I gotta go back to Pleasant View. I wonder... It, I think... Well, I don't have the Community Time mod in. Um... I swapped out, I put story progression back in and took community time out. Um, let me reload them again. What time was it when we left? Was it, it was probably like almost midnight or something. Maybe she was just blacked out for the whole date. That's true. That's true. I could give her a, a memory or something. I don't know. Yeah, she doesn't have any memory, right, of the woohoo, no. That's lame, so we just gotta remember that right now I can't go... Um... I can't... Well, uh... I don't know. That's okay, we'll just- we'll just stay on this lot- well, actually, I can go if I walk. If I have the sims walk, it's okay. But other than that... Now she got a hold of some good kush. <laughs> so it's 6 p.m. now. Let's let's once again let's alter the time. How about it's how about we make it she gets home Sunday 2 a.m. Sure. Why not? What? Oh, okay. Y'all are out here. These two are chilling. This has been a goofy time. This has been a goofy time with this household. I just don't feel like constantly replaying them. Let me just have them like sleep a little. Also, I'll turn on my testing cheats again. But oh, that's that's true though, because I have, well, because I have my testing cheats off, I can't like drag needs. So I have to, I have to be the old fashioned way. I have to play the old fashioned way. But yeah, maybe she, she was too blazed to remember it. That's how she got here, yeah. Did you uh, think they were about to bing bong on the ground? I didn't know what was happening. I couldn't figure out why she was on the corner of the lot. Oh, she likes dance, music, and dance. What is her lifetime wish, Rock God? What is your lifetime wish? Business? His? Children. Professional party guest. Golden anniversary. I think I'm gonna give him the slacker career. When he gets up. Pocket full of sunshine. Came out in 2008 and suddenly I feel old. Interesting. So it, what, what expansion pack did that come with then? But that, was that like a a part, in 2008, I mean, that was almost right before Sims, because Sims 3 comes out in 2009. So it must have been one of the last expansions, right? That's interesting. It's 
free time. Okay. It was okay. That's interesting. I'm not great about knowing all of the things that come with all the different expansions because I've gotten so used to having them all with the ultimate collection thing. Hello, I have returned after about an hour. Have I missed much? You were just starting the Langorak set. Okay. Not really because we've had we had we had to shut down the game because of a pink flashing and a reload that we also had to <clears throat> I'm having errors when my sims leave the lot when my sims leave a community lot with a taxi I keep getting errors and so I keep losing all the progress so like we kind of haven't made much progress because I've lost everything I've done so far <laughs> so here we are we're gonna try and just stay on the lot and do things um this girl is hungry. I'm hoping that Kaylin wow. made a group meal. Yeah, I don't know if the... I'm, I'm gonna do... I'll have to run it through... What if... What if I do this? Let's do... We're gonna... We're gonna go on an adventure while the Sims are eating. Let's see. Let me do... Let's search... Is it logs? No. Isn't it with the what caused? I can do the what caused this. Downloads folder. This is no... Am I confused? Oh, select log. There we go. Let's see, that was this, this was the most recent one. Let's just proceed anyway. See what it comes up with. Oh, maybe because the game is still running, it won't let me. Ah, it won't let me. The function main, it's the car, something with the car. I don't know, sorry. We went, we, we tried. We'll take job. <laughs> I'll have to wait. I thought maybe just because I could, um... They did for Katy Perry's Hot and Cold with Apartment Life, and that's what I was picturing in my head. Oh, okay. We made an official music video, yeah. I think we've watched the official one. Daddy, Daddy Lingerick's sluttiness was too much for the game to handle. You're an autumn and could have decorate- should have decorate accordingly. Okay. Ma'am, you need- you guys need to get in here. Alright, well, it's Sunday morning. Ileana doesn't have to work today. He's not employed at all. So, it's kind of interesting, so he's, like, got a little bit of a John Burp thing going on, where he's, like, stay-at-home family dad. Is this face- this is probably facing the wrong way, isn't it? Still praying for Mommy Langerak. <laughs> there you go. Kaylin's- oh, she's a little bit shy still, but she's not too bad. <laughs> what? <laughs> I like how Butt Spot- <laughs> Butt Spot perfectly censored that. <laughs> Stay at home and bing bong her sister dad. That was funny. Not the sister dad. So she- so let's look at- I'm curious about the memories. Ileana graduated. When did- So she only made out with Dustin. Parker grew up badly. Made out with Dustin. So she's only ever made out with Dustin? She's never- oh. Yeah, had first kiss with Dustin. 
fell in love with Dustin. Ileana went to college. Ileana graduated, grew up well. So this was when she was like a teenager or a young adult? So I guess when they were younger, they had like a sh Dustin and her had a thing. Parker is their son. This is Parker. Oh, wait, him sitting, wait, him sitting down on the ground playing the video games is so good. They never, they almost never do this. It's because I guess something's wrong with the chair. Look at him sitting down on the, playing his video games. <laughs> Parker is the older son. Oh, she got demoted. And she also does have the extra want slots. Um, so she has a bad memory of Zelda moving in. Like joining the family. She got demoted. Um... She married Dustin, she woohooed with him and had the kids. Interesting. <clears throat> no, you're okay. <laughs> Parker's, we've been saying Parker is a little bit forgettable. I'll see you Parker. You're gonna rot your brain seeing that close to the TV. Why does he want to talk to Cornelia Goff? Like why? Sir? It's funny, I like him sitting on, right in front of the TV. Uh, I gotta go for a bit. Might be back with Naga for the stream. Thank you very much, Crystal Beth, for hanging out. Thank you. And if you don't come back, hope you have a good rest of your your week. Okay. What are we? I don't know. We're kind of just idling here. I'm not sure what to do. Um. What kind of draw? Should I cause the drama? I want him to hire a maid. I forgot about that. What are we doing? Oh, he's sleeping. Oh, when I was having eye problems with Quincy, I would literally just be like, Parker. Parker wants to be a black widower? Oh, with the... Yeah, maybe he's into older ladies? Interesting. Maybe he should. Let's have him call Sin. Let's see what he talks to Cornelia about. Oh, wait. He's got a little phone up here in his room. He's going to do a little secret call from his room. To Cornelia, for some reason. What are you thinking about, sir? Uh, let's just talk. What are they going to talk about? <laughs> Moving out. Okay. Oh, he wants to throw a party. Oh, was that sports for a second? He's like, yeah, I got to get out of this place. Milf time. Growing up. He's like, yeah, I'm, I'm mature now. And I need somebody who can make me soup. It is a very interestingly shaped room. I like it. Yeah, I like soda. <laughs> he, he zoned out and he's like, yeah, soda. Also, wait, I just saw this. This is a great poster for this family. That's so good because this family originates in The Sims 3. So they have the Sims 3 poster on the wall. That's great. That's such a good little hint. <laughs> That's great. I'm a grown man with soup needs. Oh, he's, yeah, I like, he's just talking to her about food. He's like, yeah, I love all the food. I like eating. Male version of a Black Widow is a blue beard. Really? So he's talking about soda again and cooking. He's just talking about food. Wait, they're getting along because they like food. He wants to chat online and have a party. That's so weird. What is what is this man up to? I feel like he's up to something suspicious. He's just eating food. Once again, I want I did want him to hire a maid eventually. He does need to speaking of food, he does need to eat. He's still just kind of talking. <laughs> oh, 
Yeah, also taking applications for women to make food and carry me through life. Yeah, he has mommy issues? You think so? Or grandma issues. Does he have grandma issues? The way that the way that Jessica Ibadi is just like staring through their wall. Or through their window. Kaylin's a little tired. She's just getting up and, and watching different, I mean, sitting at different angles. Everybody in this household is tired. I don't know what to do. Because my, my cheats are off, so I can't... And if I turn them on, it's still... I have to leave the lot and come back in order to drag things. <laughs> what are we, are you, she's still talking to her. A emergencies. It's an emergency. I'm very hungry. <laughs> He's literally hungry right now. He's like, actually, I gotta go because I am very hungry. Goodbye. Okay. Everyone's having their own separate moment. It's true. The way this door is stuck because of these chairs. I think we might need to get rid of these chairs, but I don't wanna, because it looks nice. I put like, oh, oh, did not mean to do that. Did I just like, oh. For now, it's kind of goofy. I could put windows here. The door is ventilating. There you go. Look at that. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I gotta know I'm super sleepy. Have a good night. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you, thank you. We gotta clean that up. I'll have him take a shower. Actually, he's super sloppy, so you know what? He probably would not clean it up. He's just gonna take a shower. Zelda, I also need you to, like, get up. Isn't there- is there another bathroom? There's only one bathroom in this house. That's kind of rough. The outdoor light is floating. Do you mean the one that was on the wall? Or... Is it? Oh, yeah. That's weird. Was it because of the... That's weird. Is the other one floating by any chance? No. Huh. Okay. There we go. <laughs> you don't have to leave the lot. Just mess with the visual settings and then change them back. Like, I turn off snow on ground and save it. Oh. Really? Oops. Ugh, I'm terrible. I gotta do the bull prop. Not pool prop. <laughs> Not this. How to type. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. So like you turn on like a graphic. Do I have to like save it? Or prop. And then I can... Ah, oh, okay. Thank you. I'm gonna make everybody awake because it's literally the middle of the day. Like, girly, just wake up. That was a good trick. Thank you. Is that a matchmaking ban on DVD? Because my internet kept cutting off. Oh, no. I've had that happen before. I remember there's been times where I've been in matches where like the server goofs up like i had this one time i think i was playing killer and it the server screwed up and froze and kicked us all out and i got zero points in a matchmaking ban <laughs> it was like thanks but everybody else who got kicked out got all their points okay girly i'm gonna have you i don't know what to do with you Buy a car. Ooh, buy a bubble blower is a good one for her. Where is it? Isn't it? It's under party. Um. Took me forever to learn that because I didn't even... I didn't think you could even cheat skills yet. With cheating skills, all you gotta do is click and drag. <laughs> you gotta just click and drag. Where is she at? There she is. Zelda May would absolutely have this over here by the 
Yeah, right here, like watch. If I click on our cooking, see, I can just click it and drag it. I just gotta just, just like you do with the needs. Here, we'll give her zero cooking skill. Go blow some bubbles, Zelda May. I love DVD as well, MG. You could stream that alongside The Sims 2 if you can. Yeah, I I don't know. I've tried before. I'm not I'm not great at streaming it. I don't know. I get nervous. It's hard. It's it feels weird to play DVD streaming. I don't know. <laughs> it's a different world. <laughs> But I have tried it before, and who knows, maybe one day when I'm bored, some variety day. Okay. Yeah, I just don't really know what we're gonna- what we're doing here. You want- she- I'm gonna have her do her charisma some more, I guess. You need to wake up. Maybe he should come out here and join her. What are his- he's getting a new set of wants. He wants a baby? Oh no. Flirt with Ileana. See, he still wants his wifey. Maybe he feels bad and wants to fix things. Maybe he... But see, that's the thing is his wife doesn't know he cheated. Like, his wife has no idea. Um, Like, there was some weird things going on in the household, but she, there's no proof that she cheated. Herb, why... <laughs> why is Herb here? I just, I just turned around and Herb is here. Wait, the curbside guy scared the shit out of you? Is it, is it Herb? Or curbside? Or you mean delivery? <laughs> you mean delivery guy? Like in IRL? Maybe Elia. Yeah, that's the thing. So I have a thing where they can admit it. Do you think that... Look at Herbie just sat on down. Because he's a family sim. And maybe he's guilty. Like he feels bad. Like would he admit it to her? Because he wants to still be in love with her and everything. Maybe he's going to he's going to admit it to her if it shows up properly in my game. Yeah, he smells the herb. Herb loves an herb. I think I don't know if it counts unless oh yeah, confess to cheating. We could do that. I think I might. He's guilty cuz he's not getting any other wants to continue it with her, which maybe says that he's he feels bad about it or something. Sir, you're outside. He's watching her through the window. Sir. He's like, God, my wife's beautiful. How could I do this to her? <laughs> I must tell her the truth. Also, I'm going to turn my uh, decorations back on because then I can see the lot skirt. Okay, sir. He's running in. He's like, I must tell her. I must tell her the truth. <laughs> He's gonna yell through the window. I slept with your sister! <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh-oh. Wait, does she understand? He's giving her a rose? She's she he gave her he said I'm sorry I oh I'm confusion He's suave she hates Zelda May and doesn't like him very much okay Hmm He's so hot all of the <laughs> What everybody's thirsting over a little little dust in <laughs> Sorry I slept with your sister. Here is a rose. <laughs> Here is a rose. He mimes her. He mimes at her confession. Yeah, I don't... He just peeping at her. He bing bong peeping at her. Ooh. Let's, do Let's do like admire. He's gonna try to do something. I said up to you! <laughs> like, yeah, like, sorry I slept with your sis, but like... Here's a rose. Yeah, she's gonna take a while to warm back up. He wants to try and flirt. If I do... Cold hands, she's gonna say no, right? Uh-oh. It was a fail. He wants to buy love potion to try and convince her. That's kind of funny. 
would they have maybe they've got a a computer that they could order it or does he have to or he could call the sawi can i call the matchmaking service can i buy for the matchmaking service i can't remember now he's she's brushing teeth while he's shitting folks what is going on i know i know bro did not wash his hands oh no you're right he didn't wash his hands oh no i forget what matchmaking service sells i think she does sell oh yeah 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 that's literally what the instructions say okay you folks these two just loitering in here is annoying me he needs to just be Oh, they do have a computer up here. He wanted to chat online. Chat with Gunther, Mikey, Summer, Pablo, or Wild. Who am I? I, I don't know. Summer. I forgot that he literally has a boy, has like a guy he's with. So I, for, I forgot about that. Of course, he wants to drug her now. Shake my head. Oh. You know, you're not wrong. <laughs> you're not wrong. I'm gonna have little Kaylin do some painting. And then... Buy a ceiling fan. Buy new clothes. Maybe she needs to start fresh. She wants to buy new clothes. Okay, she got her skill point. Just sit and watch TV. Oh, here comes the guy. Charlemagne is her name. Charlemagne Hegarty. Oh, that's Coral. Oh, it's I forgot. I, I got confused. Coral Caliente. She got married to Flamenco. That was quite a wild time, huh? Is Herbie still here? Yeah, let's save. Sure. It's probably a good idea to save. Of course, he wants to try. <laughs> let's see. What, is it going to work, though? I forget how the... Doesn't he have to take the love potion? Is that how it works? Um, buy potion. Love potion. Let's buy a few. Oh, we don't have enough money. Wait, how many? One is three hundred dollars. Three hundred fifty dollars. There you go. There we go. He looked right at me. <laughs> oh, now he wants a job. Maybe, I don't know what he should lock in. Maybe, let's have, I'm gonna have him check. He's like, I'm gonna get a job. I'm gonna prove wifey that I can do stuff. Did he ever have a job and like get fired or something? Or does he just not, he's not into the working man life. He's more of a stay at home daddy. Take a full time job. Parker grew up badly, made out with Zelda. Got caught cheating. That was him confessing. No, it doesn't look like he ever really had a job. Oh, I gotta roll a dumb ad. Oops. Uh, let's just look again. I'm gonna have him look once, but I might just give him the job. DJ. Server. Okay. You know what would be kind of fun? Is if there was, like, a mod where the, um... Where, like, you could choose any job you wanted from the newspaper. So it was kind of like you still had to wait for the newspaper to show up. So it was, like, not as... Didn't feel, like, as just straight to the cheats, you know what I mean? But, like, it still was <laughs> straight to the cheats, you know? Like, that'd be kind of fun. I'm just gonna go for it. I love his everyday outfit. The open shirt is a pinnacle of handsomeness for me as a child. <laughs> He's not like, that's what, that's what attractive sims look like. Okay, it's 6 p.m. <gasps> She's poking him. She says, how dare you? Embarrass me. You can clean this up. How about you serve some sketty? Should we try and... I'm going to save the game again. I think she wants to buy new clothes. If I walk to lot, I should be safe. We can walk to a lot. She could walk to the clothing store and get new clothes. Is she, what kind of, she's, she, what kind of, would she get something like really attractive that's going to make him 
<laughs> like she's trying to make him jealous or, or or like make him realize what he was missing <laughs> or something stupid like that. She's gonna go by herself. Um, this one's the clothing one. Ma'am? Please? Uh, that was her way of navigating around his sobbing. She couldn't get past him crying, so she sat down and then stood back up. These smart sims. Okay, these smart sims. Who are you? Ernst. Ernst? It's like Ernest, but less letters? Take a seat, queen. <laughs> She's gotta get a she's gotta get a hot sexy outfit for him. That's what she's gotta do. <laughs> Flutie hippie clothes, you think should, she should go hippie? I don't know if she'd go hippie. I think she's she might go slooty. Oh my god, this song though. I love this one. This is the like medical drama. This is the like drama TV show song. Hi Nalu. Slow body rolling. <laughs> I love this one. <laughs> this is the Wee Woo Woo and Tonight music. <laughs> Bing Bong Song Certified. <laughs> I put R&B on for my Sims on date night. <laughs> I just love it. I think it's so good. Okay. I don't think she's... I don't know. What's she gonna... She's gonna show a little shoulder? Maybe she's gonna be like, you know what? I'm in charge now. This one's kind of a fun little outfit. Or this one. Maybe she wants a little color. It's like a business. It's got a little business going on. Hmm. But she seems... Well, she, right now she's wearing like pink and tan. I don't know if that's significant. Maybe she's not. Maybe instead of being slooty, she's being like... She's like, I'm getting me a pantsuit and I'm going all in on the business front. You know what I think is that her, her, Jenny Burb, and I just literally looked down and it looks like she actually wants to be BFFs with Jenny, but her, Jenny Burb, and who is it? Mary Sue need to be besties. They need to be like a crew. They're all the business girls, the boss babes. They're going to be, they're going to be running us MLM together in Pleasant View. <laughs> That's it. They're going to be going door to door with their Avon in Pleasant View. <laughs> I'm in charge now. I'll bing bong. No, <laughs> no, <laughs> not that. <laughs> All right. Gotta go fall asleep in business law. Okay, Lear. Good luck. <laughs> Good luck. Oh, boy. I don't know. Oh, that's yeah, that's, that's not it. <laughs> that's not it. That's not it. <laughs> Real Housewives at Pleasant View. Yes. Oh, this one's kind of fun. She looks like she could get away with this outfit a little bit. It's a weird one, but I kind of like it on her. But I don't know that it's uh, showing off enough. <laughs> Why did you have to ruin them with the MLM? You know, <laughs> maybe they don't do an MLM. Well, what's the alternative? What's their alternative? Are they just like business girlies doing business girly stuff? Owning corporations? Doing doing corporate shenanigans that are non MLM things. This is a funky little outfit, huh? With like the baggy top, like it's a weird choice. But see, like here's the thing that's fun. What if she wears this suit, right? See, there's these three suits. This is this is Jenny's because Jenny likes brown. She could wear this one and Mary Sue could wear this one. Or she could wear this one and Mary Sue. They could each have like the matching suit. <laughs> they could they could be the suit girlies. <laughs> they could all have the same suit. 
<laughs> Maybe it's Sopranos approach. Okay. So like the girlies are working up a plan together. Is that kind of kind of it? Which one should she wear? I feel like she should wear one or one of these. Is she the white suit or is she the black suit? I feel like she might be the white suit because I like the idea of red for Mary Sue. <laughs> that's because MLM people are broken. Don't actually, that's true. So if uh, MLM, then they, I feel like they're starting, that's what I was about to say, they're starting one and getting stinking rich. True. They're the, the salute girlies. <laughs> they're the suit girlies. I'm going to get her this white one. Just committing general fraud. Okay. <laughs> in their husband's names. Sorry, I forgot the music was extremely loud. Sorry. <laughs> um, they're committing fraud in, they're taking out lots of loans in their husband names. Husband's names. <laughs> I think that's what's happening. There you go. That's the, that's the mood. Okay. Look at you and your, your fancy new suit. Okay. Now let's hope this works. Walk the lot, go home. Oh, hello, Bella. Hello, Cornelia. That's Cornelia there that what's-his-name was talking to. What's Cornelia trying to do? She's like, be admired. Oh, my. Allow us to breathe, please. Allow us to breathe, please. Stealing hubby's identity? Oh. And Tiffany's. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. Look at how angry she is in this picture. Hi, Parody. How are you? How are you? Okay. So she's. I don't know where she is. She's here somewhere. There she is. I want to do something. Let's do. Turn on spawn menu. Um. Where? Is it the burb? We got Jennifer. See, Jenny's already got like the booby version of this. I guess Jenny's okay. Hers is like the booby version. And then. So Jenny's already got pretty much the same suit. It's like a little bit different cut. Then spawn. See, Mary Sue had this one, which is fun. But I think um, she's going to get a new outfit. Unless they all got the, the booby version. Should they all have the booby version? <laughs> Jenny got the milkers. <laughs> She does. I think maybe they should all. Maybe that's what they're, they're going on a girls' trip to all get boob jobs. <laughs> that's terrible. Let's see. Okay, these are the little version. Maybe that's what we need to. We need to introduce the. Oh, here we go. This is like the. Okay. Interesting. Do they have their arms out? We'll grab all of them. <laughs> yes, boob trip. <laughs> Finally got a Tuesday stream. Hello, Jelly. Even though it's a class day for you. Hello, I hope you're having a good day. Or maybe a, a, at least not a very chaotic one. I think there's more of those same ones. I might have missed them. Because the brown one is hiding in here somewhere. I know she is. There they are. Yeah, we've got... Okay. Well, see, this version doesn't have boobs. There we go. We're just purchasing all... Oh, these have boobs. <gasps> these are the long versions that have boobs. Okay. We're doing good. We're collecting the boobs. Hopefully my game doesn't explode for me. Okay, we're in the... I, oh, I think I went too far. Oh, they're there. These are all the bottoms. The girlies are getting their looks done. 
<laughs> Gotta go watch a man juggle? Re really? <laughs> like, maybe, I think, actually, Mary Sue should have the the white one now that I'm seeing. Because Mary Sue's got a white suit on. Mary Sue's got the white one. And then Kaylin's gonna get... Or not Kaylin, Ileana. Wait, no. I I watched a man juggle earlier for a presentation. Oh. Interesting. What was it supposed to be for? <laughs> Out of curiosity. I like the fancy. This. Yeah. Look at the girlies with their boobies. <laughs> All the girlies got their boobies out. <laughs> Wait, um... We gotta... Get friendly hug. Friendly hug. Are we friends with Mary Sue? Yeah, we are. We're besties with Mary Sue. Wait, why did we lose friends? Best friends? That's weird. Not cat. I was gonna... How do I... I guess I gotta wait and do it for, like from the phone to make a gr little pre-made group. Love a good booby out. Women hugging with booby out. <laughs> yes, of course. This is the Our Husbands Are Dumb Club. This is the where, where Our Husbands Are Bad Club. Except for Jennifer, her husband's like just annoying himbo that she needs a break from from time to time. But they're also just like or business girlies with useless husbands. I guess that it's the business girlies with useless husbands club. Let's all blow some bubbles, I guess. Okay, you're in here. What? Zelda, why are you sponge bathing in front? Why? She wants to perform music for tips. That could be fun, too. <laughs> He also uh, wrote a book about juggling because he juggles, so he demonstrated. Oh. That's it. He's just really into the juggling. Okay. I mean, I know there's, like, really good pro juggling out there. We are down to $37 because the guy bought a love potion. He's just sitting up here hiding. Is he just hiding from his wife up here? What is he doing, sir? You're in here. What are you, are you chatting? Be kissed. No. Play SSX. Oh. Listen to joke. <laughs> Zelda's doing Zelda. Zelda's wild. I feel like Zelda should live out in a tent in the backyard or something. <laughs> but like, I f isn't Ileana gonna get mad and kick Zelda out? Right. Don Burb isn't useless. He's just a stay-at-home himbo trophy husband. True. You're right. <laughs> You're right. He's he's. But like he's a little bit useless. But like in a nice way. <laughs> he's maybe clueless. Maybe clueless is. Maybe. I love these girlies together though. Um, but like. I feel like Zelda might have to leave, though, but where would Zelda go? Again, I feel like Zelda should be in Strange Town. But would she move in with somebody in Strange Town? I'm trying to think if there's any, like. Because at one point we had, like, kind of like a singles household. I don't think we really. That kind of dissolved, though. I don't know that there's anywhere. I'm looking at my little tracker sheet right now. There's not really. I think she'd have to just be her own. There's not really, like, a singles household. I know, the girl is doing hookah in the backyard. But maybe I can wait till we're done kind of playing them to kick her out. Something like that. Okay, also it's raining. Maybe we should, um, go inside and... I don't know, order some pizza. He's gonna try and give use the love potion. I think how it works is that he... I'm gonna lock in and have baby still. I think he drinks the love potion and then he tries to flirt with her. I think is how it works. Or does he give her it? I don't think he gives it to her. I think he drinks it. It makes him more irresistible. 
Uh-oh, not you dancing with, with Zelda. Maya, sir? Sir? He's kind of causing a little bit of trouble. Okay, you are just chilling. This household's just kind of doing their thing. Can you... Can you stop blowing bubbles? Can you stop getting high in the backyard? Please. Also, she's a lot closer to Elder than I realized. She's pretty old. Is he also? He's pretty old, too. They're both pretty old. I feel like they should have some wrinkles. Maybe he needs a little wrinklage. Does he need a little wrinklage? Maybe they both need a little age? He looks like a newborn baby. Not really. <laughs> a newborn baby with a beard. I have more. I downloaded more, like, it's a little too much. That might be a little too much. Oh, I got these. Get like a little, give him a little smile line. And a little eye bag, maybe. I think you like layer these. Those don't really show. That kind of shows. No, love potion makes you grow daisies and maybe hearts wherever you walk because that makes you super attractive, I guess. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I remember that. What is these? This is like, I don't know. I feel like the lines might be too much. Maybe just around his eyes a little. Like that little forehead. Seems there's such a stark difference from Calic. It's true. It's true. It's strange. It's strange. <laughs> there you go, Mr. Langorak. She could use a little too. After she's done here. Uh, let's just order Chinese food. I kind of forgot what normal Sims look like. I know, it's true. But it's like, I don't know, my little Calicundian, they're not that weird. I know they're weird, but like, you know, sir. Uh, you know what I mean? It's like, they're just the, their little selves. They're just their little Calicundian selves. They don't, they're not, they're fine. <laughs> they're okay. I'll give her like those. That kind of helps. It's like in order to see it, you have to layer them. Give her a little eye. A little eye bag, maybe. I'll just do that. I think that's good. <laughs> Don't be Zelda-ing around. I know. Her looking at him. What's she trying to do? She's trying to poke him. I think she should bother Zelda, because her and Zelda haven't really had words. Let's argue with Zelda. What do you think they're going to argue about? I want to see what pops up. Uh, temperature? Stop making my husband hot. Stop telling my husband you're hot, Zelda. She's like, um, I am hot. I know him sponge baby. <laughs> End of conversation. <laughs> now he just, she just wants to go punch. Uh, poor Kaylin's like, ew. Dad, ew. Rich creativity skill four. Just go paint. I kind of wanted to put this paint. This painting is like in a bad spot. The easel's in a bad spot. Because it's like right in the way. Everything's a little cram jammed. We must acquire the foodstuffs. Oh, that was a flash of lightning. Please, sir. Oh, whoop. Oh. I cannot control my camera. Okay, there we go. Uh, accept delivery. Uh-oh, is he heading for it? Sir, we ordered it. Everybody calm down. Oh my god. Everybody broke... Everybody broke each other. Oh, now where'd the Chinese food go? Oh no, they broke the Chinese food. Where did it go? It's gone. 
I had to reset them because they all went running for the Chinese food and they got stuck in the door and now it's gone. Uh, and now this man's just standing here. I actually have a cheat where I can buy Chinese food from the, the category here, from the invent or whatever. There we go. Whatever. We, you never, we didn't see anything. <laughs> Chinese food does kind of sound yummy right now. This is such a loud rain. Can I turn down? I can turn. This is ambient, I'm assuming. There we go. Everybody, get out of the way. Go here. Get out of the way of everybody getting food. It's annoying. Like, walk away. Get out of the way. Look at these girlies. I love them. <laughs> <laughs> I love the girlies. I'm gonna lock in be besties with Jennifer. Jennifer is eating our food. Oof, why is it lacking on our lot right now? Okay, thanks, Parker. Oh, Kaylin thinks. Oh, he's bored. Is he- is he filthy or is that just the- I think this is the light. Okay, let's have him before I forget. Let's try and drink the love potion. <gasps> he's, oh, he's gotta try. He's he's like, wifey, please. Believe me. And then he wants to- what is this, flirt? I don't know what's a safe one. I feel like hold hands is not- Oh, I'm gonna do this. <laughs> Sam abuses the needs to drag a bull prop. I abuse move objects. I just have no patience for Sims having dumb route failure or taking forever to do things, so I just pick them up and move them. I do that with the babies sometimes if a toddler goes somewhere they're not supposed to. Okay, y'all. Speaking of which, you know what? <laughs> I'm doing that right now. <laughs> Everybody's fighting because there's only one bathroom in this godforsaken house. I'm, I'm doing the love potion. Wait, wifey, please. I've taken- I spent $350 of your hard-earned money on this love potion so that we can be together. <laughs> wifey, please. <laughs> wifey, please. <laughs> like, she's the one with it. He just barely got a job, but... Okay, this isn't working, sir. We need to talk. Maybe we'll say goodbye to everyone. I have Sims with twins in a two-story house. Those babies get plonked up and down stairs all the- yeah. Especially if, like, because I like having the, the toddler rooms with, like, the gate, so they're, like, staying in there. <laughs> Krusty- Krusty Dustin no more. Do you think she should- she should divorce him? I don't know. I don't know what to do. Oh, you need to go to sleep. It's literally 2 a.m. What are you doing? Sleep. You, sir, are going to sleep. His hygiene is horrific. He has flies. This man is covered in flies. He has flies around him. <laughs> he doesn't, because he's super sloppy. And I don't think he cares. He's <laughs> <It's> disgusting. <laughs> he's got the swamp, swamp you know what. Okay, you. Ooh. Ooh. Where did Zelda, Zelda sleeping? She wants to go out to eat. Dine out with Sim. I'm gonna lock in these. What if she goes out to eat with her girl gal pals? You know? But also, like, who would be her next in line? Like, if she got... But see, this, look at... She's got three bolts with him. You know? Imagine if it ends up with all the girlies fighting over Mortimer, because he's the only good guy in town. <laughs> That'd be funny. Everybody's disgusted by, by him. Why you walk around in your underwear? Ew. He's still got his love potion. He's got to try. He's gonna try. Parker has the night off. Well, there you go. 
Uh oh, did it run out finally? I think it ran out. Uh oh, everything is, is falling apart. He wants another love potion. You don't have enough money. He's gonna, here, he wants to tickle her. <laughs> He's just failing. Oh no. Oh no. He's like, I'll call my, I gotta make friends with Michael. He'll know what to do. Okay, go to sleep, girly. It's a fail. We're failing. We're failing. It's too late to call Mikey. I don't think she's gonna let you sleep in bed with her, buddy. Oh, oh. Is she gonna get up? If you get make her get up because she hates you. Okay. Yeah, she literally, she's like, ew, no, I hate him. Why are you crying? What the hell is he crying about? He wants to hustle pool. You're tired. Go to sleep. <laughs> what are you doing? What are they doing? Rusty gotta go to the sofa, you're right. I think we should lock him out of the bedroom. Like, he's not allowed to go in. Only she is. She's- no, she's trying- I'm gonna make her stop. It's not join. Look to you! I'm gonna have her call him. Ooh. I said look to you! There we go. She called him out. She called him out. Allow me only. She's locked. She changed the locks on the bedroom door. Okay, bye. She was okay. Bye, asshole. Bye, asshole. <laughs> you know. Okay. These girlies are sleeping. I'm gonna do auto lights. Except for maybe like. I like some of the main rooms to have lights on. <laughs> yes, you did. It's part of that the oof redemption. <laughs> it's your dollhouse in the Sims living. That's true. You, you, it's a dollhouse. You just pick them up and plop them around wherever you want to be. You know. Yeah, the the background of the oof because it was made from a TikTok. <laughs> it's a TikTok account of this like guy and his like I don't know if it's his mom or his grandma. She's like a funny old lady doing funny stuff. Oh, I remembered that just a little bit ago and didn't hear it. Yeah, that's interesting. Maybe it was there was other sounds because it's just in the background. So maybe it like other sounds drowned it out a little. I don't know. <laughs> I literally never heard that part before. Interesting. Yeah, because it's let me see. Am I allowed to? Oh, it won't let me redeem it, but <laughs> it's interesting. Congrats, buddy. Also, I'm gonna have him call service, call maid. And then he's gonna just, like, nap and stuff. I'm gonna hire a maid for this house. Actually, we're very poor, so that might be a bad idea. But you know what? He's willing to live the dream. <laughs> Gucci the Matrix vibes! Uh oh it's just the random dude. Wait, I don't think we have any girly maids in town. I think we need some. It's only the dudes. Zelda's awake. <gasps> what if Zelda tries to cause trouble? What does she want? Dance with someone. What if they dance? She's like, hello, your wife can't hear us now. Your wife can't hear us now. Also, this being so close to this makes me nervous. Oh! They're going- oh, oh no, wait, I didn't realize this man was still standing out here. <laughs> He's just here. He's watching the sunrise at, on our front lawn. <laughs> He's broken. Uh, Avery Garcia is broken. Hi, Avery. Look at you and your little face. <laughs> Not a thought behind those eyes. He's a, he's a lost boy. Uh oh, was that a fail? Did he did he reject her? I think he might have rejected her. He knows too much now. Oh no. <laughs> he's he's just waiting for his tip. 
This is his first day on the job. Oh, oh my god, he just came back to life! Out of nowhere! Why? Just because it turned 6 a.m. or something? What just happened? <laughs> I did nothing! <laughs> he just- he just decided, okay. <laughs> that was enough. <laughs> okay. Cool. You are filthy. Take a shower. <laughs> he's had enough. Yeah, he's just- he's just done. Okay. All right. School bus for Kaylin. This guy's still absolutely disgusting. Literally putrid. Literally a putrid man. He wants to go hustle pool. I'm trying to think where he could possibly have pool in his in in town. I don't know where there's any pool tables at all. I can't remember. Trying to double I'm trying to think what Oh, girly, are you oh somebody's gotta go to work. Who's whose carpool is this? Probably hers. Uh oh, you gotta get up and go, girly. Oh, she wants Kaylin to get a scholarship. How close is Kaylin to college? Not soup. She's got seven days. Sell a masterpiece. Kaylin is very into artsy fartsy stuff. I like her little her little pink pajama pants. Just thinking about marriage. Oh, now you gotta go to school, girly. There you go. Oh, ew. Why is Zelda still stinky? Why is she stinking still? She's clean. She's- or it's not the food. She's literally just filthy and like slobby and gross. <laughs> Zelda? Zelda? Question mark. While he's sleeping. Emergency technician. Emergency medical technician level one. Entry level, low paying, grunt work in a big medical lab, but a way to test your aptitude for an interest in exploring a doctor's world. Zelda core. <laughs> That's why they, they got it on with Crustin. Wait, I love Crustin. He's, he is Crustin. Zelda. Well, nothing better to do. I guess we gotta go smoke some pot in the backyard at 8 a.m. on a Monday. You know? What if it was- it would be funny if, like, secretly- well, there's no way to do this. I was about to say, like, what if one of the kids was secretly Zelda's, but that's not how it works. <laughs> Dustin carried the child. <laughs> Dustin gave birth to the child? <gasps> I'm being sneaky and watching on mute in class? Naughty. I'm gonna call- I'm gonna email your professor. <laughs> who's- whose job time is it? Yours, you gotta go to work. Honk honk. Honk honk. Honk honk. Honk honk. I unironically make John Burb carry their kids. That's f so you make. Because Jenny ain't about that. That's so funny. But like, wait, but like, that's fun. Because you could also spin that like, like John Burb, like trans icon, John Burb. Man with womb. Beautiful, beautiful trans trans dude, John Burb. <laughs> Every weekday, I am here, I am I I am at work with headphones in watching this at my desk. Oh my goodness. T for T Burb realness, yes. <laughs> I think that's great. I put captions on for the first time. And all I see is honk 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 honk. <laughs> I think it must have been the bus. Orion or Ori Orion head cannon accepted. I like that. <laughs> okay, he wants to go on a date. Maybe he should. Everybody's gone except for his dad. Maybe he needs to call his boyfriend over. Oh no! What did I just hit? I don't know. What I just hit call transport. No. Also, we got our, our uh, little dudes here, our little cleaning guy. Look at him with his little bandana in his head. His little bandana. 
Um, bum, bum. Here we go. Uh, invite over. Please don't work. Please don't have a job. We're returning job revenue translator icon. I just saw a potion mod that will do that for you. I think I've heard about the potion mod. Yeah, we were talking about the that concept. <laughs> you want 10 kins? Go get them. Yeah, squ squ push them out yourself. <laughs> but I do like that. I think that's fun. I could, I do I do kind of want to look into the potions and see how they work. Because we do have, in, in this hood, in this hood, our... Um, our vidi, our little vidkin curious is trans. A, a, a in progress trans girly. We think we're gonna name her Violet. Violet curious. Like after the African violets that little V is traditionally obsessed with. I think it's the African violets. Okay, I think your boyfriend's here though. I think we need to give your boyfriend a makeover. I'm not a big fan of his outfit. Reet Jamar. I know. I need. We need to get back to Violet. <laughs> we need to. But we do have college kids to play at the end of this round, I believe. The few. Oh, that was a weird goof. What should we? Let me. I'm gonna do. I just. I'm not feeling the outfit. I'm just gonna give you like an everyday. Who's who's Jamar? We could still give him something like jeans and jeans and some kind of jacket, but maybe something different. <clears throat> How do you guys make it's kind of the, the way to do it is more so like heavy handed. Like for me, it's like if it feels right for a particular sim and then the technicality of it is downloading clothes that have been converted between between genders or um, then down the line, you could also possibly like edit the sim in sim pe to change their how they're flagged because it'll if you can change the flag from either male or female and it'll show the sim will look like the game will change them to one or the other um apparently there are mods out there that make it easier though and i haven't looked into all of them yet i have a lot of clothes but other than that yeah that's all i know Sandwich. <laughs> Automod did not like that. Break up with the boyfriend because he has no steez, no style, no style savvy. <laughs> Those kids keep getting with the most dripless men. <laughs> You're a hater. Why are you a hater of this innocent man's? Wait, I see, like, I have some different, like, more fem feminine sort of outfits. Wait, what if, what if he, what if, what, like, <laughs> what, what if. <laughs> This one's not bad. Mayo men. Boiled broccoli, plain oatmeal. <laughs> Peyton on the manses. Parker's flavor in men is, is being hated upon. What if he's just walking around like this? That, I guess that, that begs the question. What is Parker's taste in men? And we have to dress this man accordingly. You know? You know, um, I fell asleep and woke up to stream off. I was so heartbroken. I think I missed stream. What a blessing to come back to. Oh, no. Did it like cut out on you or something? Hi, El Flamingo. Guys, I got a, a job interview I applied for last night. Ooh, congratulations. Very nice. What if I give him one of these? That's cool. That's exciting. I hope it goes well. We're kidding, man, specifically for Parker. He better be grateful. Yes. I just, I don't know what the, the vibe is. Let me go all the way to, like, the end. Sometimes I, want, I like starting from the end. Maybe, I feel like he needs a fellow stoner friend. Like, he needs a f stoner boyfriend that's also, like, he needs, like, a fellow stoner friend. It's not a boyfriend friend. <laughs> I know the sun has shown upon me. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, I'm on Twitch on my laptop for the first time, and it automatically enabled chat filter. And I just saw asterisks in chat, and I was like, w where is the foulness in my evil satanic chat? <laughs> That's funny. I don't know. I'm, I'm spending too much time deciding what this man should wear. 
Maybe one of these. Or just give him one of these. I don't know. Started from the bottom. Now we're here. This is kind of a nice little outfit for him, right? Like, I don't think he's with anybody too serious, you know? You know? What are they doing? Goose. Oh, this... <laughs> Darcy didn't like that. Darcy's looking up at God, like, <laughs> God, why? God, why? Oh. Darcy? <laughs> I don't think Darcy's okay. <laughs> I don't think Darcy's okay. I know that he's reacting for some reason to their interaction, which is like weird that he's being so dramatic about it, but it looks like he's embarrassed that he dropped the trash. Like he was so, he was so shocked or like flustered that he dropped the trash and now he has to clean it up. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Are we still playing broke? No, we're actually, this is the Langerak household. Um, which is Kaylin Langerak's family, who originally show up in Sunset Valley. So they've kind of been teleported from Sunset Valley to early Pleasant View. They've moved. It's mentioned in their bio that they moved from Sunset Valley. Uh, hey, oh, hey, Parker, you seem like an insightful person. <laughs> good, good joke. Look at him. He's, why is he mortified? Sir? Darcy! <laughs> Darcy! I'm going to turn on the cursing on mobile because I can see one of my laptop. I see asterisks on my iPad. I would think it would be some sort of chat settings like at the bottom of chat. Hmm. Oh, I just realized how to do something for me. Okay. Because I always have an issue with deleting messages. I just figured out how to turn on it so that it's easy for me to delete messages. Haha. -ha. Now I can delete things that you gremlins say. <laughs> That's weird if you don't see chat settings. I don't know. Would there be like another another button somewhere? Or maybe even account settings? Is there a way to go to, like, your account? I met it- Oh! <laughs> uh, what? Kaylin needs to make a banner for a class project, and the easiest way to do it is to print out multiple pages and put them together. I've never seen this. Kaylin- Should Kaylin put the different pages together with glue or tape? What a random message! Tape? Tape has never let Kaylin down before. With a few deft strips, the banner becomes comes together cleanly and nicely. The project is well received, and Kaylin gains enthusiasm. <laughs> Sorry, I'm gonna read Kobe's message. I met an elder Sammy at the store just now. I was walking through the dairy section. This old woman locked eyes with me and started talking to me about glorious fertilizer. And I'm just like, yeah, mm-hmm. That'll be great for spring. Are you kidding? Are you joking? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Why did they just- why did she just start talking about, like, fertilizers? <laughs> That's funny. Darcy is either struggling or homophobic. Yeah, I think- or, like, in the closet. Darcy looks like he might be in the closet. And he cannot handle it. Also, thank you for the seven stream streak, hello, Flamingo! Three vertical dots in the app, yeah, maybe that. And mobile mine is three vertical dots, and there's an option to hide offensive language. Okay. I turned it off. I found the settings. Okay, good. Darcy is home of phobic and home of sexual. <laughs> yes. Why is he dis well, he's disgusted by his boyfriend? What? He wants to ask on let's ask on date, because he wants to like go on Oh, what did I hit? Do you like what you see? Like what you see? Okay, yes. What if the answer was no? I wouldn't have known what to do. Darcy is struggling with internalized homophobia. Okay, well, there we go. Oh, he's a romance sim. Oh, he's a little player. He's gonna play us. Tell him a dirty joke. Play. Do I tickle? They want to dine out. I don't really mind mess with that. 
Fuck. Gossip. He thinks we're disgusting, which we actually are. It's funny because you can't see it. He's literally fully red hygiene. And you can't even see it, really. Because he- I think- I don't know if it's- he's like- he's a fully sloppy sim, so I'm guessing he just doesn't care. But his boyfriend's just like, you need to take a shower. Stealth stank, he really is. It's very strange. Oh, this guy, John, thinks Parker's hot. Are you trying to steal? I swear, are you stealing? This man just got like teleported from the 1960s and now he's gonna steal our trash. Oh, he's kicking our trash over. Why? This man is also homophobic. At the beginning, I thought she was talking about soup because she said something about soup, and then I said, oh, that sounds delicious. She looked at me like I lost my head, then I realized she was talking about fertilizer. <laughs> what? That's so wild. I'm not joking. There was literally nothing in the vicinity that had to do with anything about gardening, but she was just talking happily about it. I don't even know who she was. That's wild. That's wild. <laughs> I don't... I don't... I'm glad we were able to regroup and pick up- pick the trash back up. Oh, I didn't notice she even picked the trash back up. That's so funny. Okay, she wants to paint, but I'm- so I'm actually gonna do something. I'm gonna give her... Crap, we're kind of low on cash. We need somebody to come home from work. Because I want to give her a different easel. Maybe I could sell a tree. We have too many trees, per usual. What do we got? This one's like 200 bucks. Sure. And then, I'm gonna be a cheater, take you away, I'm sorry. Ruining your easel. I'm gonna put her- give her an easel outside out here. And I have all the custom ones that let me do different sizes. I'm gonna save the industry, but I wanna get well rested for the field trip that I'm taking for the kids tomorrow. Okay, Robin! Good luck! <laughs> good luck on the field trip. Good luck, good luck. Thank you for hanging out. Have a good night. I just, yeah, I wish I could just be like, anybody wanna buy my tree? Pick it up yourself and it's free. This one's actually only a hundred bucks, so I'm gonna get this cheap one. Practice painting. Let's make an oval canvas. Oh, Kristen Lost had their first kiss with Danny... some random... some random... townie? Uh, would you be willing to wink that, wink that water mod? Sure! I could... I can try it. I don't know if I have it on my... Do I have it? Do I have it on my mods page? I'm just gonna look up on my mods myself. Maybe I don't. Maybe I didn't finish... I might not have finished putting, um... putting all my hood stuff in. I guess I didn't finish putting those in. Yeah, I can try and figure out which ones they is. I'll end up forgetting. If I don't. I'll have to look, yeah. Huh. Because I don't know what ones I have. I'll try to remember. I'll try to remember to... To, uh... Post them. Um, Gag? Knee. <laughs> <laughs> what? I like how I just come back to crying, <laughs> butt spot, crying, ha ha ha. <laughs> Score bing bong. <laughs> oh no, bing bong, bing bong, bong. <laughs> butt spot? <laughs> butt spot? Um, I might accidentally sometimes, but I, I do try, yeah, no, it's okay. I just couldn't remember if I had put it in a different weird spot or something. I'm gonna write a note for myself, because I I I'll forget. Also, might have been when I made that list, which I haven't updated my list in a while. I might not have been using it at that time. I'm gonna try and put it somewhere where I'm gonna remember. Let's see. <laughs> anyway, sorry. <laughs> anyway. Back to the video game. Mm. Shop, 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 shop. Mm. 
Everybody, uh, he's trying to shower, sir. Just take a goddamn shower. Just go take a shower. You're allowed to shower. Just take a shower. Just take a shower. Speaking of there she is, little, little dreamer. I, um... I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, I was thinking about my little drawings I did a while back of some of the Calicundians. And I need to, I need to pick a day where, like, we can do, like, start stream with a little drawing moment. I could, I could, we could, I could be doing, like, the drawings on my little tablet. Because I'd be able to sh screen share that. <laughs> Have, like, the beginning of the first hour of stream be a little doodling, a little drawing. I don't know if it'd be good at the beginning or the end or what. I forgot these guys are literally on a date. He does want a woohoo. Where did our boyfriend go? Oh my god, I'm in a goddamn tree. Yeah, I think it might be kind of neat. Uh, let's just do it on a sofa. Yeah, that'd be kind of neat because, again, it's like, it must be, it might be on a day when we actually play Calicondia, so maybe, like, I can try to remember to tr try and set it up. I have to prep the scene for it um, to make it work, I think. But, like, yeah, I could pick a day that I'm going to play Calicondia, like, this Saturday. Um, that could be kind of fun. Time is running out. They want a woohoo. What are these? What is the difference between? Oh, have very foost at first woohoo. Have foost foost woohoo. I also download mods and CC all the time. And if somebody asked me to have a complete list of everything, I'll have not be able to. Yeah, it's okay. It, yeah, that's the hardest part with the. It get, if anything, the the listing gives people an idea of directions to go. <laughs> you know. Wait, what would be cool? I stepped away. I um, I have. I was talking about how I had done some sketches of some Calicundian Sims, and I was gonna um possibly do like a day where I. Uh, my cat knocked over his, his cat tree over with him in it. Oh no! <laughs> but I was talking about. Somebody just went. Did you hear somebody go yeehaw? Who just went yeehaw? Oh my god, it's him. I thought it was somebody reacting to these two woohooing. <laughs> oh, it was him. He's playing. Uh -huh. Jesus Christ. <laughs> um, the cowboy lives in the building. But I was talking about doing a drawing stream, like at the beginning of one of our Calicundia streams, that maybe for the first little while I would do like some digital art that's what was the that would be cool how to do with <laughs> okay he's he's being distracted do you not work no he doesn't work today just sit down and eat or something i don't know what to do with you just don't look this way Oh god, he's gonna sit down right there. Mm, Awkward. Mm, mm, mm. Ew, I got like an up close of his face. Awkward. Mm, mm, he's just like, he's just in the distance. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> he's just in the distance. Mm, mm, mm. Night, my air. It would be fun to have portraits of notable Calicundans you could make into in game art. Yeah, that's true. That'd be really fun. Liliana wants to bring home Bud Muse. Yeah, maybe we maybe we got a new man's is. Oh, we got. Oh, she got promoted to president. I know. And also, yeah, the big window. Okay, they're getting up now. Uh oh, she just got rejected for something. Also, I wanted to lock that in. Now she wants to buy new clothes again. No, just pick up this can. Okay, so she got her promo. Uh, Bud? He says, oh, hey, random lady walking by. I wanted to let you know that I hate genies and I hate fashion. Just so you know. And I also hate cooking. <laughs> She's like, wow, you're kind of an asshole. Bye. <laughs> she wasn't even slutty her clothes. Okay, I'm kind of ignoring their date a little bit. Counts creativities. Oh my god, she needs lots of creativity. I need, like, another way to play creativity. To play creativity to get. Like, maybe an instrument. Instruments are nice because they can continue to work slowly instead of having painting. It's like they stop and then they start. And I feel like she would play 
a little violin. Oops. This desk feels like it's a little bit of a waste of space. Am I wrong? Wait, I have an idea. Boom. There you go. <laughs> they should have got public woohoo memories true. I don't think they would have. They got woohoo memories, but... Who's sitting? Oh, that's you. I gotta get you some skill points, girly. Are they clothed yet? I'm in class and there are people behind me. I don't care if they judge me for watching stream. I just don't want them thinking I'm watching video game porn in class. They are in fact clothed. <laughs> they are in fact clothed. Oh. What? A, it's a it's a weird concept to think of like me being on somebody's screen in class where people can possibly like look over their shoulder and see like it's such a weird i don't it's a weird concept to just think about the other end of the stream <laughs> i don't know <laughs> you know what i mean the receiving end okay she's playing a little violin who's sleeping zelda's sleeping oh wait that's oh <gasps> dustin is sleeping in zelda's bed suspicious Suspicious. I'm a public figure. I, I've, I've been painfully reminded of that. Okay, I'm gonna have to get rid of another tree. The trees are slowly getting knocked down. These are slowly getting knocked down. <laughs> they're getting in my way. <laughs> this is crusted. <clears throat> I'm choking. Deforestation. Deforestation. Kaylin has the opportunity to enter college. She still has six days. Where are, where are these two? They're eating. They're still on a date, technically. It's almost over. I like... Oops. I was locked that in. He's afraid of getting married to Jamar, though. This was a nice time. There you go. He wants to be besties with Cornelia. I wonder if he's... I'm gonna, um, adjust... I'm gonna spawn the adjuster. What is his preference? Is he fully gay? Uh, yeah, it looked like he was. Oh, no, no, wait, now he... Oh, that's Zelda May. Zelda May is by. I don't know if the game saved just now. That was weird. Kaylin, the queen of fine art. Yeah. <laughs> she is. She really is. We maybe the maybe they have to cut down trees to make paper for Kaylin to paint with. Wait. Can can we at least pretend I literally didn't even read your message before before saying that. I was just looking, I was looking at the word deforestation and started. <laughs> can we at least pretend Kaylin cut down the tree and made paper with it? <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's literally same brain moment. My parasocial relationship with Samuel Sunshine Canine. <laughs> it took me a minute to be like, who? I, I was about to say, who's that? <laughs> who's that? <laughs> That's funny. Kaylin? Kaylin? <laughs> Kaylin's having a breakdown. I really, I think we need like another bathroom. How would I hypothetically fit a bathroom in this house? Like, what about, like, here? And then, like... I don't know if we have enough money. I hear Hanky barking up a storm. See, the problem is, is, like, the... The roof. Yeah, that's okay. We could do that, I guess. We just really need a second bathroom. I'll just, like, copy-paste the same... Whoa. Oh, the walls in here are really weird because of those... Oh, wait, was it when I deleted that section of... roof that it, like, caused this to suddenly appear? That's weird. Okay, well, I guess I gotta... Oh, that's true, we have this whole space here, too, don't we? Shoot, you know what? Wait, let me undo. Okay. Maybe we'll go this way instead. Maybe that'll be easier. I 
would like to like to say your full name is Samantha Well. That's wild. <laughs> Samantha Well. <laughs> Samantha Well. Uh, let me put this down. Where's the bathroom? I guess. Go like we'll delete that section. We'll bring it out this way a little. We'll do that. We'll have like a little bathroom here. Is there a more scientific name for the sun? Solar. <laughs> Solar K9. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Some Samothy. <laughs> Samothy. So Sunshine K9 is kind of cute. So maybe I need my maybe my like Steam username needs to be Sunshine K9 now. <laughs> It's literally just sun. <laughs> that sounds about right. Okay, we're gonna grab you. We gotta move. We're gonna maybe we'll make you smaller or we'll make you stop existing. And then you can still go here. Uh oh, see that one went. Why are these doing this? I guess I can. Can't I? Oh wait, I can manually delete those, can't I? But then I have to, like, redraw the line. Ah, uh, I remember that now. Goofy. Turn up here crying right now. Oh, my name isn't special enough! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, if, if, if the sun had more special names. <laughs> Was she the sun had more special names for a special... She's a special lady. Kind of. How should I do this? This is pain. Why are roofs? Why do roofs hurt? That was not correct. Why does the roof have to hurt so bad? I'm calling it good enough. Um, uh, I like though that it's the sun, not the sun. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> Class isn't over. I don't know. I was, I was always too much of like uh, terrified of authority to ever just like walk out of a clasp. <laughs> you know, I was always too much of a afraid of like getting in trouble i'm just gonna do some copy and pasting i don't know exactly how to set up the set out the layout treat yourself <laughs> maybe that's the answer i guess like this or i guess really it should be this huh I just realized they have a lot of towels in here. <laughs> They've got a rack, a rack, and a rack. She's very stanky. I don't know. She's got issues here. We're going to steal this rack and put it up here or something. We'll do that. This music's fun. I'm really... I One of my favorite things I've done is add The Sims 1 building music to the catalog of music that plays when you're building because it's so good to the point where I would I I've considered replacing all of it with that but I don't know if I can maybe we'll do Big window? I yeah, know they're decked up on towels. I don't know. Oh, I guess that's a little window. I thought it was bigger. Here we go. Look, we have another bathroom choice now. Holy crap, Ola. Zelda, leave. Zelda, leave. Zelda, come take a shower because you are horrific. Why is why do so many Sims in this house have to 
be filthy. Like, why are they just... They're bad at hygiene in this house, and I don't understand why. Oops, this, this got goofed up again. Oh no, this room got goofed. I gotta fix her. I guess I gotta I gotta draw the wall again. Tricky. New bathroom who dis. It's funny, like the Sims just like you imagine like we've talked about before, like how Sims like they freeze and then all of a sudden their house pops up in front of them because it was just like for them it was just time paused, you know? And it's like you add a new a new room and you're like, my sim will use their new room. And it's like, maybe the sim doesn't know the room is there yet. They just blinked and it appeared upstairs uh oh my sim got demoted for playing a game during her lunch <laughs> this game is rigged oh no oh no i like how the captions will say goofed but not kaylin like, i can infer that you're talking about kaylin but not once have the captions said the name what do they say wait let me open up my obs kaylin kaylin Kaylin. <laughs> it's every single time it's spelling it different. At one point it said Caitlin on my screen. Kaylin. Kaylin? Kaylin. Kaylin. <laughs> it just keeps saying Caitlin. Silly. Keeps calling her Kelly. Of course, it's, I bet it's because I'm specifically, like, saying it clearly, whereas when I'm talking, I say it quickly. I keep thinking you're saying, but yeah, Kaylee. <laughs> Kaylee. <laughs> Her new name is Kelly, because that's a silly name to me. True, Kelly's a pretty good one. Kelly's a pretty good one. Okay, so Dustin's asleep. She's still filthy. She's fully clean. She's fully clean, and she's stank. Why is she stanking? Whereas when he was fully filthy, he wasn't stank. Look, she's got perma stank. She got perma stank. Just go to bed. Yeah, I think it's the custom hair. It is kind of weird. Should I change his hair? Or is that like his style? It's because of this this custom hair. Maybe I'll give him something different. Let me go into the actual default, so I want to give him like an actual. That one's pretty good, actually. That's pretty. That that was a good first click. That's actually lined right up. Wait, was Kelly the name of Brooke and Kendall's mom on Dance Moms? I don't even know. I'm not much of a Dance Moms watcher. She's one of the women of all time. Okay, I'm just gonna give him this. This is fine. There you go. Look at how ridiculous this coat is. Can we take a moment to appreciate this mesh? Look at that. Ooh. There's something about just like the loose hairs that are just make me uncomfortable. Why does it have to be like that? Like they got really ambitious with it? But it's just, I don't know. It's rough. It's a weird one. It looks like pubic hair. You're right. <laughs> Oh no. Kaylin wants lots of stuff. She wants to play a bass. Looks like my dog's tail. That's funny. He's too fooling around. Oh, he wants to woohoo with three different sims. How do we just say goodbye to him? Unless that was a goodbye. Just say goodbye. Okay, another kiss. Oval Llama. Ooh, I need to like. I need to throw my, um, oh, Automod also got pubes. <laughs> How white are your pubes? <laughs> maybe blonde people got, you know, I mean, it, or maybe, you know, don't judge people for their, their elderly, <laughs> elderly pubes. <laughs> I don't know. Kaylin's having a... I mean, not Kaylin. What's her name here? Is having a good time. <laughs> or maybe, you know, maybe there's people out there that enjoy 
becoming, you know, being, having relations with folks of a certain age and they just happen to be familiar with, you know, <laughs> you know, he still is obsessed with his wifey, but I don't know if it's going to work out. Why are they? <gasps> this grown man just farted on our teenage daughter. <laughs> She's crying. She's crying. Leave. Tell him to leave. <laughs> Bud Muse is a bad guy. <laughs> Bud Muse is a bad guy. <laughs> I. You know what? I'm not. A, I try. <laughs> she should cry for that. Oh god, not the pink eye. He made her cry with the... <laughs> oh no. Oh no. My hair is getting long. I've been- I've stuck it out, I let it grow. I have no clue what I'm even doing with it. Who's out here? Oh, it's you. Okay. I'm gonna have you, like, use the bathroom and then go to sleep. Turn that off and go to sleep. She, you wait, you're right. She's brushing her teeth because she inhaled it. She was just thinking about her dad. When did she learn? Learn to make omelets. Okay. <laughs> I have nothing to go off but sight. I have no sound. Oh no. <laughs> I think you're right. <laughs> yes. Do I have to learn? I maybe have to learn like. To do this, to communicate with Lear. <laughs> Whoever smelted, dealt it, or whatever. I don't know. I'm playing with sticky notes. I'm fidgeting with sticky notes. Uh oh, one of my sticky notes fell off. I gotta download the height mod too. I wanna, I wanna mess around with that. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> oh, wait, we cackle in class. That sounds like a challenge. <laughs> that sounds like a challenge. Okay, girly. Sticky notes. Like, look at her. Look how filthy. She just. She just. That's just. She's not. She's not dirty. She's just like that. That's just like her essence. She's just, ma'am. <laughs> she's just a stanky, and I don't understand. Okay, you're sleeping. I don't know if these two are gonna have to get a divorce or something. I really, really wish there was like... There was a, a way to make sure that it works that Sims can roll divorce. I swore that I had a, th a fix for it, but I guess it doesn't work or something. I don't- I gotta look back into it. I don't know if there was a final fix for the Sims being able to roll divorce. How do you feel while laundry in Sims game? I downloaded a laundry mod for Sims 2, but built in laundry room and then promptly forgot about it. I don't know. Ooh, sorry. Oh, my eye just twitched. I don't know that I ever really felt like I wanted it. I like laundry in The Sims 3. I think it's fine. <laughs> I also figured I don't like the word stinky. Oh, no. Like, boy, stinky is a stinky word to me. Understandable. Understandable. Why is my phone buzzing at me? Weird. I don't know. If, I don't know. I feel like I feel like there's worse worse words than stinky for me. I guess. <laughs> what about line pubes? Does that mod like that? <laughs> I think I already okayed those in that formation, so it it went with it. <laughs> distracted by lines. <laughs> oh boy. It's 1 a.m. This man's awake, dancing to the music. What do you want, sir? See a shooting star. You know what? Go out here and stargaze. Is that how they see a shooting star, is stargazing? Or is it through a telescope? Yeah, I guess stargaze. Okay, go ahead and stargaze, dude. There you go. The loins have awoken. 
Thanks, Comey. The, 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 the loins have awoken with a moist stank. <laughs> That's what you meant. <laughs> Why did I have to do that? <laughs> he ran to see the stars. <laughs> I know. What if he gets smushed by a satellite? <clears throat> Bring me to life, loins version. <laughs> oh no. Maybe I need the mod that makes it... Isn't there a mod that makes it so you get a little bit of a higher chance of satellite kill? I don't ever have my sims stargaze anyway. Or... Look at the sky. Anyway. Bring me to stink loins version. <laughs> it only catches loins... Yeah. It's... <clears throat> what it, The way it works is it like... It permits a term, but then if that same word is used in like a slightly different way... It still re-catches it. It re-catches that. I have to run a, a silly little ad in a minute. I can't believe it's already been five hours. Uh, Automot said you have one loin. You can have a singular loin, not too many. Deadly Satellites by Saijan. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. You know, I also downloaded the More Dangerous Fire mod a while ago. I don't remember if I said that. I'm just going to fast forward. I don't remember if I said that. Um, but I did download the More Dangerous Fires mod. But we just haven't really had a fire. You know? Oh, he saw a shooting star, I guess. Perform music for tips. Tell an inside joke. Oh, and creativity point. Somebody's honking? Who's... Whose job? Your job? Oh, you're going to work. Okay. 4 a.m. Oof. Crawling out of bed at 4 a.m. Fire being dangerous? Oh, yeah. Sure hope it is. <laughs> I love that mod. You like the more dangerous one? Yeah. I think I just... I need more danger. I need more death. But I don't really like... I still don't really love the miscarriage mod. I don't know. That one's kind of yucky for me. But fire? Burning burning in a fire? Yeah. <laughs> Getting squashed by a satellite? Yeah. <laughs> you know? <laughs> um, just be aware, I lost a sim who got electrocuted fixing his computer and the shock started a fire and killed him. I didn't even know that was possible. That's fun. That's fun. But I like I like death and I like like I like sim death because it makes some more interesting storylines and makes things a little more interesting. That's literally I just said the same thing twice. <laughs> I just I just said this. I reiterated the same thing in two different ways. Oh, yeah. Ma'am, what are you doing? What? Just play play. I guess I should have put that here, huh? That's OK. Man got his breasts on full display at 4 able stargazing. You know. He needs to he needs to know that the neighbors know. You know? He needs to know that the neighbors know. But see, like, the thing is, is I also have I also have the um Burglars are arsonists mod, which is dangerous. So I have the arsonist mod and more dangerous fire mod. <laughs> This is, this is trouble. <laughs> I used to random number generator instead of mods to spice up the game. That's also a good idea. I often forget it. I, I end up, if it's not something that's done for me, I forget it exists kind of thing. <laughs> I heard it when I was trying to start generations, long custom, gen generations, long custom hood. I was not productive. Oh, not to mention, I never fixed the breadfruit tree and the lightning fires from that were stupid. Ah. Uh. Uh, if you got it, flaunt it for the aliens. Yes, exactly. <laughs> for example, also I, I don't I don't really feel like doing this. Sorry. <laughs> Satellite birth control. Wait. For example, when a sim star guys, I did a random number generator. If it's one through five, it was sold. As it was sold about a ten, they die by satellite birth control. Oh, <laughs> step by childbirth. A, Oh, there's a random number of generator where I divide. Oh my god, that scared me. This entering the scene scared me. I was like, oh my god, who's dying? I meant the one through five out of a hundred, they die by satellite. Okay. Interesting. 
I like looking inside of these vehicles. There was there's something in like the code. It's kind of interesting. There's something in like the code I saw where there's like an unfinished code for like a si a pregnant sim being loaded into like an ambulance to have their baby or something like that. Isn't that a thing? I've seen that around, I think on Tumblr, where there's like some sort of code about like an, a sim being put in an ambulance. Like that was a feature that didn't really get finished or got got rid of early on. So that was kind of interesting. I'm just control feet when it comes to, yeah, I get that. I kind of am, but I also am not. I, I guess I'm really just not. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, some of the cars have stuff. The, my favorite one is the if your sim has the athletic career and they get into the big like sports bus, they get into the sports bus. Um, there's a there's a there's creepy children in the sports bus. And it's funny. I'm gonna have her do her homework in here. I like the creepy children in the sports bus. Yeah, the mannequins, they're funny. It's like they're supposed to be people in the, in the bus, but they're like just children. They're just children. <laughs> There's a lot of detail, lots of detail. Yeah, I swear I saw it on Tumblr somewhere. <laughs> I like how I looked up, one of my tabs is just human waste fertilizer name. <laughs> Human waste fertilizer name. Google search. <laughs> that was from our earlier conversation. <laughs> A kiss. Oh, now you gotta go to the school. You gotta go to school. Okay. I feel like these two should do more arguing and fighting. Also, she her stank stopped. She cle got cleared of her stank, so that's good. That's a start. So it's a start in the right direction. They're fighting. I feel like they should fall on a fight. What if there was? What if they had a fight and it, we used it to decide who does? Like, either if it, like, what if? Either whoever loses gets to moot leave or something, or divorce, or like, what if I figured out, like, what if I made a decision, like, if her and her husband fought, if that means, I don't know. We used fighting the other day to do something. I thought human waste can't be used for fertilizer slash manure because it's not nutrient rich. I don't know. Apparently, well, I mean, it is a thing. I don't know how good it is or how often it's used, but it is a thing that people that use. I was looking up the name of it. Um... Like, our dead bodies can fertilizer, but not our fecal matter. Yeah, I don't... I don't know. It's not a very good fertilizer. I think it's more for, like, the soil. That, that sounds weird, but, like, it's more like an organic material for the soil. Have you decided who owns the house as which sim will technically be the owner? So the other son would have to move out. Yeah, I think... Uh, I think that maybe wifey owns it. Because she's the one that's, like, the big business lady. And when we started this household, Dustin was didn't have a job. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. I don't really know. I feel like maybe the husband would get kicked out and Zelda would get kicked out. What if Zelda and the husband both leave? <laughs> Who's fighting? I just left class. I have my sound back on. It was Zelda and Zelda and Ileana. Which... They're sisters, and they both, uh, well, Zelda fooled around with Ileana's hubby, Krusty. Like, for, in my games, I like, uh, signing over an owner to the lot so I can stay in a certain family for, like, the Pleasants, I have Daniel own the house, because his, technically, his family home. Okay. Interesting. So, like, if there's a divorce, Mary Sue leaves. Okay. Holda, hold, hold, Holda, and Crustin, <laughs> Crustin. I don't know if we'll roll for death or if like, I feel I didn't see who won actually. I wasn't paying attention, but I feel like if one of them wins over the other, they could, she could move out or something. I don't know. Somebody, I think Zelda needs to move out. I think maybe by the time we're done, 
Zelda could leave and maybe Dustin could be leaving too and maybe they both can go live somewhere together maybe they'll both go to strange town or something oh parker's back they got promotion oh god <laughs> poor darcy's back darcy's like ready for the ready for a bad time oh i did not realize dustin was still out here crusty is still out on the lawn he's been spending his entire day laying here yeah i need like a flop house I don't have a good one, but I'd like to make my own because I don't really like any of the ones I found online. Just like essentially just a really cheap. She's just sitting down crying while her sister serves her burnt pop tarts. Now she's angry at sister. Okay, I think that sister and hubby need to leave. She says, how dare you? I feel like that was a purposeful passive aggressive move that Zelda did that on purpose. Look, she's about to attack her uh, by her own free will. Uh oh, you were supposed to go to work, dude. He never went to work. That's what I forgot. It was his. Oh, Dustin. Krusty. Okay. Should we do it? I think we should do the divorce. <laughs> it was 100% on purpose. I think she's going to break up with him. I'm going to do it. I'm going to. I'm just going to be heavy handed with it and make it happen. It's gonna happen. Sir, are you stripping down? Okay. Sir? Can we... Can we... I... I don't... <laughs> His head is in the clowns, literally. She's waiting. This man's about to have another traumatic experience. He can't go in here because this this poor maid is like this household. <laughs> the sun god said divorce. Not her giving in and eating a rotten pop tart. No, you're better than this. You're better than this. We're gonna have them argue and then break up. I'm gonna make him stop. Another sponge bath. It's like, come on now. Come on now. Oh, you think, you think, you think, you think, huh? Yeah, you think, huh? I am very uncomfortable with the energy that we've created in the studio oh, today. He didn't want to fight. There it is. Here it is. Look at her little red heels. Anyway, <laughs> I got distracted. Um, Dustin's gonna move out. Goodbye. The, the children are sad. Parents broke up. Oh no. Oh no. Uh oh. Rip. She's crying too. I said up to you. Did we like. I think I saw a mod. I think I need to get it. It's where you can you can kick anybody out of your household. Just like you can with, um, <laughs> uh, just like you can with, with like roommates. And I think that'd be cool. Another alternate Crystal Beth name is Criminal Bath, which is what just happened in game. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. I think she needs to, I think she's going to leave too. Also, she won the fight against Ileana. Maybe that means that she gets crust in. Maybe because she won the fight, she gets crust in. How do I find... I gotta use the computer. I'm gonna have her leave, too. Oh my god, I keep knocking over my mouse. She's gonna take her, her hookah with her. <laughs> Wait, she's gonna take her hookah, and she's gonna take her bed. And I don't know, should she take some of these plants? Maybe she'll leave the plants. And her rug. She said, I'm taking my stuff with me. <laughs> taking my things with me. Her and Dustin will have to get a place. Her and Krusty. What, what is Zelda's gross nickname? We said Ho Holda? Hoelda? I guess Hoelda. <laughs> That's a little rough. How about Zoot Zuda? She's Zoot. 
such as Zoot. Zoot and Krusty. <laughs> Zoot and Krusty. Those are their names. <laughs> okay. Her crusty rag and her crusty man. <laughs> Imagine you're on your dad. That's I that has got to have happened a hundred times at that in real life. Also, hello Bubby. How'd we do? Poor guy, he's crying. Hug him. No, maybe not. She doesn't really like her son, so I guess not. Her and her son don't get along, so. <laughs> I, wait. Kaylin's coming home to say, Mommy, look at, look at, I got a good grade. And she's like, okay, that's great, honey. Um, your father and I have divorced. He's never coming back. Also, I hate your aunt. And I think your husband, uh, your husband, I think your, your father and your aunt might be getting married. <laughs> but I'm glad you did an A plus, honey. <laughs> I feel like she's going to immediately cry after this. After she realizes... Yeah, literally the next thing in her queue is parents broke up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's terrible. I think ho Holda, Holda is great, but you have to spell it that way. Here we go. I'm going to take a screenshot. Oh, no. Yeah, true. No, no wonder Caitlyn ended up the way she did in The Sims 2. It's true. But maybe this time she'll have a better. She's got a good girlfriend. Where are... What are you doing? Oh. <laughs> Back to burning his retinas on the TV here. On the TV screen. What's the point of even having your damn couch in here, buddy? How about you just lose yourself in your homework? How about that? She's going to put herself into her art and stuff. That's what she'll do. Yeah, whatever, but whatever Calicundian paintings I end up doing, I need to put them into like the custom paintings as well as make like, like, but I could also make like actual recolors of paintings that I could put for download and stuff. That'd be fun. That way anybody who downloads it could have Calicundia art in their game. Zeldor Matt? Oh my. <laughs> oh my. I know, you are sad. You gotta go paint out your pain. Paint a depressed llama. Actually, wait. I'm gonna move this back inside, because I think this would be a good place for her now, is to be in here. I feel like this... I don't know. I guess I'll leave it. Is she gonna... Okay, she's rerouting. Reroute. There you go, Kaylin. Now only the Sims with black hair are in this household. Both of the blondies got kicked out. Oh, okay. What kind of interaction? Are they getting along? Their relationship is recovering? Intriguing. Intriguing. He's still sad. He wants to be besties with Cornelia. <laughs> let's call let's call Cornelia. For some reason. My nose is itching. Let's just talk with her? Or should I... Let's invite her over for the hell of it. Please he's paying red hands because it's the only acceptable way he can hit his mom. No. <laughs> or she can hit him. <laughs> oh, boy. Oops, I forgot to move this. Imagine the drama of if she was, like, pregnant with his baby. After the fact, after he left or something, that'd be funny. But it didn't happen. He did want to have a baby, but it was too late. They already were having trouble. What would be like if she were to get married, like, a remarried, who would be her next one? Oh, she, she's got chemistry with Dustin, Daniel, and Bud. Who's dinging our bell? Oh, Cornelia. Hi, Cornelia. Your, your bestie is here. <laughs> what a weird... Parker, what is your obsession with this old woman? What are, why do you want this old woman so bad? Also, does he want to go... He wants to go on island vacation. Okay. 
Can I do like macro friendly? Get them to be besties? Are they even friends? Yeah, they're friends. I like her little outfit. She's got little red shoes and a red belt. It's a nice outfit. Okay. Why don't you just clean up all of this? Okay, yes, I know you're excited. <laughs> I know you're excited, ma'am. Olive oil is here. And she's chewing on stuff. But, like, doggy stuff. Did you finish painting? Is that the done? Is that done? Is is it? Is it done? Are are you sure? Maybe. Okay. If you say so. If you if you say so, madam. Oh, I was supposed to roll an ad. I forgot. Who's walking by? Oh, that's that Cassandra Howard girly. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, um, roll an ad real quick. Sorry if you get stuck behind a silly little ad. Anytime there's a weird teen elder relationship in my game, I just imagine their neighbors or co-workers or the elder as a mentor. True. Although this isn't a teen, he's actually an adult. <laughs> he's actually not a teenager, he's a full adult, so. <laughs> he's just like the stoner son that lives in the attic. But he's a fu he's fully grown. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> you know, you know, what's going on with her chin? She had like a chin situation for a second. So it might not be, oh, she's got some like clipping happening in her chin zone when she talks sometimes. That's okay. I know he doesn't look like it. That's kind of the point is that he kind of looks young. But he is an adult. <laughs> I tried to make him look like young. I couldn't tell from his behavior exactly. Yeah, he has a crush on Don, so he's the weird one. Oh, he so he's supposed to have a crush on Don. Okay, that's weird. I didn't get that. He's he started a relationship with some random, but he's a romance sim, so he's like no, probably not gonna stick with it. He'll just go to different people. You know. What's up with Simmers and Chins? Chelsea and Bitch also comments on Sims 4 Chins. Interesting. I don't know. I just noticed it clipping. She was, she was, she had like a clip happening. We're getting along. Uh oh, what? Oh, he got a love letter. I thought it was a stanky bad lever letter, but it's a good letter. There you go, little Parker. There you go, little Parker. Oh, Cornelia's in here dancing with our mom. Oh, he's gonna dance with Cornelia. Does he have a weird... <laughs> Do you think he's into Cornelia? He's thinking about his dad. Wait, I want him to check her out. Not really. Okay. Oh, that's right. He's gay also. So I guess he's just... He just his besties with Cornelia for some reason. For some reason. Uh, speaking of chins, my mom calls her chin a witch's chin. I'm like, excuse me, mom? I have your chin. Oh, no. <laughs> Uh-oh. Drag mom? Interesting. Is there a door on this room? Oh, the, the, the dialogue box was hiding the door on this room. Wait, did Cornelia just give Ileana the flu? I'm sorry? Rude. Very rude. Okay, well, he didn't get to make besties with her. Ugh, he's got sick. Maybe he was the one that caught a j at illness? I'm just gonna try and get them to be besties. Buy car. Buying a car would be fun, but they don't quite have enough money. Oh, 
Let's see if we can get in the low. She started another painting on her own. She wants a masterpiece, so hopefully she'll get one. I don't know that she... She has pretty good creativity skill, actually. She's pretty high creativity. Oh, ew, she's hacking in our face. Okay, maybe we need to tell her goodbye. Say goodbye to Cornea. We knew her well. Maybe, <laughs> wait, maybe he, maybe he, maybe Parker is just not a smart guy. And everybody kept telling him that if he sits really close to the TV like that, he's going to hurt his corneas. So he said, I don't want to hurt Cornelia. I'm going to call her up and be friends with her. And he's confused. <laughs> he's confused. What? Okay, sir, we get it. You're sick. Stop. Uh, I feel like we could do pretend to drag by getting it, setting it formal is so crazy fun. That's true. Have them go use the microphone a lot. That would be fun. Wait, that'd be fun. We could maybe do that. I can see what I have available. He's off right now. Can you do... I wish you could do makeup per... See, the problem is I don't think you can do makeup per category, can you? That's the part that sucks. I mean, I could temporarily give him makeup for the outing or something. He's gonna eat. Yeah, it'd be really cool, like, for formal wear. That'd be great. Yeah, she's having a little bit of a rough time. Okay, you wanna you wanna clean up? I know you like cleaning, girly. Go ahead and clean her up. Okay, you're sleeping. Yeah, it'd be cool. No makeup for swim sleep. So yeah. Poll worker invites Parker over for his weekly poker match. Parker is a pretty good poker player. Yeah, sure, why not? His co-workers are good at sports, right? Sits down to play. Realize their skill levels are different. Parker wins a large number. Parker is discouraged. Okay. Honestly. That's fine. I don't care. I don't care, Parker. You can be discouraged all you want. I think Cornelia needs to leave. Is Cornelia leaving on her own? No. I think we're going to say goodbye to Cornelia. There you go. Well, this household definitely uh, kind of fell apart in a way, but sorted itself out pretty quickly. Definitely, some of our households in Early Pleasant View in this first little kind of play of Early Pleasant View have um, had some big developments. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> it's kind of interesting. There we go. I'm going to also save. We have just one. I'm going to just play. We have one more day of this, ho of this household. So I'm going to, I'd like to just play them through this last day before I'm, I'm done for the night here. I think it would be nice just to have a nice, clean end. Be able to start someone new next time. The last, we only have one more household left after these guys. And that actually is Cornelia's household, the Crumplebottom household. So, that could be kind of interesting. I don't really know what we're in stir for. What? Oh, no. Wait, we haven't played the Dreamer household, have we? I just, it's funny that he popped that up because I'm like, wait a minute, we haven't played the Dreamer household at all. So that means I'm missing them on my tracker sheet. I don't even have them listed. How do I not even have them? Also, uh, it appears that Darren Dreamer got alien pregnant. <laughs> Let's put them up next. I can't believe I forgot them. They're like iconic. What the hell? I forgot about Dreamer. <laughs> you you for Bing Bong about Dra Bing Bong? <laughs> yeah, too much. Too more cows to go. What? A, what? A, to have these two this pop up. So anyway, Darren Dreamer has been dropped home from a round of intergalactic travel. So we're gonna have an alien baby. <laughs> okay, that should be an experience. Okay, buddy. Good job. Okay, honestly, Parker, that's on brand for you. This is on brand for you, sir. 
I'm gonna let you do it. I'm gonna let it happen. Olive Spectre is getting engaged to Rick Romans? We don't even know who Rick Romans is, Olive. Oh no. Oh no. All right, Ileana has awoken. Next victim. That's true. Probably next victim. <laughs> Please rename Rick Romans to Dick Romans. <laughs> Isn't it funny that it's kind of just barely there? Because you said that was a character or something. I'm not familiar with the character. You don't need to play video games, ma'am. Just serve cereal. You have to have work today. You do have to work at from 10 p.m. to 3 a.m. Parker. Yeah, just wake up and go to sleep, buddy. <laughs> Just wake up and go to sleep, buddy. You know. Oof, look at his bladder. Is he gonna he's gonna like pee the bed or something? Okay. Oh, oh you're gonna go you're gonna accidentally okay. He went, he made it, he went. <laughs> oh whoa. Okay. Is that your that's her <laughs> This is her. Look at that. She got divorced. She got herself out of the stupid marriage. She got herself a limousine. <laughs> She's winning. <laughs> Ileana is winning. She's uh, she has to wear this weird red outfit for work, but you know what? It's OK. Look at her getting into her limousine. We got to look at the inside of the limousine. I want to look at ooh, it's sticking out. Look at this. Oh, God. Sitting in this? No, thanks. Sitting with your knees, like, interlocked with the person across from you? <laughs> no, thanks. This guy is the driver for everyone in this hood. <laughs> like, I don't even know what your name is, sir. Do I get to see who your name is? I don't get to see, do I? Oh, I saw it for a sec. Oh, well. <laughs> I just keep seeing him behind the wheel. Flamenco is here. Can I have her recycle? How about pay all bills? What are you doing, sir? I know, it's just your comfort's bad. How about you just go back to sleep for now? Hey, she is a girl boss. Girl boss. Gaslight gatekeep girl boss. Ileana. Meanwhile, Miss Kaylin. The question is, should Kaylin still become like a maid? Because that would be kind of funny. Jenny Hanna is getting engaged to Fred Mora. Interesting. Jenny Hanna is currently the lady who's taking care of our orphanage. Which we haven't played yet. So she's getting engaged. That seems like an issue. Ileana is healthy again. Oh. What is this with the, all the engagements? We're getting all kinds of engagements. Story progression. I guess I need to slow her down a little bit. Loki is getting engaged to Hayden Graham. Spencer is getting engaged to Moonchild Hawkins. Those are our zombos. All, like everybody on all the Spectre's lot is getting engaged right now? Question mark? <laughs> Where are you, sir? I'm gonna... I think I might need to change... Yeah, I think this one. Put it back to one. We're gonna do story progression speed. Let's do every four days. So we just... We don't have as much happening. Her, yeah, her name is spelled just... I think it's without an H. I think, I think. All right, well, our zombos are getting engaged. <laughs> getting zombie marriages. Okay. Okie dokie. The only one here is Parker. We'll save real quick. The Spectrette, like the Bachelorette. Except everybody gets engaged. All, all at once. And I think Moonchild is the one that he kept trying to convince to marry him that wouldn't. Okay, poor Darcy's back. Uh, 
I don't really know what our last day here is going to be. He does technically have to work, or else I'd... I, I like the idea of the thing we were talking about, him having like a little fun formal outfit to go out, but he's got to work all night. So I might not do that. Maybe in the future, if I remember. Maybe I could still give him a fun um, formal wear. Oh my god, not all of Spectre is getting married to Rick Spectre. <laughs> Damn it. Olive does not waste time. Olive does not waste time. Maybe wake up. Love is strange. Love is blind. <laughs> Love is strange. Love is blind. Let's plan. Let's buy clothes formal. Let's see what we can get him for formal wear. So so he's we've decided he's gonna have like a drag formal wear. What do we have? What, are, what are, Spencer's first time in drag. <laughs> what is this going to be? What is Spencer's drag name? That's the question. What's Spencer's drag name? There we go. We got some dresses. We got a fancy little pink dress. Purple. This was not bad. Titty clipping. <laughs> Titty clipping. Maybe one of these will be good. I don't know what his color is. The red is fun. Ooh, wait, I like the bright red. Look at his look at his bright red outfit. Wait. Gussie up. Can't I change hair per category though? That's fun. A drag name calculator would be fun. So let's find I'm gonna find him a wig. For his for his outfit for his formal wear. I need more. I need better options. I guess we will have some. Oh, here we go. Got some long blonde hair. <laughs> it could be a blonde bombshell. There you go. That looks like a bad wig. <laughs> <laughs> that looks like a wig. What if he... I can't do these for... Oh no, but then his everyday hair turns into blonde too. Oh no. Is he gonna dye his hair blonde? Did he... <laughs> oh no, that was everyday wear is blonde. Oops, not change. I don't know how I feel about it. Committed to the bit, I guess so. But like, why would he put on a blonde wig but also dye his hair blonde? <laughs> like, sir? Oh, he, he's very sick. Do you put him in black and his drag name can be Hella Goth? Oh, no. <laughs> okay, well, he's hacking up a lung. Fantasy, the, my go-to, the savior of all. Fantasy generators. Oop, not the flash, there we go. Fantasy name generators. Drag queen name generator. Sublime? So, like, sublime? <laughs> Phoenix. We got any funny ones? I don't know if these are going to be funny ones. Joni? Stella Fish? <laughs> <laughs> Not sell a fish. Supreme? Supreme! Aster Star? He looks like Coco and Ch Chantra. Miss Mood. Okay, these ones are, like, not as great. Wait, let's see. Oh, I'm not doing a... Sparkle Royale, Sapphire Moon. These are all bad. <laughs> These are all not great. <laughs> I think Titty Clippin' is just what we're going to have to stick to. Okay, so now you smell bad. Who is this guy? Devin Burton must have come home from school with her. Uh, Devin's got some eyelashes. Wait, look at Devin's eyelashes. He's just a random townie. He's got... It's because what it is is I have... I have a default for the eyeliner i have an eyeliner default that turns it into eyelashes so he's he had eyelash eyeliner on he's got guy liner 
A little bit of guy liner? Oh my god, this camera mod? This man? Can you... Can you get it together for me? I've changed my mind about his hair. He is struggling. But what if he used... What if he got, like, this going? That's kind of fun. Wait, I like the blue. It's kind of fun. Oh, he likes the blue. Well, there you go. He's got blue hair. <laughs> join play. Now, what happens when somebody tries to join them? Does he... Will he sit down at the chair? Oh, he, oh no. They're going to sit... They're going to ignore the chair and cram Jim in there. Cram Jim in there. Lauren, Lauren Jitis. Oh no, like laryngitis. <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good. <laughs> I do like that one. He puts an extension when he's in drag. That's also a good point. I missed that comment. That's a good point. Well, here we are, I guess. Uh, Jenny Hanna's getting married to Fred Hanna. Okay, my story progression is going hard. It needs to calm down. My story progression needs to calm down. It's because you're always hacking up a lung. Where are you, girly? What are you, what are you doing? Vlog about art. Oh my god, dude. Sir? This kid? Also, this kid's pants are so low. You're about to die, sir. Devin? Watch out, Devin. Like, you're gonna get diseased. Why are you in this grown man's room? You're gonna get diseased. Yeah, story progression said matchmaker, matchmaker mode on. <laughs> Wants to be the main character, yes. Yes. What are you doing? I don't know what you're doing. Let's see, what, what does Kaylin want in life? Get a kitten. Should we buy our kitten? Honestly, this household could probably use a kitten. Let's see. What what kittens are available? Actually, there's a phone right up here. Am I allowed to adopt a, a pet as a teenager? Let's see. I doubt it. Maybe not. I don't, I don't remember. I know the adults can. We can have Parker do it. Pet adoption service. Yeah. She's like, I'm sad and I want a kit one kitten, please. Oh, there's only a cat named Rodan. How do we feel about Rodan? <laughs> Rodin? Rodent? Rat. What if we named his what if he was just called Rat? <laughs> um he just has like some playful behaviors. Lazy, friendly, aggressive pig pen. I think I'll just get him. Yeah. It is. Comes at a price. Wait, pets come at a price and that one looks a bit steep for you. You don't have enough money for How much did the goddamn cat cost? His adoption fee is two grand. This is a $2,000 cat. It's $2,317. Why is this cat so expensive? <laughs> Rat's cute. Just cheat to fulfill the want list. Yeah, that's what I was gonna do. <laughs> but I might now use the puppy creator. One of those premium rescue cats. Apparently, who's pay who is paying two grand for a cat unless you're like a fancy cat breeder? <laughs> yeah, I ended up on a Reddit post about disease names that would be good baby names. I report back with my findings. Oh no. Okay. Damn. Uh, Ileana's bringing someone else home, sure. Mommy's got all kinds of friends coming home. I'm gonna do the, the baby pet creator. Great kitten. Who we got in town? We got Bailey. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna use your Rodan. You're a $2,000 cat. I'm gonna breed your $2,000 cat. To whoever the hell I want. Petunia. Rose. Cinnamon, cinnamon goth, Mips, Mips is good, Bonnie, Doom Paws, I forgot about Doom Paws, Haste, Hakuba goth, Ugh. 
I don't know who I want. Let's just do Petunia. I don't care. It was a girly kitten. I don't know what to name the cat. Should I name the cat Laryngitis? <laughs> Is that the cat's name? Does cholera make you cough? Because his name could be Cholera Ho. <laughs> That's a Cholera Ho. Yeah, I don't know what Ka Kaylin would specifically. What if, wait, what if Kaylin names her cat after like a cleaning product? <laughs> Kaylin's obsessed with cleaning, even at a young age. <laughs> Lysol. <laughs> this is my kitty cat, Lysol. Oh gosh, what would it? Color as a poop and actually, that's you're right. I think I heard that. Fabulosa. <laughs> Fabulosa. Kleenex the kitty, Windex the cat. <laughs> oh no, there's too many good ones. Kleenex or Windex. Windex is, I think, good for because cleaning windows. I had cholera as a baby. Mom said it was really gassy. I couldn't really call. Are you sure that's not a colic? Because I think cholera is like a really serious disease. Or am I mistaken? Because I think babies get colic, which is when they can't pass gas. Bleach. Bleach is good. I was gonna say, cholera is like a really dangerous disease. <laughs> I was like, I think that's like something you only get in like very like certain areas of the world or something. Like it's like a, I don't know if it's like hot places or like tropical places or so. I don't know. <laughs> There's some, maybe I'm completely wrong on that, but I think it's a dis really bad disease. Oh, it's like Oregon Trail disease. Okay. My knowledge of cholera comes from a super unheard of Western miniseries. It, it's waterborne, usually dirty water. <laughs> Dreamers said, I used to drink dirty water as a baby. <laughs> I got cholera. <laughs> oh, no. Windex is ammonia and cat pee sounds like ammonia. I'm going to do Windex. That one's fine. Okay. Name the damn cat. Look at our baby. Oh, it's a pretty little kid. Kid? Kitten? Okay, hello. Small baby. Small baby. There we go. Let me go buy cat stuff. It's not endemic to certain areas. Okay. I feel like I've heard of people getting it in, like, tropical areas, but maybe I'm thinking of something else. Cute little kitty. Mm -hmm. Let's get. Maybe she'll have like, we'll have its food like here, just because it's like in a nice area. We'll have the the bed in here somewhere. I guess I'll just use that bed. I don't know what kind of. That oh, one's kind of cute. That works. I'm just kind of slapping stuff down here. Just kind of slapping things down. Honestly, this... Well, actually, let me turn snapping back on. Uh-oh, I think that... I think I just broke the phone by accident. My nose is itchy. Why is my nose so itchy? <laughs> I keep seeing that grass. My brain instantly goes, Are we playing Sims 3? Oh... I guess it's just like that. Yeah, it's got kind of that Sims 3 vibe. Oh, this man is touching our cat. Uh, progression. Why is story progression? I just turned story progression down. And it's going nuts. Why? Why Why is my story progression broken? I made it so that it's every four days and only one iteration per day. That's like slow. What the hell? Now, Marilyn is romancing Heaven Kyle. Who the hell is Heaven Kyle? For example, it's very common like Industrial Revolution London, but currently if there are people drinking dirty water, there could be color. Okay, interesting. Don't let him steal the kitty. Here, just interact with your friend. 
Uh oh, he's gonna steal our cat. At least the house has like, it's like ground level. It doesn't have a foundation, above ground foundation. So it's like the cat can come and go. Sorry, color in for the, I enjoy historically significant illnesses. Like, okay, it's interesting. <laughs> Story progression feels a little unstable, like doing whatever it wants. Yeah, it's weird. I don't. I feel like I don't see it that often, and all of a sudden it's just appearing constantly. Maybe I have to like restart the game for the settings to really kick in properly or something. All right, come here, Windex. I love the cat. <laughs> the cat named Windex. It's so stupid. Have you heard of puppet history? It's based on what you said. I feel like you would appreciate it. Okay, you don't need to have a meltdown. There's another bathroom up here that you can use. Congratulations. This man will not stop touching our cat. <laughs> Hi, Gate Tarantula. How are you? Our Sims 2 has been unique today, <laughs> as always, honestly. We've had a little bit of drama and some weirdness. This man's face is kind of wild. Look at him. What kind of, what anime did he crawl out of? <laughs> I don't know. He's not like fully, his eyes are like anime from like, he's anime from like here up. And then he's like cartoon character, like other cartoon character from here down, like non-anime cartoon character. <laughs> yeah, cats attract strangers. True. True. I've never t lit this fire. It feels like it's a bad idea to do. Why are we having meltdowns up here? Okay. They're like standing in a row and being fussy. I don't know what these two are just like getting along. Oh, you love puppet history. It's on YouTube. Ooh, excuse me. Hosted by a silly puppet called the professor, but the contestants are humans. There are great songs and lots of fun stories. Two guys that were in Buzzfeed and Zald. Oh, but it's not Buzzfeed. Huh. In a warm self. It's supposed to be fall time, so we gotta be nice and cozy. We're besties now, Sims and Watcher. Oh, we'll save. Oh, she's got some pimples on her face. Really, you gotta wash yourself. video game we have once again we're sending an email to will Wright. okay uh uh, -uh. use acne cream <laughs> i don't this random child is just schmoozing everybody in our house can i just say ask to leave devon he's <laughs> just a random dude just some random dude <laughs> I wish that like when they put the acne cream on you could like see something on their face or something that'd be kind of funny it'd be kind of fun oops oh my god I'm spinning in circles spinning in circles these two are getting along pretty good let's I'm gonna check if Kaylin is eligible for any scholarships because her mom has the want related to her getting a scholarship. I just want to see. It. Maybe we can fulfill that. Maybe that'd be good. Okay, we did get one. Good. Okay, cool. So that, that accomplished that for her mom. So that was good. Got a sculpture. Charisma point. We could lock that in. Just playing her fancy violin. You're hungry. Oh, she's clapping to her mom's violin playing. Serve. How about you serve some dinner? Serve some dinner. Oh, not our not our coworker up here playing video games with our son. Okay. Oh, oh, they got caught. <laughs> oh no, he's got a. The co-worker thinks our son is attractive. <laughs> oh. Maybe. I, I guess we'll... 
I guess we could chat. For reference, our son is an adult. He's just he's just a young adult, obviously like kind of a younger adult. I just I never if I ever am like sick and coughing, I just I don't like just let it loose all over the room like that. You know what I mean? <laughs> I I guess I haven't really been that sick in a long, long time, but still. <laughs> I just don't know that I'd just let it loose like that. Just, just flowing around the room. I'm just about to put this man on the list. Yeah, no, no, he's... Son is an adult, technically. He's a little immature, but he is an adult. He looks young. Uh, they can joke. He's just kind of a stoner dude that lives in our attic. That's our son, you know? Like, that's kind of him. I feel like I should download the mod. I feel like I should download that, like, mod that has... That, uh, has your sims be able to actually, like, smoke... <laughs> smoke weed. <laughs> I, I think some of my sims need it. Okay, she's eating. Everybody want to, like, come to eat? Can't I, like, call household to meal? There we go. Everybody's gonna come and eat. Uh-oh, that's literally his carpool showing up. Oops. Okay. Oh, I guess Parker's gonna go to work. He says, oh, sorry, I gotta leave my... Oh, she was disgusted by Parker? Is he dirty again? No, he's not dirty again. I think she's just so neat and he's so sloppy that everything he does disgusts Esther. I feel like that's a personal gift to me. Oh, <laughs> this is this sim smoking weed thing. <laughs> yeah, I think I should I should try it. We'll see. I don't think it'll be funny for certain sims to get into it. Oh, we're looking through the window. Not the window, the stairway. Oh. Kaylin is very neat. I feel like this household is much better without Krusty here. <laughs> this household is much better without Krusty here. And, and Zelda... Zelda jerk. Zelda jerk. Bum, bum. Thank you very much for the follow. Thank you. Oh, she finished a painting. Cell. Do you have the ability to do custom paintings yet? Ooh, we do. Custom horizontal? Oops. Oh, okay. I got to choose. What kind of custom painting? Time for Zoot Zoot. Family had moods in Sims 2. I was looking into one mod that actually made Sims go do crazy things like fight and propose when they drink too much from the kick. That's fun. I like that. I know I've seen moodlets for Sims 3 that make Sims like drunk and stuff. That's fun. Here, let's do. Do this chaos painting. Big wide chaos painting. <gasps> Whoa! I just noticed something. Look, when you look in the mirror, it shows the finished version of the painting. Uh, hack? I'm hacking? I'm hacking in The Sims? <laughs> hacking? I'm a hacker? <laughs> I'm hacking in The Sims? What is this? Maybe it's this. Is it just this custom easel? <laughs> also, that painting. This is an old screenshot from Free Sims Online. <laughs> Reporting you to Will Wright right now. <laughs> Comey is entering Will Wright's hotmail email right now. Parker is sitting in the tiny sales kiosk, listening to the sound of the rain beating against the bulletproof glass. Blah blah blah. I'm just gonna click one and see what happens. Oh, he won 500 bucks. Cool. I'm unlocking the new Mirror World. What's going on in Mirror World? I know it, there's like no snapping. There's no snapping in Mirror World. Anything else happening in Mirror World? There's not really a lot happening in Mirror World except for painting. <laughs> the chaos. Will Wright is cool at Hotmail. <laughs> oh my god, I hit my mic. At Hotmail. <laughs> Please help. Send me hacking the paintings. 
reporting me to to Max's headquarters for hacking in the video game. He's goss. He was just gossiping. She. Sorry, let me try that again. She was just gossiping about Zelda May and Cor to Corey. Okay, can we ask this man to leave? He's just loitering around our house and flirting with our son. I don't, I don't understand. What do you think Woolwright's personal email really is? Is it? I, I feel like he's a Yahoo man. You think he's a Yahoo man? <laughs> I love scooters69 at yahoo.com. <laughs> Will write UFO. <laughs> Red scooter at yeah. Red scooter one. <laughs> Red scooter at Yahoo email. The painting is a vampire. I posted a functional beer keg in the Discord. Okay. He's he's still rocking his Netscape email. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. Also, it's Thursday here. We'll save. OMG, we've been going for six hours. I haven't done a six hour stream in a while. I'm actually wide awake. Caliente Vespa. <laughs> Who do you think is Will Wright's favorite pre made? He must have a favorite, right? He must have a favorite. Oops, not my not my whole desktop. <laughs> I didn't know my screen my dis screen display was on. <laughs> not my nasty desktop, my crusty desktop. <laughs> my my terrible crusty desktop has been exposed. <laughs> Push it. The the world record for an eight hour. I almost did. I we've done seven. We've been over seven before. <laughs> A little over seven. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. Do we want to watch one more machinimer? We could have one more machinimer moment. There we go. Um bum 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 bum. bum. I don't know what to watch. Let me scroll up a little ways and see what stuff I might have missed. We watched a lot. This was that stuff. Tragic Love seems to machinima. Exterminator NPC does their job. It's kind of slow. It's just watching. Trigger warning Kool-Aid. Okay. <laughs> the last one. I could try the last one. Oops. Where did it go? There's also one... This one also we gotta watch at some point. Maybe we could watch a couple. Let's watch... How long are these? Let's do like... We could do a couple. Do I feel bad? If, this one's been sitting here for a little while. Oh my... This is... We've already got wolves and stuff. We got wolves and stuff. Yes, the Kool-Aid. Uh-oh. We, we need to watch multiples. <laughs> Wolf inside me. A woo. Wait, this one's unlisted. This one is unlisted. Okay, we're getting secret insider knowledge. This one's nine minutes. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> I might have to... Well, maybe we'll speed this one up just a little bit. <laughs> the wolf? What is it transforming into another wolf? Wait, it's a wolf transforming into another wolf. Okay. <laughs> okay. Zelda. We'll see if this one's just a bunch of them walking around with nothing. I might, we might, I don't know. We'll see. There's no dialogue or anything. I personally am not very familiar with the. Okay, <laughs> they're just they're just arguing. I don't know what's happening. I'm not familiar with the Zelders personally. <laughs> also, I might skip around a little. Uh, dramatic music. Oh. They're in the they're in the thing. <laughs> that guy's Zelda, I'm sure. Yeah. <laughs> this guy, he that's the Zelda, the main character. Ganon. Uh 
Are they gonna do it? Are they gonna get it on? It looks like they were gonna get it on. <laughs> they're just they're just they're just chaos at oh Yeah, I think this is just like This music. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> I think I'm gonna we're gonna check out another one. No offense to the folks. I don't understand what's going on. Oops, my screen's been exposed again. <laughs> I'm gonna do little eyeballs just to remind us that we did check her out. Um, let's see. How about we try the Kool-Aid one? Because we did we did this one was also older. And then we'll do also do the other one. You thought that the Zelda machine was peak filmmaking as a kid. I just don't. I'm not a. I've never played the Zelders. Oops, I just clicked the wrong button here. <laughs> I guess I didn't quite. I love dialogue. I like a story. You know? Okay. Tragic love. Also, let me just see. 11 years ago, 2013, I made this video for a collab I just joined. Okay. This one's only three minutes long. I think I do still have it sped up a little, though. No, it's normal playback. Let's see. We'll see. I remember this one's kind of slow. Okay. Might speed it up. Sometimes they're funny sped up, too. Okay. Is this one also going to have dialogue, or is it just going to be another music one? Okay, we might speed her up. Okay, she's aged up. Okay. <laughs> the, the edible kicked in. Here we go. Double speed. Not double speed. It's 1.5. Oh, why, why does his eyes and face look like... He's like realistic. It was like a little bit uncanny valley. Okay, still slow. <laughs> How is this two speed? This is two speed. <laughs> did I click? Did I just click it right? It is. It's two speed. <laughs> it looks normal. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> oh, she fell. <laughs> <laughs> what? She fell and he goes, Oh yeah. And then jumps on her. <laughs> so I looked at his face with you. There was like an uncanny valley that happened. It was like the detail of his of his custom content on his face. What is this? Is this supposed to be them younger and they're older or so? Does he die? Is this the like an alternate? Oh, she just hit me. <laughs> she got hit by the exterminator. That's so funny. Wait, no, we gotta <laughs> wait. Now we gotta watch that one speed, just that moment. Look, it's all in this is one speed. <laughs> Exterminator doing his job. That's so funny. She did. With all her Kool-Aid. Okay, so he's... He's kissing her in the afterlife by playing her a song or something that reminds him of her or something. And he's teleported into... That's why she grew up at the beginning. <laughs> The piano is a paid actor. Oh, now she's gone. Quarshed like a mean girl. Okay. okay. That was, well, you know, look at their picture. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. Anyway. Let's do... Let's, okay. That was fun. That was a fun little one. Eyeballs. 
And then we gotta go to a more recent one. Where's this? That's not it. Is that it? No. Did I miss? I thought it was right in here somewhere. No, it must be up higher. That's the Van Buffy. Is it? It must. Oops. I think I'm going too fast. Here we, no. Sims 2. Is it the Academy? Was it the Acad? No, it was the last one. Here's the last one. Here we go. Yeah, we could look at the comments. Sometimes the comments are lacking. <laughs> Sometimes the comments. Okay, this one. So this is the Sims 2 Machinima Lost Preview. Okay, okay, okay. Why is my thing? There we go. When you go on vacation, you ready, honey? You look a bit worried. Have you ever been afraid of a crash? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just having a little, a silly, what? Hold on, bag it up here. Yeah, I'm fine. Just having a silly fright about the trip here. Not a silly fright. You ever have a silly fright? You know I hate plane rides. Don't worry, Emma. Of course her name is Emma. <laughs> Don't worry, Emma. This will be great. No offense to the Emmas. It's just like, you know, <laughs> just a silly fear, right? Bye, house. <laughs> Bye, house. Or is it? <laughs> the sound of the crashing? I'm sorry. Do I have it fast forward? It's still no, it's still normal. <laughs> the crashing. <laughs> okay. Uh is he dead? Stranded. Confused. <laughs> Looking out at the waters. Wait, do you think that that's the castaways? They're using the, the that, that's what you're, you just literally said the same thing, Kobe, because that's the water for, for the castaways is the only game that has that shiny water unless you have mods. I didn't see what year this was made. I don't know that they'd have that looks like either they're playing. That seems like they're just playing the castaways game. Maybe. To get this these shots. Is this is this our first confirmed machinima from the Castaway stories? Okay. Looking for someone. Emma. Yeah, this looks like it. <laughs> the stars. So they'd have like two castaway saves. Who doesn't remember who they are? Oh my god, this music's gonna be like a headache. Where am I? Who am I? <laughs> what? Not who am I? What do you mean, who am I, ma'am? <laughs> Dang, Emma, who punched you on the way down? I know. Will we see the orangutan? <laughs> I can't remember the name of. Hello, Bogwater. I'll, we're just watching a little machinimas before we're done here. <laughs> I hope it's not a seven hour stream. Who am I? Who encountered upon me? <laughs> Lost. The fireball didn't kill me. You know, that's a, that's a good start. Who said, who, who doesn't remember who they are? Oh no, oh that creepy face. This is awesome, this should be a movie. Looks really dramatic and interesting. <laughs> interesting. So what was this again? It was 2010. 2010. Thank you very much for the follow. Thank you, thank you. We wanna, that one was another short one. <laughs> we can do the little eyeballs on her. Do the little eyeballs on her. Yeah, welcome back to the living, Bog. Do you have any other short ones we want to watch? I'm in the mood to watch them. We're just kind of jumping around here. <laughs> the Boy in the Shadows. This one's 14 minutes. We'll wait on that one, I think. I don't really want to do this one. We watched this one before. This one was the Sims, the music video. 
I don't know. Maybe we'll wait. Maybe we'll, we'll save some for a future, a future adventure. Maybe we will wait. We watched a few today. Today, because <laughs> we watched one when we were reloading the video game, and all of that fun stuff. Okay. Okay. Uh, thank you for hanging out. Um. Yeah. So, I'm not gonna be on this Thursday, unfortunately. Um. But I'll be back on Saturday. I'll try and figure out something with the art stuff that we're talking about for Saturday, maybe. We'll see how it goes. Time for me to play with Goose. I promised we were done. I would go play. Okay. <laughs> go play with Goose. Go play with Goose. Uh, uh, but yeah, thank you very much for hanging out. Hope you have a good rest of your week. Um, I'll see you on the weekend. Uh, do I have music still? Music for playing? Yeah, there we go. Okay. All right. Thank you very much. I will see you next time.